what's up guys? Hell yeah! That Resi 4 intro vibes! <laughs> what is going on guys? I hope you're all well and hyped for some Resident Evil 4 original tonight! Hell yeah! I just wanted to rave, I just wanted to rave coming on screen! <laughs> An absolute vibe! An absolute vibe! All right, let's 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 take it down a notch. Let's take it down a notch a little to our merchant theme. The Serenity theme. <laughs> We've got to save the energy for the stream, bro. I hope we're all well, guys. Thank you for you um, you guys who are already here tonight. But halfway, Gamer Dude, what's up? We've got Ken Kenny. Uh, we got Roderick Fields, Man Cave, and Mr. Frog. Yeah, what's up, you guys? Who's hyped for the remake and who has played the demo? We'll definitely go into, um, you know, discussion and our thoughts onto the remake, um, you know, once we're uh, diving into the game. It'll be absolutely awesome. So it's been about almost a year since we uh, since we streamed uh, this game. So it is obviously the original RE4 with a HD project and it's a fan-made project. It's real good. I've like knocked a million things over on my desk because the, the, the sleeves on this, they're really uh, thick. So basically, guys, we've kind of been had a little bit, right? I've been looking for a nice... Um, a decent, reasonable replica of um, Leon's jacket, uh, but th this it, it, it ain't good. It's like a wish special. Uh, thank you, Neil. I appreciate that. Neil May said uh, I said this to you on Facebook earlier, but that jacket is fire, bro. It it's so bad. It's so bad in real life. It's bright orange. It's so bad. Like I will show you guys. Right, I'll show you the listing on how it looks. Right, it is absolutely. This is what should have. Um, turned up basically it was on amazon right should have been like that not as orange not like this not like this right and then yeah obviously it turns up and it is very orange um i made a good meme out of it though um you versus the dude she said not to worry about <laughs> yeah basically uh the thumbnail is in fact a lie uh, it's a photoshop special photoshop at its finest so obviously i had to edit this um on photoshop there's no way um, I could have had that, like, all orangey. Uh, what's up, Neil Macy? Thank you for subscribing, man. I appreciate it. Bobby Kendo's out tonight. He said, I'm sorry about that. He's sorry about that, babe. <laughs> but, yeah, basically, um, I'm just kind of going to blag this and, and just wear it for this stream. But this is the one I have chosen. I'll actually get this up on the screen because um, I've got a web page up. Let's uh, get a little cheeky window capture. So if we get that, um, and it will be... It is on this website. Let me just um, let me just shrink this down a little. It's a bit a bit cray cray. But yeah, there's, there's a couple of really nice uh, Leon replica jackets on here. Uh, what's up, with Kevin Wolfen as well in the chat? What's up, Kev? I hope you're all good, man. This makes it a bit bigger for when we um, view them. That's it. So what I'm looking at. Um, let's put this behind me a second. There we go. So there is, that looks pretty cool. Obviously that the dark kind of fur, however it is black though. Um, that looks decent. Um, however, I, I mean, I have seen a lot of replicas like this one. I hope you guys can see it all right. Yeah, that's cool. Um, but still, I don't think Leon has the fur on the pockets if, um, if I remember correctly. However, it's not a bad piece. It should be um, 180 pounds. It's down to 140. I know these are very pricey, guys, but it's like, wh what do you do, man? It like you can order them off Wish, but you know they're, they're pretty bad. Like, you know, I want it to look decent to some extent. Now this one should be 200 pounds, and it's 140. Um, and I've actually placed an order on this, um, so I've gone for an extra small. I, I measured myself up. Hopefully it should be okay, because obviously these are men's sizes. Uh, but I think that looks absolutely badass. So shout out to um, best mate Alex. He actually linked me to this a while ago. I was just a bit hesitant in paying a lot of money. Um, you know, obviously it's, it is difficult. Um, but I do think it's the best option, for sure. Uh, if I show you guys... Um, is it these? It's the Shop NYC uh, Leon jacket. So there is an official one, right? Um, where is it? It's on here. And it's like around a thousand pounds, um, or around like fourteen to fifteen hundred dollars. Have a look, is it on the 
P3 bomber jacket. That's that's usually the style. So it's actually it's that one. There we go. That that's women. That's a women's version. But no, it's definitely it's that one. Um, that's literally what um, Leon's jacket in the remake. That is literally what it is a copy of. Um, but as you can see, fifteen hundred US dollars. I ain't that rich. But um, it it is real nice though. That is an an absolute uh, dream to own that at some point. What what do you guys think to that? I think that, that looks so cool. It's definitely on a bucket list, you know. I could pull it off, um, you know, obviously if uh, I could do like the pay monthly option or something like that, but um, it is uh, it is a hell of a lot. It's a hell of a lot, man, but um, it is good though. It looks a bit rather more goldish in this. It looks very lighter in these pictures. It could be the lighting, but, but yeah, this is known as the official um, Leon jacket in the RE4 remake. It's the... Um, I think it's pronounced shot or Scott shot NYC. Yeah, it's a real beautiful jacket. It's real nice. Um, but yeah, it is it is cool, man. Yeah, it's it's not bad. This it will do for tonight's stream. Um, but yeah, it's uh, <laughs> it looks even more orangey. I've kind of lessened, uh, you know, how bad it is uh, with my light, and it doesn't actually look as bad, to be honest. I'm actually buzzing. I can actually wear it. Right, I'll wait, if I wear it for this stream, I don't have to put the heating on. <laughs> so, <laughs> silver lining and all that. Um, yes, Neil, I do play on PS5. If any of you guys want to add me on um, PlayStation or Xbox, my, my gamer tag is just Holster TV. You can totally feel free. I'll be your mate on that uh, anytime, guys. Um, yeah, Kevin said, I uh, played the demo on Steam, 4K maxed out with ray tracing, and it's so epic. Cannot wait to play in VR. Hell yeah, Kev. Yeah, ray tracing makes like... It does make that extra difference, right? Um, I know that there, there is a ray tracing mod for OGRE4. However, um, it is a little complex to sort out. This one is the HD project. Um, it's a fan-made one and they literally, it took them eight years in total on this uh, whole project. They literally built it like kind of from the ground up. They just um, upscaled all the textures. It looks beautiful, uh, but you can do reshade and ray tracing on this. So I will set it up, um, you know, at some point in future. Uh, but yeah, the HD project still looks real nice though. Uh, absolutely, Mr. Frog. Always, man, always on the go, man. Work hard, play hard, Holster. You you know us, man. We always at 100 mile an hour. What's up, Rach? Said hello there, stranger. Man, it has been a while. I hope you're all well. Hope uh, you're doing good, man. Thanks for dropping in. Yeah, man, I've just uh, been on the tubes over a year now on, on live streams anyway. No, it's cool to see people drop in. I actually shared this stream. I don't usually share it on my personal Facebook. Obviously, I have my Holster TV page, but big streams like this, like if it's a, a big resi stream, I will share it on my personal. So, um, you know, hopefully more uh, people will drop in because uh, I know it, it's real popular. I uh, just want to give a massive shout out, by the way. Let me just, um, sorry guys, I'm a little unorganized. The, the only thing I was organized with was um, <laughs> was, the, was my entrance, but um, let me just get Etsy up because um, there is a really awesome store called Raccoon City Surplus. Just want to give a massive shout out to this store. Let's have a look. Do any of you guys shop on um, Etsy, by the way, for Resident Evil stuff? I'm always searching. I'm forever searching it. Oh, bro, I need the... Um... <laughs> I'm trying to find the actual store. Bro. Just bear with me a second. I will get it. I will get it. If I just search Resident Evil. Oh, bro, where's it? There we go. Found him. Found him. It's not that easy to, to bring him up on Etsy. Uh, let, me, let me click on his store. Oh man, you know, I think this is the first time I've actually navigated Etsy on a PC. I'm always on them. Um, yeah, always on my phone. Um, okay, let me just... Oh, I've actually clicked on the game. Go back a sec. Right, let me just set up another cheeky window capture. There we go, there we go. Right, I know I'm, I'm kind of in the way a little bit. But we good, we good. Um, so, yeah, this is Raccoon City Surplus. 
Um, so Mark is the guy behind uh, these custom figures that he makes, Resident Evil, right? I just want to give a massive shout out to him because he actually very kindly sent me uh, one of his models. So it is a typewriter, first aid spray, ink ribbon and keys, and obviously the obligatory uh, gore, Resident Evil gore splat of blood. Yeah, so it's, it's really awesome. It comes on a, a real nice stand and uh, I've actually, uh, obviously, apart from bringing this up here to uh, show on stream, um, it is proudly on display next to my stars team members picture on uh, my coffee table so yeah it really is awesome if you guys can like see that it is real detailed as well like on the first aid spray label uh, each of the keys and stuff really nice so yeah I just proper wanted to um, shout out Mark and his um, Etsy store Raccoon City Surplus thank you so much for that um, but as you can see obviously the typewriter is there he makes um, a huge variety um, of Resident Evil figures, obviously you've got the Cerberus zombie dogs, uh, some herbs, so obviously the, there's like the collectibles, you know, consumables, as well as the main characters, um, some of these that are stand out for me, I really like the Marvin one by the way, I love the, the whole turned Marvin one, I think he looks awesome, he, he's done a real awesome job, and I like how his trousers are baggy as well, because actually, um, I mean, you see more of a full body shot of him in the RE3 remake, obviously, when you see the, um, you know, how Brad got infected. Um, no, not how Brad, how he got infected. Sorry, I get, I get confused. Obviously, you see how Marvin got infected. Um, but yeah, it really is cool, man. Um, I can't remember if his, if his trousers are baggy in that, but um, yeah, I just thought it was a really cool look. So I really like the Marvin. Uh, I know that he is going to release uh, a Krauser figure. I don't know if that's up just yet. I know he's working on them. Um, I think Mikhail as well from RE3. That, that's another standout for me. I think that's really um, real nice and detailed. I think he's captured him real good there. Especially the wound as well, man. So definitely when I've got some, you know, some some, uh, some spare cash, stranger. Um, you know, for some more Resident Evil, um, you know, bits for the collection. Definitely head over. To Raccoon City Surplus. The quality is there, man. Uh, like I say, there's a massive, massive, uh, you know, variety of uh, Resident Evil stuff. Especially uh, that Mr. X looks cool. X go and give it to you. It looks real cool, man. So, yeah, I just want to um, say thank you again uh, to Mark at Raccoon City Surplus. It's uh, very kind and appreciated that, man. Uh, what's up, Dano? Thanks for stopping in, man. He said, looking like Tom Cruise. <laughs> I'm a shite maverick. There's no way, man. You've been real generous to me there, Dano. <laughs> um, mate, it, honestly, it's really bad. It is um, it's a really bad um, replica. Because like I say, I've, I've, I just said at the start of the stream, we've kind of been had because it should have been uh, it should have been different, basically. So I am actually going to, I'm planning on like return this and uh, I'm buying a more premium Leon jacket for sure. It's on a website called Hawk and Bull. We've just uh, we've just been on that, um, but yeah, that's that's the best kind of replica I've seen so far. I've got one of those on order, so it will be here very soon. So as long as I've got it in time for the remake streams, I'm good with that. Uh, Swell and Bunyan, what's up, man? He said any news on Starfield? So I think it's coming out. Um, I think it's like later this year. Um, I can't remember what month it was. Um, I don't want to say because I totally can't remember what month it was, but I know that there has been a delay. I'm sure there's going to be more revealed. I don't know if it's about around June, July time. I can't remember when it was, but there is going to be more footage and uh, reveal of the game um, coming up in, in the you know recent months. Um, but yeah, um, I'm glad you... Oh, good, Rachel. Yeah, I'm doing all good. Thank you, man. Um, yeah, definitely. Uh, just drop us a message, man. We'll get a catch-up sorted for sure. <laughs> Got you up on the TV. That's awesome. What's up, Derek? Damn, Daniel. Um, th thank you. He said that jacket. And he, I've got the fire emojis, got the hands up. Hell yeah. Thank you, man. Um, you know what? Honestly, it, it's a terrible jacket. Like, it, it looks even more orange in person, but it's just cut, thanks to my lighting, it just doesn't look as bad. But I kind of wasn't really happy about wearing it tonight, but I was like, I kind of have to. You know, I've, I've got a Leon ish jacket, even if I do look like I'm straight out of Wish, you know. Um, and yeah, I don't have to put the heating on then. So, <laughs> uh, no worries at all, um, Man Cave. Yeah, he said shout out to the sick lineup for Insomnia Gaming Event this year. Yeah, so um, there's actually four Resident Evil voice actors at Insomnia this year. Um, so, there is, um, let me just show you guys. I'll just uh, 
just show you then we will get into um we'll get into the game in just a second so it's on the main site and they're actually just slowly uh, announcing them one by one but um at first there was just meant to be um stephanie panicello who's the voice actress for um for claire redfield on the resident evil 2 remake so let me just get this uh, let me just get this screen back up again there we go so we got um stephanie panicello um and then there's actually there's a, a, a dude who uh, voiced the witcher as well um i've not actually played that game but i know a lot of you would appreciate that nicole tonkins um, who voices Jill Valentine in RE3 Remake and also in Deliverance Mars. She is there. Maggie Robertson, who voices Lady Dimitrescu in Village. And also Nick Apostolides, who um, voices uh, Leon in um, Resident Evil 2 Remake. So, yeah, at first there was initially only um, Stephanie announced, but to have four Resident Evil voice actors. So this is a UK event based in Birmingham at the NEC Arena. Um, so it runs from the 7th to the 10th of April. I will be there from the 7th till the 9th. I've luckily been able to get the time off work. It fell smack bang into all my shifts and I was really stressed. And um, I just really stressed to my bosses at work, please, like, I really need this time off. Um, so yeah, I will be meeting up with Andy from Biohazard Declassified and Residents of Evil and a lot of other Resident Evil content creators and we will be obviously exploring the event, enjoying some game, we'll be going out on the night times and obviously meeting these four legendary voice actors. So to, to not even only get one but four Resident Evil voice actors, it genuinely is a dream come true for me and I'll be able to obviously take my copies of Resident Evil 2 and 3 Remake and village and get them signed by these four and obviously have them um, have pictures with them so um i'm absolutely stoked for insomnia um if you guys could get yourselves down there i would obviously absolutely recommend it i've actually not been um actually uh not been uh to insomnia before so i'll be uh really happy to uh to uh be attending this event this year but yeah that is insomnia for this year exciting times man i know man caves going guys if any of you are going please do let me know um yeah definitely rach uh, a food parcel would be good man <laughs> just send me, send me loads of iron brew and you got like a in the like a really strong iron brew in the like a triple x iron brew or something i've got some scottish people um who are, who are regular in the streams if we get craig in the stream he'll, he'll be able to tell us um, but yeah um yes neil i do play on ps5 um I think I, I said that earlier. Um, not playing tonight, though. We are playing this um, on the PC. Um, obviously, it's got HD Project, uh, the fan-made uh, mod on this. Um, yes, there is actually... Um, I missed that in the demo. I, I believe... I don't know if you had to climb down a well or something. I don't know if there's an, an underground part in the demo. It's pretty easily missed. I mean, I, I played for it twice. I've only just seen, obviously, people are saying you can now get the TMP in the Resident Evil 4 demo, so the, the remake demo. So, uh, yeah, that, that is incredible. I didn't, I didn't know about that. And apparently it's actually real powerful as well uh, from the footage I've seen, you know. Um, and, yes, I, th I think so, Dano. I'm literally almost certain that Nick Apostolides, who voiced Leon in RE2 Remake, is also voiced Leon in, in 4 Remake. I believe so. Falcon Scott, what's up, man? I'm doing all good, thank you. I hope you're well too, man. Um, hope you guys are all good. I'll just get us all ready to go and into the game. Uh, thank you for all you guys who've turned up tonight. You're absolute legends, honestly. So kind of you guys to turn up tonight. If you don't mind, if you're enjoying the stream, if you could just drop us a cheeky like. It helps us do well in the YouTube algorithm. But yeah, it's, it's so awesome as well uh, to be able to stream, um, obviously, on a Saturday evening. Uh, some weekends I'm obviously uh, working stuff. It's so good, so good to be free and be able to stream at peak time. Uh, with everyone so yeah let's jump into resident evil 4 the original with the hd project hell yeah guys there we go this is the guy i've hello stranger what's up craig canavan this is our guy from scotland um rachel in the chat uh just above you craig is also from scotland um i was just saying isn't they like a um she's about sending me a food parcel of uh, things that i may miss from uh from up there um and uh what was i gonna say in the like a strong like in the like a strong iron brew or something so it's like an iron brew triple x or something like that or is it just extra iron brew it's like more it's like not as dilute or something i'm sure we've been on about it before craig i'm sure oh so kind rage you still remember me shipping you those peanut butter oreos hell yeah yeah 
<laughs> I, I know you uh, you mentioned them, didn't you? So I totally uh, had to hook you up there. Um, let me just make sure we got the sound on and everything. There we go. Let me just crank it down a little bit because I have to crank it right up for um for for the cheeky intro. Right, I think the sound should be um the sound should be all good. Just give me a shout if obviously um I need to tweak the sound. But yeah, should be. Yeah, it should be all good. Oh man, so exciting. So exciting. It's always good jumping back into RE4. Thank you for clearing that up, Craig. There you go. There you go, man. It's extra. It's no sugar, better taste. I still need to try that one, Craig. Have you tried that one, Rachel? <laughs> yeah, that's awesome, man. Right, let's go. I, I ain't I ain't doing professional just yet. If we have time before the remake, we will jump into a professional, but we're just going to be chilling on normal right now. Oh, man, it hits. Oh, I've got the G Fuel as well. I've got Sour Demon Aid tonight. Whoa, whoa, hang on. Special one, special two, and normal. Let me take a look. Let me take a look what these are. Resident Evil 4 special costumes. Oh, nice. Okay, okay. I'm just thinking. I don't know whether to switch to those, though, because I don't know if they're going to... Surely they won't crash them, right? They won't crash the uh, the thing, will they? Right, so there is Leon in his RPD costume. Okay. Right, so we've got special one, special two. So we've got Leon in the RPD. And then Ashley's in... It's just got a special one outfit. She looks like... Uh, she reminds me like she's going to belt out that... Uh, By the heart, city you remember Dancing in September She reminds me of that. Like she's going to belt out September. <laughs> and then she's actually Ashley's got a night uh, costume in this and Leon's got his noir costume um, I, yeah, I really don't want to be like crashing the, the, the stream with the HD mod we will just go obviously normal because uh, yeah I, I need to look like uh, like Leon Elvago says normal as well we got to look like him in the jacket I'll never forget it it was the year when those grisly murders occurred in the Yarklane Mountains soon after the news was out to the whole world, revealing that it was the fault of a secret viral experiment conducted by the international pharmaceutical enterprise, Umbrella. The virus broke out in a nearby mountain community, Raccoon City, and hit the peaceful little town with a devastating blow crippling its very foundation. Not taking any chances, the President of the United States ordered a contingency plan to sterilize Raccoon City. With the whole affair gone public, the United States government issued an indefinite suspension of business decree to Umbrella. Soon its stock prices crashed, and for all intents and purposes, Umbrella was finished. Six years have passed since that horrendous incident. Come on. Wait for the drop. I received special training via a secret organization working under the direct control of the president. I was to assume the responsibility of protecting the new president's family. Cool. Why am I the one who always gets the short end of the stick? Yo. That's a local's way of breaking the ice. Anyway, you know what this is all about. My assignment is to search for the president's missing daughter. What? All by yourself? <laughs> I'm sure you boys didn't just tag along so we could sing Kumbaya together at some Boy Scout bonfire. Then again, maybe you did. <laughs> oh, you crazy American. It's a direct order from the chief himself. I tell you, it's no big name. Counting on you guys. Oh man, that intro music hits. Da, 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 da. So good. <laughs> right, it's all serious now. Is we are down to business now. It was 
right before I was to take on my duties of protecting the president's daughter when she was abducted. That's the ultimate reason I'm in this lonely and rural part of Europe. According to our intelligence, there's reliable information about a sighting of a girl that looks very similar to the president's daughter. Apparently, she's being withheld by some unidentified group of people. Who would have thought that my first job would have been a rescue mission? <sighs> it's freezing. So cold all of a sudden. Must be my imagination. <laughs> Sorry it took so long. We almost there. It's in our hands in, in a second. Thank you to all you guys who have uh, been dropping in. I'll shout you out in just a second. Up ahead is the village. I'll go and have a look around. I will stay and watch that car. Don't want to get any parking tickets. Right. Parking tickets. Good luck. Jeez. Who are these guys? Did you say something? <laughs> There's our boo. Let's go. I'll be your support on this mission. Booty call. Loud and clear. Somehow I thought you'd be a little older. <laughs> so the subject's name's Ashley Graham, right? That's right. She's the daughter of the president. So try to behave yourself, okay? <laughs> Whoever this group is, they sure picked the wrong girl to kidnap. I'll try to find some more information on my end as well. Good. Talk to you later. Leon out. Leon out. Nice. Here we are, guys. It is in our hands now. Did you um by the way did, did you turn behind uh you know look behind you in the in the uh the remake demo cuz obviously you you saw the police your car um in the demo What's the matter? Did you lose your nerve? <laughs> uh, so, yes, yeah, so Falcon Scott I'm getting uh Ari 4 remake um on my Xbox. Right, we're going to get our shots in early guys. It's uh What's going on? Hang on. There we go. Sorry, guys. The controls are different, you know. You, you know, obviously on the, on the remake and, uh, yeah. It's been a while since I played this. A steady shot. These crows ain't loyal. Let's get them for them sweet Pasidas. We're going to be balling. Then I'll be able to get a better jacket than this one. That's straight out of wish. <laughs> but, yeah, um... What's up, Baron Grod? Thank you for stopping in. We've got Lorna as well. What's up, Lorna? How you doing? I hope everything's going well for you. It's been a while. It's been a while, girl. Are you still gaming, by the way? Me and Lorna. Me and Lorna, we go, go way back, man. Because uh, you guys in the UK, you know the store game. Um, yeah, me, me and Lorna used to work there. Um, I, I worked there for a few like consecutive years um, as a Christmas temp. And I uh, met some awesome people. Lorna definitely being one of them. That that is that is a tease, seriously, I trekked for that box. What's up, Lee? Thanks for stopping in, man. He said awesome coat, mate. Honestly, it's ridiculous. It is bright orange. It's literally like they soaked the fur in sunny day. They took the piss with her. So like, we've absolutely had our pants down. Um, but no, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna actually return it after after this stream. And um, I've um I've I've got a better one on order. I've got a more premium one on order. Excuse me, sir. This first encounter is good, man. It is good. It's all about the first encounter on Resi Games. We'll talk about that in a sec. I was wondering if you might recognize a girl in this photograph. What the hell are you doing here? Get out of here! 
Sorry to have bothered you. Freeze. Don't make me do it. Freeze. We've been streaming for two minutes. Don't get hostile already. Bro. Let's go. <laughs> They're like, we out of here. <laughs> we gotta bounce. Right, they're going, they're going. I ain't finished with this guy. I think he needs- I still need, still need a few stabby stabs. Shit. Booty call. I love Honigan. Is everything okay? There was a hostile local. I had no choice but to neutralize him. There are still others surrounding the area. Get out of there and head toward the village. Take whatever measures necessary to save the subject. Understood. Uh oh. Understood. Holster TV out. I thought we still, um. He's not a zombie. Yeah, I thought we could, uh. Right. I might, I might like it. Yeah, and if he's fully dead. Let's grab these a sec. Hell yeah. We're out of here. Oh! Bro, you, you're giving us no chill tonight. No chill. But you hold that up at me. Get away from him with the rake as well. Guys, are you a are you a headshot or a knee kind of kind of person? Cause uh I was going for headshots a lot in the remake demo and people you know, a couple of people were like, go for the knees. Do you guys like to aim for the headshot and then do the swing kick, or do you like to get him down on the knees and then just, just smash him? Yeah, I always go for the headshots, but the, you know, shooting the knees, oh well, god, still effective. You had the dog. Let's go save the doggo. We're gonna save the doggo. So there's been a lot said, right, about the doggo in the remake. Apparently. It doesn't live, but I've heard from sources that it does, in fact, live, apparently. Oh, thanks, Lorna, bless you. You was the best, too. Like, our crew was absolute, the absolute OGs. Man, it was so good. Um, yeah, apologies, guys. I, I might keep accidentally pulling out the, the knife. It's because the, the controls are different. There we go. Get them procedures. Got to spend it with the merchant later. Yeah, like I said to Lorna, you still game. She said, uh, it was on Genshin Impact. Nice, I've heard of those, but I think it would be... I'm just trying to find the doggo. I think it's up a little further. Um, I think that would be a little too too advanced for me, that man. I'm not um, I'm not actually that gifted on RPGs. It's like a warning of some sort. I have a bad feeling about this. It does look real nice, don't you think, guys? This HD project. This was a fan-made project, literally from the ground up, upscaling all the textures, making this HD. And it actually took um, uh, some fans like eight years. Oh, that's incredible you're living with Steph. I hope you're both well. That's awesome. Fucking two epic roommates. <laughs> I'm just living with me. I'd, honestly, I'd, I'll tell you guys, it, it is... Um, I'm sorry, someone's going to come down here. Yeah. If he's coming down, you can uh, you can trigger these. Hopefully. Unless he's smart. I don't know if he's going to be smart. He is. He's smart. It's fine. Yeah, honestly, guys, I'm not even kidding. I, I get really sad when I end my streams. Like, because uh, I just love hanging out with you guys. And, uh, yeah, at some point, I do have to end the streams because I, I get too hangry. Right? That's my only reason, honestly, for ending the streams. Otherwise, I'd stream the whole time I'm home. Um, yeah, I get really sad after I've ended streams. And I'm, I feel so alone and isolated. Like, honestly, it's, that post-stream isolation is horrible. I'm alright after a bit, though. It's fine. It's, no, it's nothing, like, major. But it's, it's just, like, I miss you guys. <laughs> you know? Where are they? I ain't been ambushed in this cabin. Let's, uh, let's grab this. Yeah, so we've got no chance because uh, <laughs> there's sex discrimination here. So we've got no chance. I, I ain't being. 
Bro, I, I ain't being impaled. Not with this jacket. I made the effort to dress up tonight. You guys, you, you ain't ruining it for me. Oh. I think he just dodged that. Oh. Early. Where's the guy? Where's the guy? I can't see him. I can't, I can't see the bodies amongst all this. Alright, that, I think that's him gone. Where's the other bro? Let's, let's get him in the knee. Try a knee. Straight down. Apologies if I missed some of you guys' um, messages. Um, got Simon says, Hi, what's up, Simon? And hell yeah, Lorna. Disc care crew for life. You know, you know um, I don't know if it's still a thing. Game did disc care for a while, yeah? So it's like. Um, so you can pay a pound, right? You pay a quid. And it covers your disc for like, I think it's like a full year. And then if you, if there's any damage to it, like where it won't play anymore or anything like that, they'll um, run it through the disc cleaner and um, like repair it. If not, they'll replace the disc. And yeah, so we, we proper, we were the disc care divas, right? Do you remember that, Lana? We proper sold it, man. We smashed it. Didn't, didn't that even feature us like on a post or something like out of all the regional game stores, something like that, or the national ones or something? Absolutely smashed it, man. Uh, what's up, James? Thank you for stopping him. I'll get to your comment in just a sec, man. Leon, how you holding up? Bad question, honey. Sorry to hear that. I'm sending you a playing manual. Hope you find it useful. I'll take a look at it. Thanks. Bitch, we've been playing this game since 2005. Since it came out. Jeez. Um, yes, James, I did see that um, you can unlock the TMP. Well, you can find it, right? You can find it in the um, in the demo. I've not actually found it myself, though, but I, I definitely need to go back and uh, try that out because it actually looks real powerful from uh, what I've seen. Oh, God, you're, you're both not too far away, Lorna. That's cool. You're in Lincoln. You know, I used to love Lincoln for a day out. Anyone who, who might know Lincoln, there's a really awesome store called Gotham Games. Real good uh, retro game store, but they, they shut down like the other year. So I think the guy just went on to new stuff. This part's awesome in the remake, by the way. This is like literally the main part of the demo. And um, graphically, it looks incredible. But yeah, they've done a decent job on this, though, to make it look uh, make it look impressive. So one of our Policia guys. Yeah, you're a headshot gal, Lorna. And Roderick said, uh, I only go for a headshot. Yeah, knee shots are also good, very important. Yeah, definitely. Definitely gives us that advantage. I'll tell you what um, what startled me, right? I posted a clip on like all my socials. You know the cow? On my second playthrough of the demo. I was streaming still. The fucking cow. It escaped, man. Oh, no, we've been spotted. Oh, man, I wanted to be all sneaky and go around here. We might be okay. I feel real paranoid. The music's intensified, but I didn't think I, we got spotted. Uh, yeah, the, the cow was just fucking running riot, on fire. And uh, I was spraying my shotgun at the crowd. And uh, yeah, I kind of killed the cow and I was really sad. And Andy put up a real funny post on Twitter. He literally retweeted my, uh, oh shit, I forgot about that guy. I don't think he's in the remake. Hell yeah. Let's get some booty knives in there. Slice that booty up. Oh, oh, no. They're on to us, man. Hey, what's up, Lara? Thank you for joining, by the way. Sorry I've only just got round to your comment. I know you said you was glad that you uh, got to the stream in time. Thank you. Thank you for being here, Lara. Let's get his hat off. Get his hat off. This, this situation, though... Oh, bollocks! <laughs> um, it is way more... Shit. Oh. It is, honestly, it's way more intense in the remake, in the demo. It really is. Bro, stop pulling those axes out your booty. I can, I can hear someone breathing down my neck. I absolutely can. Oh, that was a bad time. That was a bad time. Oh! Don't you dare mutate. Don't you dare... Oh. oh 
so vicious. Right, we need to... We'll go get a shotgun in a sec. Just being conscious of our ammo. We good, we good. It's, it's real intense, this part. It, it really keeps you on your toes, man. Nice. Let's go. Yeah, definitely, Lana. Thank you for that. Um, I always actually um, have streams on in the background. I have other people's streams on. Uh, I, it is actually kind of like company sort of thing. Honestly, I'm, I cope fine living on my own. But um, it's just the whole... Oh, shit. It's just the whole initial, um, you know, coming off stream. Because you, you've got... You know, it's literally like hanging out with loads of my mates, you know. You've literally got everyone and then, like, you've kind of got no one. You're like, oh, it's, it's so horrible. So horrible, man. Right, let's sort this out. Let's get the... Uh, we're going to save the grenades. going to save that for the uh, chainsaw guy. I absolutely love the uh, whole attaché case thing, man. I'm so glad they've kept it in the remake. Oh, we, we're cornered. We're cornered. Right, this is bad. This is bad. It's been time, man. Been time since, uh, obviously, we played the original. Booty knives. Right, we, we need to be... Uh, need to be getting that shotgun. Chainsaw guy be coming. I think it's just in the next house along. Yeah, for sure, Craig. Um, I mean, the Discord's real good. I, I do appreciate, um, you know, being in the Discord with you guys. Let's go. Let's board up these windows. <laughs> Lorna, I'm just seeing all you laughing in, in the chat. Bloody hell, that disc cleaner. Honestly, we had the speech down to a T. <laughs> it's so funny. Literally reeled it off. We killed it. Like, the boys were okay, man. But they, they were just behind us. They were just behind us with that. God, we, we smashed it, man. It was too good. <laughs> there we go. Hey, yo. Shotgun time. Oh. I've said the uh, said the chainsaw. Hell no. Nah. Hell no. Nah. We ain't getting trapped in here. We need a nice open area. Okay. Wait the chainsaw guy. Right. Don't kill the cow. Oh, the cow's... Is, is there? The cow's still there. The cow's still gone. Fuck. Oh, my God. <laughs> I do panic a little. I do panic. Right, let's go. Oh! Oh man, I feel cheap. We didn't even get a chance for the guy. <laughs> it's bingo time. Holy shit. Mecha bingo called. They want the Ganados back. Lord Sadler. Holy shit. I can't believe we didn't even get a chance to take the guy out. Oh, I feel cheated out of them Pesitas. Say the line. Say it. Where's everyone going? Bingo? The absolute classic line. Bro, I can't believe we held that out. And it was... I've got bad news. I confirmed the body of an officer. Something's happened to the people here. Leon, you need to get out of there. Look for a tower and follow the trail near it. Got it. Bro, I can't believe we have not even taken out the chainsaw. I was actually quite hyped for that. Look at this in inventory. Three grenades on the go. Bro. I can't believe we didn't take the guy out. I can't believe that. You know, in the remake, this actually falls down. It's cray cray. Um, what up, Mike? Without further ado, retro in the chat. So what do you think of the remake? I think it's really good. Honestly, Mike, I think it's incredible. Um, I had a good feeling about it. I really think it's in good hands. Um, and I think um, we, we've been saying... Uh, Myself and other uh, Resident Evil um, YouTubers, we've uh, been discussing this on stream. You know, in our, 
RE4 remake hypes. Um, our hype streams. Just saying it. It literally is like the... the um, sorry, I'm sat so close to the desk. That's it. <laughs> um, it really is like the, the culmination of all the remakes um, put together, you know. With, um, RE2 remake. Solid remake. Not amazing, though. Not in my opinion. Um, RE3 remake. It's kind of awful. I love the game, but it's criminal the amount of content they cut out, right? The cow lived. The cow lived, guys. Yeah, you heard me. Hell yeah. I, I really care about that cow. I really do. <laughs> um, so yeah. And they have shown us an excess amount of gameplay. I don't know if you guys agree. If you have seen the gameplay in the trailers, they have shown us loads of the game and to the point where us Ari fanatics we're pretty much like all right that's enough just just leave it till the 24th like it's cool it's cool to see it but chill just calm it down and i think what it is i think the only reason they're doing that is probably to offer us reassurance just to say look we've not messed it up this character's in it this is in it we've not cut out this section they've literally shown us like all the bosses the sections of the game you know so I think they've they've done that to reassure us because um, me and the guys said RE three remake especially it left a stain on the series it left a real sour taste you know you know about the uh, the content being cut out we have got a little uh, it's a spinel a little spinels man I can't believe we we held this out long enough <laughs> and didn't even get the chainsaw guys cray cray um, yeah definitely. Uh, you know what I was saying? I was actually saying when I was uh, streaming the demo the other night. Um, I think RE4 original, creepy. RE4 remake, scary. They, they have absolutely ramped up the horror. And for me, it's genuinely scary. Uh, I love the whole blue, uh, like, hues um, of the of the uh, the whole tones. Of that. It, it looks incredible, all the blues in there. And it's quite reminiscent of, obviously, um, Resident Evil... 3.5 what should have been re4 obviously they changed a lot of things uh, in that and obviously that had uh, a blue like palette but right i think we've um i think we've explored everything i think we've got everything so uh yeah let's move on guys hell yeah now we did go we probably grinded that out man And yeah, the, the police guy uh, being burned alive, yeah. Um, obviously, you actually saw that. Whereas on here, he's kind of already burning. And obviously, with, with the... It's the graphics, man. It, it is so graphically beautiful. It, it really is. I've got to say. Yeah, it really is incredible, man. I, I can't believe how impressive it is. Like, even things like... I noticed... You know when Leon's fight in Krauser in... Um, it's in a gameplay scene. And he's kind of like, go to swing... Um, not really a maybe a punch or a hit or something. Cla uh, Krauser blocks him, and obviously because he's kind of jolted forward and he stops, you see his hair like kind of move, sort of like the 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 hair physics. It's things like it's crazy. It's cray cray. It's just so good. Um, yeah. They they are doing an amazing job of it. They really are. Uh, Neil Macy said, what is my favourite game of all time? That is Resident Evil 2, the original. And I'd probably say, I'd, like, for nostalgia reasons, I'd say the PS1 port. But I quite like the, the GameCube port, uh, you know, graphically. And I think the Dreamcast port's real good. I think it's more crisp, the graphics. It's uh, it's real nice. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I agree, Falcon Scott. Uh, the R3 remake, I actually loved it. But it's just the sheer lack of content that lets it down for me uh, it was you could tell it was a rush job they didn't care they generally didn't care all right you coming you coming it's so guys this this game though i don't know if you guys have um it is so enjoyable to play through it really is i can't tell you how enjoyable it is to, to go back to this game really is a pleasure to play Right, I always screw this up, so you need to... I usually do the opposite, and I usually shoot it down, and then it falls into there, and you can't retrieve it. So I think you need to shoot... You need to do something. It's, uh, it's that. You need to shoot the holder. That's it. I, I totally missed this for, like, years. There we go. And then you can shoot that down. Got a nice pearl pendant. Hell yeah. 
I have um Mike, I have indeed um ordered um i4 remake i've got the steelbook edition from game i have indeed man i don't think we get a an egg we'll try oh i love how we locked on it and it shit itself literally <laughs> cloakity fuck thanks bro i appreciate that uh, <laughs> that was so funny we didn't even have to open fire i just said i think we'll shoot this and it just it just laid an egg and pissed off Ace, I won't shoot you for that. You've given us an egg. So, obviously, I, I love getting the medallions. Seven in the farm, eight in the cemetery. Hell yeah, stranger. You need ten or more, but I, I love getting all of them, though. Um, I can't wait for the, the side missions, by the way, in uh, RE4 Remake. It will be awesome. But, um... I was tempted. Oh. I think we're a bit... I think we're a bit far away. I'll go get it in a sec. I hate wasting ammo, man. Um, I think it would be pretty cool. It'd be really challenging. But I think it'd be pretty cool to do... Um, I'd call it probably... I'd say KFC or a cheeky Nando's playthrough. Where the only health items you can consume are the chicken eggs. That'd be pretty cool. A cheeky Nando's playthrough. That'd be pretty funny. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, I actually, unfortunately, I missed out on the Collect's edition of um, RE4 Remake. Um, because uh, it was um, it was announced, obviously, on the, the Capcom showcase. Um, on the Resident Evil showcase. But um, it, it said pre-orders live immediately. So I went on game. I was refreshing the page for about 20 minutes, half an hour. Nothing. Um, and then I had to sleep. Because uh, I, uh, I was up for work early um, at 6am. And then when I woke up, there was gone. I was like, wow, okay. And they just never came back in stock. It sucks what's happening in America, um, by the way. Um, GameStop cancelling their in-store pre-orders. I can only hope and pray for, for those who've uh, pre-ordered online that, that they get theirs. It sucks. And um, I think it, it just makes it become even more of a scalper heaven. Yeah, it sucks, man. There's loads being scalped on eBay. Hate it. Hate it, bro. Um, I mean, I have seen some for around 300, but I, I just didn't want to give in to it. And then at one point, I almost did. Um, I almost purchased it, but um, so I was going to like do the, um, it's like, you know, kind of paying three sort of payments. So I was going to maybe do that. Just paying a few installments, but I was like, you know what? Nah, I'll just get one at a later date. It sucks, man, but I'm, I'm happy to have the Steelbook Edition. Uh, by the way, guys, um, Please keep an eye on my socials and in the Discord. Um, my mate Will from uh, Green Man Gaming, um, he's going to very kindly hook me up with a few full game codes for Resident Evil 4 Remake. So there's no news on some PlayStation ones, so I do apologise. But um, yeah, th these are going to be apparently for um, Xbox and PC. So um, I will be holding giveaways uh, for that. I will do like a, a public one and then I was going to do maybe, I will do like a Discord only competition just to give, you know, the, there's a lot of OGs on there and I literally want to give back as well to the OGs um, just to make sure you guys have a decent chance because obviously I've, I've held a few competitions um, and like we have a lot of entrants like on Twitter and stuff but I literally, I'm trying to get to that, <laughs> I can't remember how to say, yeah we need to shoot that down actually don't we, I didn't even use the shotgun yet. So yeah, I really want to give you, you know, you OG guys in the Discord um, a chance for sure. There we go. Awesome. Oh, what's up, Alice? Thanks for stopping in. Appreciate you. I uh, hope you're doing well. <laughs> Mike, honestly, I, I did not even set the cow on fire. I swear. Um... It was just my playthrough. It was literally just running Riot on fire. So it was one of the Cray Cray Villagers who did it. It wasn't me, bro. Call me Shaggy because it wasn't me. <laughs> right, we've checked that. Let's head on over to the other side. Same with this cat. I will not kill any of the cows. I mean, I... Oh, the dog's there. I mean, I didn't want to kill that chicken, but um, yeah, luckily we didn't have to. <laughs> Hell no, bro. We're going to beat you to it. Beat you to it with that. 
yeah, it's always a, co- a controversial subject, uh, Mike. Um, you know, the whole animal deaths, damaging animals in games. How can you not help the doggo, by the way, in this game? You have to help the doggo. He gives you uh, immense help when you're up against uh, El Gigante, the troll. Right, I think the world's... Was the one in here? Yeah. That's better. We're, we're a lot closer to get it. Let's, um, let's have a look at this one. I, I love that, James, honestly. Egg laying at gunpoint. I love it. You know what, Lara? I, I actually want the opposite. I've been pining for Resident Evil 2 and 3 remakes on the RE1 remake engine. RE1 is remake perfection and how it should be remade. But, I, you know, I, I, honestly, I was devastated when I saw RE2 and 3 remakes. I was absolutely devastated, man. When I saw there wasn't in the style of RE1, I was like, You're, you've got to be kidding me. It's crazy. Uh, Gamer316, thank you for being here, man. I, I apologise. I think I missed your previous comment. The chat is popping. It's popping tonight. Uh, Neil, I'm from Lincolnshire in the UK. Uh, I don't even feel like I have an accent. I'm just really, uh, yeah, I just sound really common, <laughs> to be honest. Um, definitely, definitely uh, Man Cave. That is um, definitely a valid point. Uh, I think, guys, that, that's what I'm going to be doing, I think. Um, accumulate CEX credit. Uh, yeah, my local car boot, it actually starts again very soon on the 19th. So that is uh, this coming Sunday. Um, actually, no, a week on Sunday, sorry. I, I totally lose track of my days. Uh, a week tomorrow. Um, so yeah, I will begin accumulating CEX credit from my video game pickups, and then I will uh, make a purchase of the RE4 Collector's Edition uh, in future for sure. Definitely going to do that. Um, oh, that's a shame, Man Cave. I know, yeah, you said you wanted the PS5 edition, you had to get the PS4. It's a shame when you can't get exactly what you want. There we go. Boom. Do you think that, Lorna? I don't sound like I'm from Grimsby. <laughs> I totally don't think I have an accent whatsoever. Just sound real common. I think we're heading through there in a sec. Let's make sure we've got everything from here. It, it really is, is daft man cave, especially, um, you know, with all the bots and stuff buying things up. It, it really sucks when there's something you really want. When, when it's, you know what, anything else, I'm, I'm not that bothered. But if it's Resident Evil, I will turn mega salty. <laughs> Oh, you're kidding, Mr. Frog. I made I made Mr. Frog a Jill sandwich, right? I held a little competition because I, I make um I make hammer beat designs and I did a Jill sandwich and uh, Mr. Frog won the competition. He said I put it up on eBay up to one one hundred and fifty pounds at the moment. You cheeky bastard. <laughs> I'm only joking, man. <laughs> How could you do that to me, Mr. Frog? Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna ban you from the channel. You're banned from the chat. I'm kidding, man. You know what? If you get £150 for that, then you only have, um, like, about £850 left, and then you can get the Leon replica jacket from Shot NYC. <laughs> Big Dog, what's up, man? Big Dog plays video games in here, so I'll be getting it for the PS5, and it'll be on, be on Game Pass on release. Do you think? I haven't heard that. Definitely not heard that, man. Uh, yeah, it's an absolute treat going back um, to this OG, for sure. Uh-oh, let's go. We've got to start mashing. This is something we will not get in the remake. They've actually scrapped uh, the quick time events. And I think it's probably... I think it's for the best, to be honest. Um, I don't mind them, but I think we can do without them, basically. I kind of don't mind. That sounds awesome, man. Case, so I'm gonna start my fifth play of the demo shortly for the TMP. Can't believe that. Me too, man. I, I couldn't believe it. Like when I first saw it, I thought it was like because of people like hacking into the um, the game. Because I think people can kind of like you know like, hack into it and stuff. They can like rip it apart and stuff. Can't like people are real intelligent like that. They have the right software and programs and stuff. But um, yeah, to find the TMP, it's cray cray. I can't believe like they've given a lot away in this demo. I wasn't even sure if we'd get the shotgun, you know. No, it's great. Right, we got a... <laughs> Don't you dare light that, light that freaking firecracker. It is lit. Right, we've got to watch out for them as well. I am aware. Oh, bollocks. Oh, shit. 
There's a guy on our left, I think. My bad. Let's back up a sec. Hold up. Honestly, I really do hope so, gamer. And I know someone else mentioned it earlier. Apologies, I didn't get uh, back to you on that. Um, yeah, he said, do you think Code Veronica will be next for a remaster? It would be criminal if they left that out. I really hope so, man, honestly. If we can... It's a little too far away, I can't even... Hang on. Oh. I saw the red dot a second ago. We've got to be accurate if we're going to go for it. Oh. Right. We'll head over to the left. What's up, Lex Lisa? Saying hi from Singapore. What's up? Greetings all the way to Singapore, man. Honestly, I, I love it, man. We, we get people from all over the world in, uh, in stream. It really is amazing. Appreciate all you guys and girls who are here tonight. You dare like that. Shit, we narrowly avoided that. Okay. Let's get these dudes in here. Is he lighting that? No. I think he's like glitching out in there. <laughs> but yeah, I, I really hope Code Veronica gets a remaster. I think it's quite underrated. Oh shit. Just wait for it to go boom. Oh. Hang on. Don't you dare throw it. Nice. <laughs> Just this other dude. I'm boiling in this jacket now. If you want to save on your heating bills, just buy one of these jackets, literally. It is boiling. Absolutely boiling, man. Right, I think we all good. <laughs> oh, yeah, we are now. <laughs> but yeah, I, I would really love to do a stream of Code Veronica. I just need to do another run through of it. Because my last attempt, I actually got stuck at the, you know, the tyrant boss, like, on, oh, <laughs> on the plane. That's what I got stuck on. You know, you may think the AI is smart in in this, but in the remake, they are... Honestly, they are something else. They really are. Really are something else. There we go. Get him, get him! Nice. Nice. Beautiful. Um, yeah, how they work with each other you know to take you out like loads of them like they, they hold you back like you know with, with your arms back and stuff while the other one uh you know slashes you with the the axes and and all that i think we've done real good actually i'll heal up in a sec yeah it's the the tyrant on the plane for me that's uh difficult on code veronica i do know obviously you need to kind of inflict some damage and then you, you press like a button and it um Releases like some crates to launch it, obviously to get the tyrant off the plane. But um, honestly, no matter how much damage I've accumulated, loads of them. No matter how much damage I inflict on that, and then um, you know, obviously, I've tried like like three times on on an attempt, man. Um, you know, to release those crates, and it's just um, and I still can't take it out. So if if you screw up, you don't have the sufficient ammo and stuff like it. You, you are just screwed at that. <laughs> yeah, it's real annoying. We do have a bear stand. I can't remember if the... I think the cat size might be for the mask. So I think they, there's like uh, them triangular kind of gems for the bear stand. Okay, so this is where we are uh, directed. I'm just double checking. I don't, I don't think... Um, if we've got like any more medallions to get like at the moment. I think, I think we're good for the minute. Yeah. I think we've got all of them that we can. Yeah, Code Veronica, that is a long game as well. I don't know what I thought of it back in the day, because I'm very, I'm very old school. Like, I love the OG trilogy of Ari. They will always be the best, better than anything, any remakes, anything. They're always the best, the OG Ari trilogy. Um, but yeah, over the years, I, I, I did learn to um, appreciate 
you know, Code Veronica and future titles. I was really late getting to this title as well, getting to the OGRE4, because obviously with it being exclusively on GameCube, you know, for a, a period of time, that ruled me out because I didn't have a uh, GameCube. Um, yeah, it's only when uh, my best mate Alex lent me it for the PS2. That's when I first played it. I was like, holy shit, I've, I've really missed out on this game. That's crazy. But yeah, what we'll do... Um, shift that out of the way. We'll heal up as well, because we've got a mixed herb, so um, obviously with the yellow bean in there. Yeah. So with, with the yellow bean in there, it'll um, increase our overall health anyway, so we'll... Yeah, I think we'll use that, boost it up. Cool. So we'll just move that over. Sort out our eggs. <laughs> that was ace, man. The chicken laying the egg at gunpoint. I've, I've never had that. <laughs> it's so cool. Like, 18 years on since its original release, this game can still uh, surprise you, man. Thank you to you all for being in tonight. Appreciate you. Smoke. Got gum. There is that the guy. The big cheese. Big cheese. Yes. What? Honestly, you didn't even dare really. We're talking cathedral cheese, man. Hmm. Fucking premium. The big cheese. He ain't no fucking baby bell. <laughs> Hell yeah, guys. That is our end of chapter. I'm just going to make a save just cause, ju just so we've got a save. These are all Ada's man from when we did, um, from when we did, uh, her separate ways campaign. We'll, s we'll slot in, we'll slot in around here. Nice. What's up LJ? Thanks for stopping in tonight, man. Hope you and Alice are all good. I know obviously Alice uh, has dropped in tonight. Nice to have you both here. Feeble humans. Let us give you our That's what happens when you have too much cheese before bed, Leon. Too much big cheese. Hey, hey, wake up. Uh, yi -yi. Crawl out of one hole and into another. You want to tell me what's going on here? Americano, see? Now what brings a bloke like you to this part of the world? Oh, hey, easy, whoever you are. <sighs> Name's Leon. I came here looking for this girl. Seen her? What, are you supposed to be a cop or something? Nah, you don't look the type. Maybe. Okay, let me guess. She's the president's daughter? Bingo. That's too good for a guess. Wanna start explaining? Psychic powers. Nah, I'm <laughs> just kidding with you, amigo. <laughs> I overheard one of the villagers talking something about the president's daughter in the church. And who might you be? Me llamo Luis Serra. I used to be a cop in Madrid. Now I'm just a good-for-nothing guy who happens to be quite a ladies' man. <laughs> Why'd you quit? Phew, <laughs> policia. You put your life on the line. Nobody really appreciates you enough for it. Being a hero isn't what it's cracked up to be anymore. Used to be a cop myself. Only for a day, though. I thought I was bad. Somehow I managed to get myself involved with the incident in Raccoon City on my first day in the force. 
That is the incident with the viral outbreak, right? I think I might have seen a sample of the virus in a lab at the department. Hey boy, I'm not bad. Oh no, we've got a QT coming up. After what it now. is. Got it. Bro, we were having a nice little chill with Lewis. It's Leon. Sorry I couldn't get in touch sooner, but I was a bit tied up. You're okay, right? I'm fine. There was a male civilian held captive. According to him, Ashley's in a church somewhere. What happened to him? He managed to escape. Do you have a fix on the location of that church? No, but apparently there's a secret passage in the village that leads there. I'm heading back to the village. It's a little bulky, so I, I need to like, keep um, just my headset and stuff now and again. Yeah, we're a nice little chill with Lewis. Curtis, you have the big cheese. <laughs> Knocking us the fuck out. Over here, stranger. It's our sweetheart. It's that guy. I freaking love the merchant. I proper have a soft spot for the merchant. Love the merchant. I would love to do a stream of um, Resident Evil 4 VR. Um, I, I do have the um, the Oculus Quest 2 with uh, RE4 on it. Um, once I get it hooked up and uh, you know available stream, we will definitely do a, a playthrough of that. Um, I've, I've played through like the first few hours of it and it is incredible. It's, it's so so immersive and um, it genuinely pre pretty scary uh, especially um especially with the, with the crowds of enemies you know um yeah i'm, I'm always like you want to be totally on it you know like so when the enemies get really up close that they're really intimidating yeah it's crazy but yeah when we first saw this guy i literally had my hands on his face i was like oh my god it's the merchant He's too good, man. Got a selection of good things on sale, stranger. Don't know if you've noticed, stranger, but did you see the blue medallions hanging around the village? Come back after you shot ten or more. I've got a specialized gun. I want you to try out. What are you buying? <laughs> so, um, yeah, we'll we'll definitely get the um, we'll get the treasure map. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. Too good. Obviously, I'm not going to tune anything up as of yet. Um, going to wait. Obviously, my go-to for the handgun, uh, handgun-wise, is, is the Punisher, uh, which is the the handgun we get from him uh, for getting the medallions. And then my um, my go-to shotgun is the riot gun. I see, yeah, I see some hype in the chat. Hell yeah, uh, for the uh, for the merchant. Hell yeah. But yeah, I love the, love the riot gun as well. See if we got uh, got some spinels to uh, to sell. Hell yeah. Is that all Dirty ass pearl pendant as well. Ten grand for that. Let's have the merchant's pants ah. down then. <laughs> Thank you. Um, Baron Grad said, uh, if they remake Code Veronica, they better make the airplane section better. That pissed me off so much. Me too, Baron Grad. Um, it, it really is uh, pretty difficult. Yeah, it is difficult. I feel like for me, it's, it's a game killer, genuinely. It can literally kill your game, man. Right, I think there's nothing else I'm after. So, um, we'll get the attaché case. You. You've definitely got to the nearest opportunity. Definitely get your attaché cases. You, you know, you can actually shoot this guy. You can actually behead him. Like, I've, I've done it before. I've um, used the riot gun and blasted his head off. And he still stays standing. He's just decapitated. It's crazy, man. I felt so guilty doing it. I was only messing around. But um, then obviously he's no longer usable at that section. But he does respawn at a later, um, you know, uh, merchant section. You don't fully take him out of the game, luckily. <laughs> but yeah, um, I agree with their Baron Grod. Um, Code Veronica, it really is a challenging uh, Resident Evil, in my opinion. I definitely want to want to go back to it and play it, though. I really want the um, the Japanese PS3 version. That that is the best port, graphically. Because obviously it's on it's on like the the PlayStation and Xbox stores, but 
it ain't great. Uh, it's just literally a direct port of the PS2 version, and it is not ideal. Oh shit! Oh nice! Oh shit! No! No! Bro! I can't believe we, we ran into that! No! We'll, we'll do the, the brown. Yeah, that, that, that does a decent amount. That's fine. We need to back up. <laughs> Where's that guy? Oh, nice. Right, this is uh this is escalating. Oh Oh my god, this absolutely escalates. Kick my ass. Right, I I, I can't take any more risks. We go in, we go in. See the that's fine. Don't worry, we'll just keep distance. Guys, I'm gutted. We've been doing pretty good. We've literally been doing pretty good so far. It's bullshit. Bullshit. Right, that got him. Oh, man, they're, they're so deadly, those. What's up, Alakazam? Thanks for stopping in tonight, man. Appreciate you swinging by. No, don't do it. Don't do it. Oh my god. Literally, what is going on at this section? Literally, what is going on, man? This is so bad. Bro. I can't believe how well we were doing. What the fuck? Literally had our health wiped, what, three times? By them firecrackers? the fuck? Don't usually remember it being this bad. <laughs> it's those, man. It's those with the uh, the height advantage. Let's take all these out, man. The, the cray cray. Oh my god, no, 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 no. Man, these guys are crazy. Let's lob this on them. Nice. We took him with the firecracker out, so I'm bothered about. Shit! Oh my god! No! Honestly, I can't believe like how this has escalated. I really can't. Holy shit! This is so bad. Bro. I'm literally in disbelief. I've never had my ass handed to me on this before. Not this bad in this section. It's literally not our night with these firecrackers. It absolutely is not our night. Did that guy fall? Oh, he's there. We need to make sure we get that guy. Even if we shoot him in the bollocks. <laughs> no! guy died. No. Alright, he's dead now. No more damn firecrackers. I'm so pissed at this. I had my ass handed to me. Bollock shot all the way from like 100 metres. Awesome. Me too, James. I'd, I'd love a uh, RE0 remake. That's a that's a definitely another title I need to go back to. Need to get good at before I stream it. <laughs> I mean, obviously, I know we, we've got these barrels to make use out of, but <laughs> we just haven't had the opportunity. Just swarmed round us. Come on, Aerosmith, walk this way. Oh, as if. How is there this many? How? How are there this many guys? That's crazy. This is even worse than the um, section with the chainsaw guy. Right. You're ready. Boom. What up, Danny? I'm all good, thank you. I hope you're well. 
awesome to hear from you, man. There's been loads of you guys stopping in tonight, and uh, I, I did have a feeling like, you know, we, we'd have a lot of you guys in. Um, obviously, everyone's on the RE4 remake hype. Everyone. Everyone. Forget how uh, difficult this section is, you know. It's not the easiest. Definitely not. Oh, it's behind us. Let's get him on the knees. Everyone falls for Leon. Everyone. Literally everyone fancies Leon Kennedy. Own up guys, everyone does. <laughs> he really, the, the best video game character of all time. Booty slices. Oh man, this, this has been brutal. We had such a good time seeing the merchant that we have this shite. <laughs> it's utter bollocks, all of it is. I'm telling you, I'm hating life. <laughs> in, in this section of the game. I'm fine otherwise. <laughs> right, surely this has got to be this guy over here. And then the guy behind us, surely. Bro. Oh. Piss off, Del Boy. I'm literally waiting for the music to go off. I just want peace and silence. You are souls. Get it, get him off the bridge. Nice. Jeez. It'll calm down in a sec. <laughs> we'll calm things down. Want anything up there, was there? No, we're good. Man, we we we're dealing alright with those uh firecrackers so far up until this we did so well that's why that's why it's handed my ass to me on the, at this section you know because we, we did so well in the previous uh, areas that's why still keep me on my toes a bit nice love those sweet procedures um, yeah, I definitely will be Lexley. Um, I'll be streaming the RE4 remake on release date. Um, I'm so lucky. I've actually I booked the day off work, and I got it uh, approved. And uh, it's actually really awesome because um, did someone else drop down. Literally, how many are there, you guys? Cray, cray. Literally, between me and you guys, we've been outnumbered in this section. How many of them are there? Oh, that was crazy. Sorry about that, babe. <laughs> right, did we did we check in here? Take a look. Yeah, it's really awesome because on, on the 24th, on the RE4 remake release day, um, I've got my next hair appointment, so I'm having uh, more blonde highlights in my hair. It's, it's due for a re-blonde, yeah? So it, it's really awesome because obviously Leon, I'd say in the remake, is a bit more blonder than right now. I think it, his blonde definitely shines. So I'm real happy because me and Leon will be absolutely freshly blonded. So cool. <laughs> so yeah, I'll be so happy to uh, to be matching with uh, with my dude. Right, we just need to find the the other part of this uh, this emblem. There we go. I do apologise, guys, for our depleted health. It was a little brutal there. I like to think I'm, like, not that bad at this game, but... I think we had bad luck. With those, uh, cheeky firecrackers. I've got everything uh, going good with your uh, Gears of War 3D printing, LJ. That's awesome. Because on last stream, he, he said he was working on, um... A Gears of War, um, snub side arm, And he's finished that. Nice, LJ. Now, thank you for sending those pictures through of uh, your 3D models, man. 
It's really awesome to see your work. So, uh, yeah, thanks for sending them in. Oh, I thought I was a barrel. <laughs> I'm seeing things. Nice. I think we've pretty much, um, pretty much looted everything. What's your favourite section of this game, by the way? I'd say mine is, is the village part, the initial village part. Um, actually, of the little outside part, you know, with um, Del Del Lago, you know, the the uh, sea creature. Uh, it's like a like that massive, like mutated whale thing. Um, yeah, I, I love um, Del Lago. I actually love that boss fight. It's probably my favourite boss fight. Um, as annoying as it can be, sometimes you think you've moved the boat out of the way, but it, it can just just nick the boat and then tip you and then obviously you got to mash your way back like you know with the quick time thing um and apart from that i quite like the salazar fight when he um mutates into the the queen plagas um i think you i'm sure that you fight off like the tentacles and then he uh there's like a part and it like opens and it um, exposes him you get like a solid magnum shot or like a sniper rifle shot and uh, to take him out i really love that uh, boss fight but yeah, I, th I think probably my favourite is actually Del Lagos, and uh, I loved uh, loved El Gigante as well. I mean, uh, well, one of my best mates, Charlotte, we we loved that. We literally from back in the day, we we uh, we were shitting it when we came up to him. We did a lot of playthroughs of this game. So damn fun. That would be awesome, James. I know obviously with this you have the Ada separate ways and the Ada's assignment. I know you have them obviously. Um, the extra like campaigns but a merchant backstory dlc would be incredible and a lewis one as well they're two characters i'd love to see uh more of definitely lewis and the merchant and judging from the gameplay we've seen obviously lewis is in the minecart scene as well so do you guys think lewis survives longer than in the original if so like, I'll, I'll be really pleased i, I really hope so I really hope he does. Oh! Gotta run in for their melees, but it comes at a price. Let's go. Kick ass. Let's go. It's a little far away. Oh! He grabbed us when I went for the melee. I don't mind as much like when you know like, when they charge at you with the rakes. Like I hate it when they, they throw the axes at you. I hate that. <laughs> the throwables are annoying as hell. Nice. Nice. That's awesome, Danny. Said, love the Resi series. Uh, planning on doing a live stream next week. Love to have you on at some point. Yeah, for sure, man. I'd be more than happy to appear uh, on your live stream, Danny. Just uh, give me a shout and let me know uh, when you're on. That'd be awesome. Honestly, I, I love doing collabs with people. I really do. Always up for collabing, man. Oh, I'm glad you're enjoying the stream, James. Thank you for being here. He said, uh, watching you play this uh, helps me get reacquainted with the original uh, before the remake is released. Hell yes. It's always good to, man. I'm just waiting until he likes that. Is he liking them? Oh. Nice. you got your own guy, man. you got your own guys. I, th I think we're good. So another one like hiding. I have to watch our step. There we go. Those sweet Poseidus. Another part of this I used to miss as well. I actually didn't realise you could loot them. I mean, I mean I'm talking like years ago. These things I've actually discovered over the years, sort of thing. I actually didn't realise you could uh, loot those those doors. Oh. Oh, watch your step, watch your step. I don't want to go too far there. Oh shit. Man, I mean, I, I will do 
a professional mode of ten, but I'm gonna have to check ourselves before I wreck ourselves for sure. <laughs> no, I appreciate you all for coming in. We've had a lot of people in tonight. A lot of people from my streams. Watch it, watch it. Careful, careful! No! Oh my god, almost. It was almost all over. <laughs> we'll be fine soon, we'll be fine. Yeah, go for it, Daniel. Just give us a message about that, man. You played the Uncharted series. Nice. Man, I, I love the un Uncharted games. And Does any of you guys see the movie with Tom Holland and Matt Wahlberg? I actually really enjoyed the movie. Really enjoyed that. I got that on Blu-ray as soon as it released. Tell you what came on Blu-ray today. Um, it's called Violent Night. So good, man. It's got... Um, is it David? David Harbour in it, who plays Hopper in Stranger Things? That, that's how I know him. Um, yes, yeah, so obviously he plays uh, a Santa, like a grumpy like Santa, and uh, he kind of gets caught up. Like he's, del he's out delivering presents on Christmas Eve, and he gets caught up like, um, in like this big like kind of heist of robbery and murders at, at this house. And it's a violent comedy. It's, it's so good. Honestly, it's so good, man. Absolutely see it if you can. Beautiful. Just in the move some fish and chip. Oh you are so I actually got a I got a hit there. Cheeky bastard. <laughs> there we go. Didn't we'll have to wait for it to come back. We're getting every fish in this pond, by the way, guys. We ain't going until we've uh, we got them all, okay? Beautiful. On this episode of Deadliest Catch. <laughs> I think it's happened last time I was playing this. I think we got stuck for ages here. I didn't actually, Danny. I didn't get any steel books of Uncharted. Um, not, not the, um, no, not the movie. Just the standard. Yeah, I went to see it at the cinema. I loved it. And uh, yeah, Violent Night, man. It's so good. I might actually put that on after stream. I might like fall asleep to that. Come on. Nice. That's another one. Another one bites the dust. Do, do, do. Another fish bites the dust. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I accidentally kind of moved my mouse. Get out of the way. That's it. <laughs> the piece is kind of trying to make me use the mouse, but I ain't. I'm doing a controller. Oh, you asshole. It jumped up at us. I can't believe it did that. Bro, you guys you guys are up for it tonight. I hadn't had one leap up in my face like that before. Come on. We need the health, so I, I, I literally can't carry on, guys. We need the health. Come on, go on, go on. Nice. No, that was a legit kill. I ain't letting you glitch out in the corner, bro. We having it. We having that. Right, so what should we have? Um, nice. That That is a great source of health. Great source. Come on. <laughs> Who else takes the fishing seriously in this game? Surely I ain't the only one. To be honest, after all that commotion, we actually need a little chill, you know? off that guy we killed get him get him nice beautiful right i think i think we've got them all it's a great little section for health it really is you can't pass up um a bit of fishing in the game you know i actually um have a guilty pleasure for fishing games i love them sega bass fishing um on the dreamcast I played it before, years ago. I really want the... Oh, man, it, it's an extortionate price. I want, like, the, the box, you know, with the, the actual rod and the game. Like, it goes for a stupid price nowadays, and I, I cannot justify that. Fingers crossed at some point I, ca I can pick one up for a decent price, but... Yeah. These crows ain't loyal. I think that, that should blow it up. Oh. Nice. 
What's up, Ruby? Ruby Junior's one said, it's 5am here in Indonesia. What's up? Um, all the way to Indonesia. I found you live. Uh, honestly, this is a good start to my day. Well, thank you. I'm, I'm really glad uh, you're starting your day good uh, with this stream. Appreciate you being here, Ruby. Thank you. Appreciate you all for being here. Just make sure there's no uh, like bird's nest up here. So damn enjoyable to play though, going back to this. I really would recommend guys, um, if you have time before the remake, do, do jump back into this and appreciate it. I mean, I'm sure you do anyway, but definitely jump back. Let's get this, uh, let's get this done. Nice. But yeah, we have brought it back. I mean, look at that. Just look at that, guys. Right. Let's just do a little inventory management. These are uh, these fish that they'll get motion sickness like this. I can't, I can't leave them like this. Actually, I might I might have to put this like here. I think to so move that move that there. Oh man, this ain't easy. <laughs> this ain't easy. Let's move that there. Then move that over there. What's up? Who's just done that? Who's just done that? Give me a second. Give me a sec. Frey, subscribe. Thank you, Frey. I appreciate you. Thank you very much for subscribing. Oh, sorry, that's gone derpy. Do apologise. <gasps> oh, no. <laughs> sorry, guys. It's because I, I quit out. Because, obviously, this, this window, the game window, is over my OBS. That's it. Hang on. Do apologise. Oh, no. What's going on with the screen? <laughs> Oh man, I just wanted to see you and subscribe because I, I, I like to shout you out. I do apologise. Just give me a second. I might just have to go into the settings. What the hell? Has it done it? It's, it's real awkward when I play on PC. It's really, really awkward. Let me just sort that. I can't remember what I've got it on. 250. Is that it? Oh, no, 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 not that. <laughs> I think I had it on that. Has that done it? Right, I think that's fixed it. <laughs> Apologies for that little glitch here. I need to just move my, my screen a second. Sorry, there's no way I can... Oh, no. Shit. Is it done to my screen? Is it done to my screen? Be with you guys in a second. Th there's no way I could not shout out someone for subscribing. It's it's not fair. It's definitely not fair um, acknowledging people. I'm, I'm really big on that. I don't like it when people aren't acknowledged. Oh, it's awesome, Man Cave. Man Cave dropping back in. Just played the demo with the TMP. It's awesome. Oh, I'm really glad to hear that, mate. I really am. So glad it's all good. Let me just move my screen. There we go. That's better. Right. Let me get rid of my task manager because that's in the way of the chat. Cool. Right. We back in business. Apologies for that little uh, technical error there. Spooky Geek, what's up? Thanks for stopping in. That's you, Angela, right? I recognise I recognise the profile picture from uh, your Facebook when you comment. <laughs> Thank you for stopping in. Appreciate you. Apologies for that little technical glitch there, guys. Honestly, like... <laughs> streaming, you know, on the PC. It literally had a mind of its own. I'm not sure, Danny. Um, trying to get headshots in, in COD. What's your best count? It's not something that I keep track of, so I won't be able to tell you that, Danny. Yeah, I wouldn't know, man, to be honest. Sorry, it's kind of messing my... It's not messing my hopes. It's such a bulky... It's, it's such a bulky jacket. It's boiling, honestly. It's so boiling. Could always take it off, like, when we're... When we're too hot. When we're in the castle or something. 
but it is actually quite comfy though. I've proper got used to it. I feel like I'll I'll feel the cold too much if I take this jacket off. Right, I totally can't remember. Oh, there we go. Nice. <laughs> Freaking winged it like I always do. That's good, man. Cave, you all prepared there. Said I'm 75% into my RE4 playthrough before the remake drops. Nice. How many of you guys are playing the RE4 original? Or have you been inspired to go back into RE4 original um, by watching the stream? Do let me know. I'd love to know what, what you guys are up to if, if you've got to play it yourselves. Now, you've got the insignia key. Hell yeah. Yes, James, you, you literally read my mind. It, it is on my. Um, my list um i, I would like uh, another monitor and i'd like one of them little slim ones you know literally solely for the live chat it'd just be cool to have one of them little slim ones um yeah to just literally have it on the side um and then i don't have to worry about the screen overlapping it and stuff it, it's a little trippy when i play pc games so i have a little difficulty with it um anything console it's straight into obs but if I'm playing it on Steam or, you know, like this game, it's in another window and I'm having to press Control alt delete and to go back onto other ones, it, it's, it's a proper mess. It's, it's not a great system. Chief's note. As instructed by Lord Sadler, I have the agent in confinement alive. Why keep him alive? I do not fully understand what the Lord's intentions are. I would, however, think he'd keep them separate, not confine them together as has been ordered. I don't expect Lewis would trust a stranger, but if by chance they did cooperate, the situation could get a bit more complicated. If for some reason an unknown third party is involved, I don't think they'd let a chance like this slip by. But maybe it's all Lord Sadler's ploy, leaving us vulnerable so that this third party will surface, even if they, if they even exist, that is. It's an unlikely possibility, but if a prowler is already amongst us, then our plans could be ruined. I guess the Lord thinks it's worth the risk if we're able to stop whatever conspiracy is at work. At any rate, it's the Lord's call. We will trust his judgment as always. Freaking reading Sadler's diaries. What's up, Ghost Rider? Thank you for stopping in tonight, man. Good to hear from you. I'm doing good, thank you. I hope you are as well. All good in the hood. All good in Sadler's hood. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> Big cheese. Play nicely, Big Cheese. You don't want any trouble. You carry the same blood as us, it seems. Nevertheless, you're an outsider. Just remember, if you become unpleasant to our eyes, you'll face severe consequences. Same blood. Same blood, so he has been infected. We'll do a little cheeky uh, chapter saves. We don't know what's ahead. Love the graveyard part. Love it. Real awesome. Especially with those creepy wolves as well. Um, thank you, Danny, for your kind words. I really appreciate that. He said, Host, that's why you're amazing. There's not many people. Uh, read the comments and you're one in a billion. Mate, honestly, I don't see... I'll, I'll tell you in a minute what my thoughts are. Leon, I've been able to get some new info that might help you. Fill me in. Apparently, there's a religious cult group involved. They're called the Los Illuminados. Los Illuminados? <laughs> That's a mouthful. Anyway, I had an unexpected run-in with the big cheese of this village. <laughs> the big cheese? You're okay, right? Yeah. But he could have killed me, but he let me live. And he mentioned something about me carrying the same blood as them. Whatever that means. Carry the same blood. Huh. Interesting. Anyway. There are more important things than solving riddles right now. You're right. Hurry and find that church, Leon. You can't talk over booty call. Um, yeah, my thoughts, like, um, with you saying that, Danny, you know, that I actually, you know, like, read the messages, like, I don't see why people wouldn't, like, I, I'm not taking a swipe at anyone. I've seen it before. It's not a swipe at anyone in particular, any groups, people, or anything, but why wouldn't you read the comments out, right? Why wouldn't you interact with people? Sorry guys, big cheese calls. 
I'll be mean in a second. I can't talk over Big Cheese. It's my own stream, but I, I can't talk over the Big Cheese. <laughs> Ada! Ada, wait! She freaking saves us! <laughs> awesome. Out of nowhere. Let's go back through there a second. I, I can't believe there's anything um, I may have missed. Yeah, I didn't want to like, skip anything. But yeah, I, I, I don't get why, like, you wouldn't... Oh, shit! Sorry, I didn't mean to disturb you having a piss, mate. Um, I don't know why you wouldn't interact with the people that support you, you know? You've got to appreciate people. I appreciate all you guys. Like, because otherwise, I like, I wouldn't be streaming, would I? Yeah. It's thanks to you guys. Like, I actually stream. You know, I have fun. You guys make the streams. I, I get some people say, thanks for making the content. But it's like, no, thank you guys for being here. We appreciate you. Like, myself and many other channels, we would be nothing without your guys' support. Genuinely. Oh, bro, that would be great, James. Yeah, the Sadler portrait painting on a t-shirt. Imagine that. That would be so sick. I I'd, I'd just love the portrait as well. Imagine that, as soon as you walk in your gaff. <laughs> uh, no worries, Lana. Um, he said, gonna, said, gonna get some sleep now. Um, have a great one. Enjoy the game. And chat soon. Glad I got to see some of the stream. Lana, it's so good to have you in here. Um, please tell Steph I said hello. And uh, yeah, both of you take care. And um, hopefully see you in another stream. Uh, I'll have a catch up with you guys soon. Uh, let me know if you guys are, are back uh, anytime soon. Yeah, it's Lana and Steph, the OGs. Who I used to work with at game. The absolute OGs. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> right. I ain't in the mood for this. It's gonna it's definitely gonna be uh fish and chips for tea after after this fight. <laughs> I I ain't uh I ain't in the mood for this. I, you know what? I, I think it'd be good to start off with a flash. Flash ah I ain't getting my ass kicked by the chisel man. Uh, Manco said, do you visit retro game shops uh, often these days and where do you recommend? So, um, I haven't in a long time, uh, Man Cave. Uh, I, I really want to. It's literally just having the cash though because I've had to literally take a step back a, a bit um, since I had my own house. Uh, obviously, I've been in my house like just over like a year and a half. Um, and obviously, I'm, I live on my own. Mine's the only income in the house. So, I just need to check myself before I wreck myself. Um, <laughs> Did I get him? Oh no, we ain't that lucky. We didn't get him. Look at that gore, man. Look at the gore. Sick. Um, but yeah, once I get a little, you know, spare cash, I will be definitely on the hunt uh, in retro game stores. Um, I don't know if you was, you might have been playing the demo, I think. You might have been away and playing, oh shit. You might have been away and playing the demo, uh, Man Cave. Oh, shit. But we was actually on about, um, I was on about Gotham Games in Lincoln. Do you remember that? I don't know if you know Lincoln. But there was, there was a really good game store called Gotham Games. It was so good. Um, and it, yeah, it shut down the other year because the owner, he just wanted to go on to other things. I was really sad to see that shut down. Um, apart from that, uh, if you're in York, uh, Saw Thumb Retro Games, that is probably the best one I have been in. I've not been in that many, but like, it is incredible. It's absolutely packed with gaming goodness so uh, definitely recommend that uh, my mate lee who owns it he's a top guy um yeah he, he really is awesome and obviously he's got a lot of import stuff as well from japan because him and uh, his family whoa go uh, go over there um now and again and uh yeah he said i, I know some awesome local place in doncaster and bradford but always nice to hear new places so I have heard, I'm sure you probably would have heard of it, um, Doorway to Darkness, I think. Is that Doncaster? Um, I've, I've been meaning to, to go there. I really want to. Um, it's definitely on my list of places to go. So that'll probably be the first retro game shop I go to, like, you know, um, after a while. I'll definitely make my way there. Because uh, the, the videos I've seen, the, the footage, of that, I, I think it looks awesome. I've been to... Um, I mean, obviously, th this is a distance away. Um... But in Cardiff, I've been to Super Tomato. Uh, that was a pretty good store. Pretty good game store. They had some good stuff. 
lots of retro in there. Some like I got some like Neo Geo Pocket games. Um, I was eyeing up um a Donkey Kong uh game. Um, it's as in uh not not a board game, but you know like a, a toy game sort of thing. But it just had like one piece missing to it, so I had to give it a miss. But um, I think it was there. It was either there or in sore thumb. Um, can't remember which one it was now. Um. <laughs> But yeah, things miscellaneous things like that. Uh, yeah, Super Tomato was good in Cardiff. Um, not really. Um, anywhere else I can think of. I mean, there's there's lots of places. Uh, don't get me wrong. Um, if you if you want to know any places, um, I actually buy a magazine um, called uh, Sega Powered, and it's by um, I don't know if you've heard of Mark Jowett. On, on the game groups. He, he runs Sega Max. Um, good friend of mine. And uh, he's, he's well known within the game community for selling magazines at reasonable prices for us collectors, making it very possible, you know, to, to collect them. Um, him and a few other guys. Um, Lord Sadler. <laughs> Fancy them being his last words. Um, yeah, so the, the magazine Sega Power, they, they have a, f a full page with stores throughout the UK, so I'll take a picture of that man on in one of my issues and send it to you, uh, so you can see some other ones. There's quite a lot. Um, I know there's a lot scattered around, but um, yeah, there's a lot I couldn't really tell off the top of my head. No, I appreciate that, Danny. Actually, meant to reload that. I didn't mean to. Shot, shot. It's only a matter of time before those snakes come out the oh, boxes. Calm your titties, you lot. Ca calm freaking down. Calm your titties. <laughs> Ain't having this bullshit. It's my cabin. What are you doing in my swamp? Oh, shit. Oh, my God. You guys, you guys, you need to chill. You need to chill the fuck out. <laughs> nice. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Get him with it. Oh, nice. Why not? Why freaking not? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. I could not get to the menu quick enough. Look at the health. Look at the freaking health. <laughs> um, no, I appreciate that, Danny. He said, that's why I come back as you are kind heart. Kind-hearted and enjoy the same stuff as I do and just down to earth and nice. Thank you for your kind words. I appreciate that Honestly, like why wouldn't you be down to earth? Watch this. Watch this magic, right? Massive fish and chips Does wonders for your health. Always have that omega-3 guys. Always um, <laughs> No, I mean why wouldn't I be you know, um I think out of everything I was actually saying to uh, Jody uh, one of the best mates who I work with the other night. Oh shit I was on shift with her and I, you know, I was posting on my socials about my YouTube and whatever and I said to her, I said, literally, the biggest compliment I've always got since I started the tubes that people have said, like, you're really down to earth. It's like, you know, why wouldn't you be? Like, I'm genuinely, I'm not on this pedestal above everyone else. I'm literally on the same level as all you guys. I'm not some, you know, massive figure above everyone. Not at all. You know, it's literally... Like I always say, when I, when I stream games, it's literally just like hanging out with loads of your mates. That's literally what it's like, you know? And you guys are kind enough to put up with my bullshit. <laughs> Level up boxing, what's up, man? Uh, says, uh, hey, Holster, hope you're well. I'm doing good, thank you. I hope, I hope you're well as well, dude. Um, <laughs> kind of had me pants down with this, with this jacket. Um, it was actually on a shop on Amazon, so I, I was a little pissed about it. I was, I was a little disappointed, but we good. I'm still flexing the jacket. The thumbnail's a lie, by the way, because I, uh, I tweaked the, the colour of it. I tweaked the colour in the thumbnail. <laughs> so it looks absolutely fine. Then you get on it, and then I look like, like someone straight out of wish. Leon Kendi out of wish. Um, so do you think I should wait for the RE4 remake or play the original? I've never completed the original, so I was wondering if I should save myself from spoilers... Oh, it's a tough call. Honestly, I'd say if you have the consoles, if you have a PS2, a GameCube, a PC, um, or even, you know, like a, an Xbox Series X, PS5, PS4, uh, Xbox One, whatever, 
you can still obviously get them on the store, uh, the OG i4. I would definitely say play, play this original and then, I mean, if you have time, definitely play this original and then do the remake, if you have time. If you don't, then, you know, it, it's fine, but um, I would say try and play this one before you play the remake. Because I feel like if you go straight ahead and play the remake, you I don't think you'll appreciate this as much. Because the remake, it honestly, from what everything we've seen in the demo, the gameplay of the demo, is absolutely next level. It's out of this world graphically. It blows this out of the park. So you've got to think this is a 2005 game. And we're obviously 18 years on from that. You will not appreciate this as much, I don't think. Um, and you, you've, you've got to see this first, I think. You know, things like... Just everything about it, the merchant voice, like, just everything original about this game. I just think you, people should definitely experience this first. But it's totally up to you, though, you know? It's totally up to you. Bro, I think he, like, landed on his head. Booty slices. Slices of booty for dessert tonight. He even, bitch didn't even give us anything. That's cray-cray. But yeah, whatever you play, level up. I hope uh, you enjoy them. This is, honestly, this is so enjoyable to play now. Like, even to this day. It, it really it holds up so well. But I, I just think if you go straight to the remake, I don't think you'll fully appreciate this for what it is. I think you'd be okay, uh, level up. If, if you crack on, you know, you've still got a couple of weeks-ish, you know, you'd be alright. And like just to appreciate like the old music and stuff because things will be changed in the remake things are tweaked and changed what retro game shop's that danny said there's a really good retro game shop in brighton market i don't think that does anything you can shoot down but it just causes a little fire i don't think it actually drops anything of course we'll climb down it's always a good idea i love these areas love them Right, keep keep our eye on the on the ceilings, the walls for any spinals and all that. Uh, yeah, I agree with you there, gamer. You said uh, retro prices are getting stupid. I've slowed down so much. Me too, me too. And that that's why obviously cause I, since I moved to my house, uh, I don't have cheap rent anymore. I, I've had to, um, you know, I had to calm down. I didn't know if anything dropped if we if we shot that down. I don't think so. Right, so it's just these spinals up here and pendants and stuff. Cool. Yeah, that, that's what's deterring me from it. Like I said, um, I was on about it earlier when we were shooting them fish. I said, I really want Sega Bass Fishing for the Dreamcast. The game only, no problem. £10, £20, £15, something like that. But the game and the um, the actual rod itself, boxed as well, extortionate. I think you're literally looking at like a, a few hundred pounds. And um, the prices of horror retro games as well. Like I, I really love Clock Tower on PS1. Not a chance I'll get that. Not a chance. It's literally like over a few hundred pounds for that as well. Oh, stranger! Something that might interest you. Stranger! Got a selection of good things on sale for stranger. Oh, nice! That that is sick. That is sick game. We said DVDs are good to collect. I got thirty WWE DVDs for three quid. I can believe you, man. That's sick. That's so good. Um, I actually love the old uh, PPV events in wrestling. Love them. Don't usually buy the TMP. We could always maybe buy it later on for a bit of fun. But uh, yeah, just for the sake of saving up Pesitas and uh, ruining the attaché case, I will uh, sell these. <laughs> Thank you. I think we'll be good. Um, we'll we'll save these as well. We'll still save these. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. Ah. I'll buy it at a high price. Ah, I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Ah, What's it say? Does it not work? I'll oh. buy it at a high price. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. A rare stone set in this made it one of a kind. Hell yeah. Ah, <laughs> Thank Merchant you. guy will be balling. I mean, unless he's got a missus, he'll have some quiet. awesome... Jewelry for his missus. <laughs> his missus is a lucky gal. Um, 
Yeah, um... Danny said, is there any way to get Resident Evil PlayStation Series sealed copies? So, for that, my friend, I would either look on eBay or uh, the game groups on Facebook. Because there are some sealed collectors and pe people selling sealed stuff. I would definitely look in those. That's your best bet to get them, I think. Look at our guy. Love him, man. Look at his eyes as well. He is awesome. He looks a little bloodshot as well. He's, a, he's having a rough night. You know, it's not only us. It ain't only us. He's having a rough night as well. Let's go. Uh, level up. I think I still like Leon's look here, kind of, but he still looks amazing, like, in, in the remake. But I think his look here is, is a little camera shy. I can't, I can't even say. Look at the stream. <laughs> yeah. His hair's like more ruffled than everything in it in, in the remake and stuff. But it's more representative though, isn't it, of, of the environment and obviously it's gonna be like that. It looks a lot neater in this. Um and I think he's got maybe even more of a baby face, if that's possible. A little bit more in the remake. I do like his look in this one, but I still think in the remake he he definitely looks amazing though. Uh James said, uh many streamers are doing it. Uh, just to make money but there's nothing wrong with that but your passion really shines through thank you james i appreciate uh your comment man i appreciate your kind words thank you uh generally hon honestly i definitely don't do this for money um I've, I've always wanted to stream genuinely i just i just literally want to be um just want to be online on, on the screens I li that's what i want to do i just literally want to be on online and on people's screens and that's that's why, and I just want to just wanna vibe, just want to have a, a real fun time with people, you know? And make many friends as well. I really have. Um, so yeah, it's been so enjoyable. Like, you look at the, the blood splatters as well, man, when we get the knives in. They're so good. I can't, can't get the medallions just yet. If you look, these bloods, they're great. So good. They look great, man. Yeah, I love this graveyard section, especially when you, you trek back and then um it's uh and then it's like night time and it, the, there's the wolves. It, that is scary, it really is creepy. Yeah, it's so good. I don't know if there's like some pickups around here, I can't remember. Someone like one of these graves or something. Or if I'm thinking of something else. Oh bollocks. <laughs> we've we've alerted some people. Right. Hang on. I want to have fun shooting my medallions. I'm, I'm getting interrupted. Bro. Is there another one? Yeah, there's one there. Let's make sure we get them all. We've got to get those medallions. I'm, I'm really excited. I think I mentioned it earlier. I'm really excited for the side missions in uh, the remake. Obviously, they have uh, added side missions in there. I'm sure there are medallions as well. But there's there's other things to, to do as well for like... Uh, Oh, shit! <laughs> For things like Pesitas and um, the Spinals and stuff like that. Yeah, I'm, I'm really excited. I, honestly, I, I can't tell you my excitement. Uh, unfortunately, um, I should have had, like, kind of pretty much a, a solid full week off. I'm kind of interrupted a couple of times after it's after the game's released. So, I've got the 24th off and then I've got to work on night shifts on the 25th and the 27th. And that that is... I've had to take those shifts in return for having time in April off for insomnia in Birmingham. Yeah, you lay there with that firecracker, bro. Think about what you did. Boom. Why haven't it exploded yet? <laughs> bro! No! 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 <laughs> How? That fucking blows. How? Bro. How did that not explode? He was literally having cr firecracker and chill for like 10 minutes. You take the piss, son. They have literally killed us, this game. I swear, if it, if it kicks my ass in the remake, I'll not be happy. <laughs> That's cray cray. I've right, got six left. We'll be trekking back anyway, um, and we'll get that. Um... Hang on, hang on. We got the treasure map, haven't we? Bollocks. 
Thank you for that. Uh, Tyrell Angel. Thank you. It said, nice jacket, true immerse. Hell yeah. I had to, I had to keep the jacket on, man. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, have I, uh... Oh, we've missed one back there. No. How? Let me just trek back. We've got to get them. We've got to get them all. Hang on. It only takes a second. See if we can get back anyway. No, I, I can't have it, guys, honestly. Like... So actually, if we get that one, we can actually go back to the guy, our guy. Go back to the merch, then, then we can get the Punisher, I think. Then we'll still get the other five, but we need at least ten. I'm going back for that. I, I can't bear to miss a medallion, I can't. Just, so just bear with me a second. <laughs> oh my god, that's crazy. Um, Man Cave said Silent Hill is £100. Wow. I think I got mine. Um, when did I get mine? Right, so it's only it's only down here. Cool. I think I got mine for like 30, 40 pounds. I think it was about 30 pounds. Uh, my mate Hannah got me it for a, a Christmas present one year. And that was back in, ooh, 2016 or 17. It's this one, man. It caught us out, I'm afraid. This one. We need to see if any, the chickens can lay any more eggs at gunpoint. I think it's just behind us, I think. I don't think it's there. Yeah. Oh, it's not that one. And that's weird. So it's not, it's not here. Hang on, it's, it's not anywhere inside this, is it? On the ceiling. I forget, I forget whereabouts they are in each, uh, each house. I think it's around that corner, I think. Yeah. We'll get to it. Yeah, so I, I will be streaming. Um, lay, lay an egg. Lay an egg at gunpoint. I always feel like somebody's watching me. <laughs> Come on. All right, fine. You, you did lay one earlier, so I'll let you off for now. Oh, nice. That one's just shot itself. <laughs> I think it's here. There we go. Beautiful. Right, let's make our way back. Making my way downtown. Back to the merchant and I'm homebound. Start, you missed that as well. Because it's still so easily missed stuff. Right, we are going the right way, aren't we? That's actually one of my most said quotes ever. Hell yeah. No, we, we needed to get that, man. We, we can't miss any medallions. I can't do it. Oh, nice. That was called Danny. We just said, was it Brighton Market, did you say, I think? Uh, it's called Magic Whistle Gaming. Nice. Oh, bro. So, unfortunately, I travelled three hours there and it was short. That's awful. I remember that happening. Um, I remember that happening when I went to um, Super Tomato in Cardiff um, at one point. Because um, I've, I've been a couple of times, like, actually, you know, going and shopping there and that. Welcome. But one day I did turn up and it was actually meant to be open. It was shut. With no notice at, at all. Well done, stranger. I see you've shot enough number of medallions. Like I promised, go claim your specialised gun in the buy screen. Don't worry about the money. This one's on the ass. <laughs> what are you buying? Hell yeah, let's get our Punisher. I, I love the Punisher. I always uh, proper tune this up. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. Right, I don't know if we'll kind of lose our ammo, but I'll I'll sell the... Um, what are you selling? Our other one. I, we shouldn't do. Is that all? <laughs> nice. Thank you. Thank you. If we've got anything, I, I think that cat's eye. That going the first time, yeah. What are you buying? I think there's anything else. I always buy first aid sprays whenever they're in what stock. Are you buying? No, I won't do that. 
Uh, can't tune up the Punisher yet. I'm gonna leave the shotgun because obviously I like the Come riot gun. Oh, sick gamer. So I've got Sega Bass Fishing with the rod. Uh, sadly not boxed. Great game. Um, are there any aftermarket rods on Amazon? Um, yeah, I assume there probably would be, man. Yeah, it doesn't always have to be official, does it? And like you say, it wouldn't be too extortionate to get the actual rod in the game. It's just the whole, with it being boxed with the paperwork, you know, that that's literally what, what bumps the price up. That's what sells it. But I just don't think it's worth it. You know, I, I might as well, like, like you said, I might as well just get the actual rod in the game. Just just don't mess around. Let's move so through the health. I think we're looking all right. Or... Oh god, so fast, oh god. <laughs> Thank you for that, Tyrell uh, Angel. Said, showing mercy for the poor chicken, I'm proud. <laughs> Thank you for being proud, man. You gotta protect those chickens, you know. Uh, what up, Craig? I hope you're all good. He said, yo, what up, Holster? What up, man? Thank you uh, for stopping in this stream. Appreciate you. Honestly, we've had loads of people in tonight. It's been so good. Won't open. There's a round hole. Maybe something fits here. Booty call. Honigan. Honigan, it's Leon. The door's locked. I can't get in. Didn't they teach you how to pick locks at the academy? Yeah. There's some sort of indentation, like something might fit inside. Well, there's no use standing around. Leon, you have to find some way or something to get inside. We got it. Always have to take orders from you, Honigan. Won't budge. Got to be locked from the other side. Uh oh. Don't don't start lighting that bollocks. No, don't do it. Don't do it. Oh my god, why? I, I literally, I can't deal with it. I, I don't get our luck on this playthrough. Fuck, we've had the worst luck with these. Like, I, I kind of couldn't, um, I kind of couldn't ignore the woman. Like, fuck. I can't, I can't believe it. Wow, that, that is unbelievable. Uh, Level Up said there's 44 people in here. Thank you. That is incredible for one of my streams. That's so good. Thank you, guys. Thank you for absolutely showing up tonight. And yeah, if, if you guys... Oh! No, 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 no! Oh my god. I thought we'd taken him out. Oh my god. I've, I've literally developed a phobia to that. Yeah, if you guys are enjoying the stream, if you don't mind dropping us a cheeky like, it helps the stream do well in the YouTube algorithm. Thank you. Figuring out, um, three, four, four, three. Can't which one we need. Uh, is it VZM? I don't know if it's three, four. One, two, three, four. My serious face is on now. <laughs> Mm. Three. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I'm trying to get to the M1 on the right. I, th I think we need to get there. One, two, three, four. Oh, one, two, three. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Oh. Two, three. Let's do four. Then do four. One, two, three. Oh, man. One, two, three. We'll get it. We'll get it. I don't know if it's like VZM, if, if you get what I mean. It's as simple as that look like them. Um, let's do four. 
Also, Wolverine Scratch, thanks for being here, man. He, he even he said, yeah, quite the audience tonight. Too kind of you guys. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Um, I mean, we can look this up. I'm, I'm trying to do it legit. I'm really trying to do this legit, man. I think I bossed it up. One, two, three, four. Hang on. Let's just delu oh, so eliminate that again. I don't know if any of you guys know it, dear. One, two, three, four. Hmm. I will get it. It just takes a little while. Four. Didn't mean to do that one. Hang on. Let's do three. We do three again. We just. I think we just need to get the uh, that flat that flat line one. I think we need to just get rid of that one. I think. One two three four. One two three. Oh man. <laughs> Thank oh, you. thank you, Craig. That's so kind of you. The merchant is out thanking you for that tonight. Thank you, stranger. Thank you, Craig, for the £4 super chat. He said, you can do this. Ha <laughs> ha. Thank you, man. We can definitely do this. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Yes! Got it. Yeah, I kind of knew it was those uh, those symbols. Hell yeah, thank you, Craig. Your, your Snapchat, oh, uh, Snapchat, sorry, <laughs> Super Chat. It's because I was messing around with it on Snapchat before this. I did a I did a dapper meme. Your Super Chat has brought us luck. Thank you. Now I'll show you guys because we're to celebrate. Celebrate is doing that. Made a, a great meme. So if you guys have seen the thumbnail, I, I've messed with the colour. The thumbnail's a lie. I'm a fraud, okay? Because um, this this jacket's turned out shite and it, it's it's been returned after this stream because I've uh, <laughs> found a much better one. But anyway, the, there's me with the shitty orange fur. They mean the thumbnail. You versus the dude she told you not to worry about. <laughs> I mean, you can't see that properly there, but it's on my socials. You versus the one she told you not to worry about. <laughs> Too funny, guys. It's so good. To have loads of you in. I appreciate you. Thank you. If I, if I could do the merchant voice, I, I'd, I'd say it in the merchant's voice. Let's just double check this map. Obviously, we, we've we've got sufficient medallions. We, we're, we're done. But I've got to get them on. I, I can't just get ten. I can't, guys. Is it like, yeah, just here. Awesome, thank you, Danny. Yeah, we'll definitely uh, start a collab soon, man. Yeah, you do forget, don't you, James, that how many collectibles are actually in the game? How do you start? Hey. Hey. You're falling for Leon. I mean, who doesn't? There's one under some floorboards. Yeah. You have to be like at a certain angle. So we'll get, I think we'll get a little closer to get that one. Uh, we got Gnome, Sobra Gnome. Said Brazil. What's up? All the way to Brazil, man. Greetings to you. Thank you for being here. Oh, oh I swung again. I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> oh no, where is it? We've been cheating out the snake. No, no. Where is it? Is it here? Yes. There we go. Beautiful. Fucking chicken egg from a snake. I knew it. I knew it was coming. Thank you, Dano. It's a pleasure having you here, man. One of the absolute OGs. He said, pleasure being here. 
closure of the church. Regarding the two fugitives, the apprehension of Lewis is our top priority. The American agent, a distant second. What Lewis stole from us is far more important than the girl. Unless we get it back, the girl will become useless to us. We must get it back to execute our plan to the end. If it gets in the wrong hands, the world would become a totally different place than what Lord Sadler has envisioned. At all costs, we mustn't let that happen. Nevertheless, we're not letting go of the girl. To ensure that the agent does not get to her, I've locked the church door where the girl is being held. Anyone who needs access to the church must first get approval by Lord Sadler. There's a key beyond the lake, but it should be safe now that the Del Lago has been awakened by our Lord. No one will get across the lake alive. That is another section of the game which I, I absolutely love. I love the lake section. and Like I mentioned earlier, I, I really... I think Del Lago is arguably um, my favourite boss of the game. I, I just love it. I just love the overall vibe, like being out like in, in like the, you know, in the open water. It's real cool. Plus, our same blood courses through the agent's veins. It'll be just a matter of time before he joins us. Once he does, there will be nobody else left that will come looking for the girl. You know what, Dano? I haven't used the Red Nine, like, you know, for a proper playthrough or anything. Um, I'm proper... <laughs> I should be more open to it, really. I'm I'm so set in my ways with RE4. Like, as in, I'll always just do my routine, you know. It'll be the Riot Gun, the Punisher, um, and then that that's legit. <laughs> there we go. 15 out of 15 medallions, guys, because we are the absolute... We are the absolute Gs. Uh, Danny said, if you got a chance to make a Resident Evil game, what would it be and who would be in it? So, my dream, um, if I if I could be some huge, hugely talented modder, I, I always would have loved to have um, ported my secondary school into Resident Evil in the style of uh, the OG Resident Evil, you know, as in Resident Evil 2. Like, with, honestly, I used to walk around my secondary school, my high school, and... Um, think about the corridors I was in and there was a real real tall building called the lodge it had this winding staircase and I just, I just used to think like which which um right we're gonna granada these I'm gonna granada them which uh like songs from the Ari soundtrack would fit in uh you know with these parts you're ready for an absolute crow feast crow feasting give us that sweet Pasidas. Look at those glistening. Nice. So, yeah, I would port my high school into the Resident Evil engine, the OG trilogy, Resident Evil. And I would actually, I'd probably get, um, it's difficult because I'd want Leon to be in it. Or I'd maybe get like the Stars Alpha team. Um, it's, it's difficult. I'd, I'd want Leon to be in it, but then I think it'd probably make more sense to have the Stars Alpha team just travelling in because they heard that there was a, an infection in a skull and they're trying to contain it. Um, so I think that would be cool. Uh, having um, Jill Valentine and uh, Chris Redfield and Barry Burton. And fuck you, Wesker. <laughs> and, uh, and Rebecca Chambers in there. I would love Rebecca in there as well. So I'd, I'd have them four, I think. That'd be awesome. And to be honest, I think Leon could be in there because he could be the school security on his first day on the job. I think he turns up his security uh, to maybe watch over the school to see if there's any further infections on the night time or something like that. Or he turns up late when, when school's out, when school's finished. But yeah, it'd be Resident Evil um, school's out <laughs> or something like that. Resident Evil GCSE edition. <laughs> I don't know, whatever. But that would be my idea. And that's what I would do if I was a mad, talented modder. What about you guys? Let me know. Or I could do Resident Evil Grimsby, right? And it turns out there's no infection. That's just what, what our people are anyway. <laughs> that That's just us. <laughs> yes, James, that would be sick. He said, I'd make a Leon and Claire dating sim. That would be so good. Like, that would be cool. Like, literally like the Sims game. And you get to control them. It would be so cool. Yes, Dano. I think that would be very fitting. Barry can be the caretaker. Definitely. Oh, that music. That 
Ambiance kicking in. The serenity theme. Hell yeah. Guys, these are some sick ideas. Please hit us with your ideas. What would you make, you know, if you could make Resident Evil game, what would be the purpose? You know, what would be, you know, the plot and everything and what characters would you have? Some really awesome questions, so thank you for that, Danny. Appreciate that. It's really awesome to have these kind of discussions, but yeah, that, that's what I'd do. Barry would be a sick-ass uh, caretaker. He really would. could probably trust him to keep the ground safe, you know. Our trusty Mr. Burton. Uh, Danny said they used to wear a long leather coat at such like and like they did in Buffy or Angel. That's sick. I like that. Look at all this shit. <laughs> we can't hardly purchase any of it, bro. Got some rare things on sale, stranger. What are you selling? What are you selling? Have we got anything for him? Spittles. Spittles for days. Thank you. He's put them cat size in the bear stein. Always buy him at any opportunity because he doesn't always have them in stock. You literally have one, and that's your lot. So you, you've got to buy him. Hell yeah. Thank you. I proper um, do up the Punisher and the uh, the riot gun. Yeah, see if these all go in there. First time. Hell yeah. I think it's just, yeah, just one more slot. Nice. Um, yeah, just because we've, like, got all sorted, I will make a... Oh, shit. Let me do that. I meant to like that, actually, reload. We'll make a little save. Nice. No, we're doing all right. It's been a little turbulent. The damn firecrackers, man. <laughs> That's been the death of me, almost. How many times has my health me literally been like that? It's crazy. Uh, Manvo, what's up? Thanks for uh, stopping in. Unfortunately, it's all these fish, man. We can't go fishing. Well, we'll let them enjoy the uh, the somber blue light of the uh, the merchant. Yeah, Mambo said, I can't wait for the remake to release. Uh, I played the demo and I am stunned. Me too, man. Um, you know what? What surprised me more than anything? Um, that the demo was not a one-shot time demo. The fact that it's unlimited. They have been super generous. That's so good of them. To give us that, you know? Oh, he's not all bad, Tyrell. He said, I feel like I'm doing a bad deal when the, the merchant laughs. No, man, it's just his personality. He's a good guy, really. He's all good. I mean, if you can't trust the merchant, then you can't trust anyone, right? <laughs> I have indeed, Dano. That is an absolute... I feel like sometimes it's not talked about enough these days. The faculty... It's an absolute sick movie. It really is. Yeah, it's, I, I love the cast in it. In, in, uh, is it Josh Hartnett? And um, he actually disappeared, didn't he, at some point? Like, off, off the acting scene. You didn't see anything of him, like, you know, after he was in, like, that. And, like, I think it was, like, a teen comedy he was in as well. I'm just checking up here to see if there was anything. I can't remember. Just want to double check everything. I think we're good. Yeah, it's got Josh Hartner. It's got L young Elijah Wood and young Usher. So sick. Man, it is such a good movie. I'd definitely recommend, guys. If you haven't seen it, please watch The Faculty. It's so damn good. Um, yeah, I didn't actually have it on DVD, but I got it from the charity shop for like 50p. You absolutely can't go wrong. Please just seek it out. Uh, oh, how did I not get him? Yeah, please seek it out in your charity shops, man. It's it's too good. Little gem, I think. I'll tell you what I think is a hidden gem. Uh, it's actually better than I thought it'd be. Cause I didn't remember anything of it. Um, snake. Oh, shit. I was too distracted by the snake. Yeah, I actually love uh, House of Wax. Did that come out, like, 2005 or something? I think. We all good for now. Yeah, House of Wax was so good. Like, the effects, especially at the end of the movie. So I won't spoil it, but there's there's just kind of like structures and stuff kind of crumbling stuff. So good. Um, I'll tell you what I also think is another little hidden gem. Um, I actually really like Cloverfield. Some people didn't like it because it, 
you know, not to spoil things, but it just, um, it wasn't kind of that explained, and it just got, sort of leaves you to your imagination sort of thing. Nothing gets explained to you, really. Um, I think it's an, an actual gem, Cloverfield. Loved it. I wish I did another, really, but great little movie. I need to rewatch the latest Scream as well. You know, before I see the new one. Um, I'm going to go and watch that next Friday. Yeah, I'm going to take Mumsy to the cinema. I'm going to treat her. See Scream 6. Oh, shit! I see you! No! Every time! Every damn time. Oh, shit. Bros, please, bros. Don't do this to me. I love how the, the snake wasn't even phased by that. Oh, it doesn't matter. Use this. Oh! Shit! <laughs> I'm a cheeky egg. Oh, guys, it's Easter soon, isn't it? I'm actually buzzing for Easter, you know. Is that guy on roids? Jeez, man. Beautiful. Even on normal mode, honestly, man, there's like freaking hordes of them. Yeah, I remember thinking Hostel was quite, uh, quite graphic, quite gory when that came out. Hostel's good. I haven't seen the other ones. Cause there's quite a few in the hostile part, you know. Part two, three, four. There's, there's quite a few. Shit. Kick him off, Leon. Almost there. We've almost got him. It's a bit crazy. Yeah, I'm glad you agree, Craig. Uh, House of Wax is indeed a sick movie. You know what, I don't know. I can't remember. Um, I can't remember if Paris Hilton was in it, you know. I, d I just watched it and just had a, a rewatch, you know, after, after years. Years of uh, not seeing it. Come on. There we go. Uh-oh. Oh, not again. But after you, it's, it's just the sheer volume, man. Let's get a cheeky shotgun blast. Nice. I think we need to uh, let's get him down here. Really, we need him going through there, but it's a little awkward. Let's try and get the other side of it. Need to try and use the environment. Come on. Oh, follow Stella. There we go. <laughs> Beautiful. Beautiful. That's it. This way, this way. Man, there, there are a lot. Boom. There are a freaking lot. We need to be on the other side of that. Shit. Proper cornering us. Let's get on a higher level. I haven't actually done it. He said, have you noticed how small Easter eggs are this year? Not at all, mate. I haven't. Oh, man. I need some in the water. We'll get them. We'll get them. Keep, keep your grubby mitts off Leon. He does. He's our bird. <laughs> Come on. Oh! There are way too many. <laughs> it's actually getting crazy. I mean, you maybe don't have to get all of them. Maybe not. We get quite a few perceives, don't we? It's fine. I like to be quite thorough in this game. Nice. Let's get these. Oh! Ready for ya. Yes! Successful snake encounter. I think we're good. 
Leave those chilling. Let's get some of a snake. Bro, slow down. Slow down. Oh. Was it gone? It's actually disappeared. Yeah, it has. <laughs> it's dipped. Not that I know of, James. You said to see which have quick weapons select. I don't think so. Got another egg on the go, aren't we? There we go. What's up, Sammy? Thanks for being here. Said one of the most wonderful and beautiful games. Keep shining and creating. Appreciate it. Thank you for being here. So we got that path up there. Does this lead to... Yeah, I know where this is going. Let's see if there's any supplies up here. Man, that... Again, another real busy, intense encounter. It depletes of our supplies. It's a beautiful view. What up, what up? I think we got someone. We got someone. Hang on. I've got this up on my phone so I'll be able to see um, who's... Uh, I won't mess with the screen after what happened last time. It's the Lago. Yeah, I totally heard Kendo saying sorry about that. Hey, yo, what was it? Lord of Darkness subscribe. Thank you. Thanks so much, man. I appreciate you. There's loads of you guys in tonight. Thank you. Support is immense tonight. Yeah, it's just the way I've got this set up, um, if you guys want to hear earlier. So if anyone subscribes or anything, uh, super chats I can see within the live chat, they will pop up just as it comes up on screen. Uh, but any, um, yeah, subscribes, I will hear Kendo, but I won't see him because my game window is over my OBS. So I kind of have to rely on just quickly popping on my phone. It's a few seconds delayed. And then, um, yeah, obviously then I can see it. Let's get that get bare nest down. But yeah, I definitely will uh, acknowledge if you do subscribe and stuff. Thank you. Gold bangle with pearls. Hell yeah. Kiki David, what's up? Thank you for being here. Hope you're enjoying the stream. Uh, what's up, Derek? He's still in. He's still here, man. Damn, Daniel. He said, fax, this version still is amazing. It really is, man. Um, it, it really is a treat being able to play. Um, I'm actually playing this with the, the HD Project mod. This is a fan-made mod, and it actually took them eight years to make and perfect. It's from the ground up, and it, all the textures are upscaled, all to uh, high def. It's uh, unbelievable. It really is. I will do a little uh, save because I, I think we've got Del Lago in, in a second. It, it might be this part or just after. We've got Craig Canavan stopping back in. Thank you, man. He said back in here again. Welcome back. How's your night been? How's all you night guys' nights been? You've you been all good? Yeah, it is Del Lago right now. Wish me luck, guys. We're about to delve into Del Lago. Well, not literally. We ain't, we ain't been eaten by uh, Del Lago tonight. Yeah. Yeah, it, it, it is a little easier, I think, in the remake, Tyrell. Um, said it looks easier, you just click X to free from the grab, yeah, and then move the analog. It's more dist dist of a distraction when fighting, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's hard when, it, when you just go like that, and then you, you've got to reach there just really quickly, like, move the analog. Oh, bless you, Craig. Teething baby troubles. I hope uh, little Cody's doing all right. What's up, Ian Langford uh, said, looking forward to the remake, uh, since it's coming to PSVR 2 at a later date. Uh, yeah, that'll be incredible once they port that to the VR. It really will, man. It'll be so impressive. Um, getting the game on release date on flat screen. Uh, first played the Chainsaw demo, and it was fantastic. It, yeah, it really was uh, really is an impressive demo. Um, here we go with Del Lagos. And uh, thank you, said uh, you're doing really well. Thank you. And Kiki David said, I'd like to subscribe. I appreciate that. Thank you, Kiki David. 
Yeah, apologize if Bobby Kendo, uh, Robert Kendo from Mario 2, apologize if he doesn't acknowledge it. They don't always come through. Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. Uh, it's not something I have control over, it's just something to do with YouTube. But yeah, thank you guys. Really appreciate you. Oh. Oh, this is it, man. It, it's, it's real awkward. It's really awkward. Get them biceps moving, Leon. I, d I don't think we might rack up a death here. We might do, but I, I will try. Okay. It, it is a little awkward, boss. So, you know, it can be a little awkward at times. Just need to get a few decent shots on him. I know what way he's coming. That's it. We chose the right path. We chose the right way. That's good. That's good. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Uh oh. Oh. Oh, not again. No. What? Yeah, I think we're out. Are we out? One more and we're out. It's because we're on danger. Yeah. The Lagos food is fine. It, it is what it is. Um, it's easy to get deaths on this. It's not a problem. That's why I saved. <laughs> oh, sounds good, Danny. Said I had a curry for dinner, homemade. Nice. What kind of curry? I, I like a korma because I, I have to have like real mild food. I cannot handle spicy food. I know loads of you guys can. You proper flex with all your hot sauce. <laughs> Bro, even when I go to Nando's, I have a lemon and herb gal. I could not have spice. What's up, Gaffer Man? Uh, no, I didn't actually. Um, I didn't get offered. Uh, you have, you just have to keep playing the demo over and over, the RE4 remake demo, and then you'll get the. Um, uh, what's it called? Yeah, I know you said it's like a crazy chainsaw mode. It's like an extreme difficulty mode, and I kind of don't think I want that being offered to me. I'm quite happy to um, stay clear of that. Yeah, so I'm gonna stay clear of it, guys. Oh, let's go, let's go. Get him, get him, get him. Nice. Oh. Call him. Get the biceps out, let's go. Oh, that was me, I was being greedy, trying to get the shots in. We'll get it, we'll get it. What's up, Boulder Dash, C64? Stop it in. Hello, everyone. Just putting in a quick hello. Always awesome to hear from you, Boulder Dash. Thank you, man. I hope everything's going well for you. Loads of uh, the the regulars, the OGs. Got some new people in tonight. Appreciate you all. It's been such a fantastic reception tonight on this stream. It really has. Thank you. I'm absolutely super grateful. Super grateful, man. Oh, bro. Bro. How'd that not hit him? Honestly, Dan Lagos is having our pants down tonight. He's having Leon's Calvin's down. Calvin Classics. Come on, let's go. Oh, he's going to go missing. This is where he goes missing. you got to do this part like a few times. It's going to tell us. It's going to tell us when. It's going to tell us when. There we go. You there? We've got to nail this. Got it. That's right. It's, it's so intimidating. It's a great boss fight. It really is. Nice. GG's, guys. What's up, Alice? Thank you for stopping him. Come on, Leon. You, you've had a, like a dozen chicken eggs. <laughs> You had, you had loads tonight, bro. There ain't any excuse for lacking that protein. K 
kicked ass with Del Lagos. <laughs> GG, guys. Hell yeah. We did it. On to chapter two. Yeah, we'll go we'll go back in there. Override that one. Uh, Danny said I love Corba but had Tika. I, I like I like chicken tikka. Nice. Uh Craig as well uh, said I've made my homemade uh Chinese chicken curry last night. Awesome. Look at you all flexing your curries, man. I, I love a decent curry. I order those gusto meals where they send you the ingredients, you cook the meals. I always li literally have at least one curry or like Indian style dish every week, all the time. Love them. I love a good Indian takeaway as well. Proper feel posh when I have an Indian. Because <laughs> they're a bit pricey. Not now, Leon. We still got way, way longer to go in the stream. <laughs> since our last transmission i was starting to get worried don't you mean lonely <laughs> anyway i started to feel dizzy and then i guess i must have lost consciousness lost consciousness maybe that has some connection to what the village chief was talking about hmm. can't say but i'm all right now i'm gonna continue my mission awesome um thank you mega pork chop uh, this is nice jacket thank you um I was on about this earlier, it is not how it looked on the description. The the fur, it literally looks like Kel from Keenan Kel has drenched it in orange soda. It looks terrible. Um, like I said, the, the thumbnail, it's a lie. I've, I've totally photoshopped it and made it a bit more pale and more like the, the colour, obviously, of Leon's jacket. I'm going to return this after stream. Yes, I have the audacity to do that. Um, and uh, I've, I've got another one on order. I've got a, a better one from a trusted website. This is shite. This is so not good, man. It really isn't. Um, yes, as well. Yeah, Meg Porkchop. He said, I see Resident Evil 4 is on sale for £6.39 on the PlayStation Store. It is on offer. I don't know in other regions, but it is in the UK. Uh, I did notice that when I went to download the demo. I don't think it might be about £14.99 usually. I think it was something like that. Great discount on it, guys. Definitely get on it if you haven't already. Get a playthrough in of the original before the remake. Anonymous letter. There's an important item hidden in the falls. If you're able to get it, you might also be able to get Ashley out of the church. But I warn you, the route to the church isn't a walk in the park by any means. They've deployed what's called an El Gigante. So, God bless. About what's been going on in your body, if I could help you, I would. But unfortunately, it's beyond my power. It's fine, bro. Oh, shit. <laughs> Science will fix it. The, the jacket's like pretty bulky, so sometimes my wire's getting caught around to like adjust like my headset and my hair or anything. Yeah, it's cray cray. Uh, Gamer said, will you miss some of the quick time events in the remake? I will. Um, you know what I, I said earlier, I'm not too bothered about them. Um, I don't mind that much about them being taken out. I think it's probably for the best. Um... But then again, I, I kind of don't mind them that much in this because I feel like it, they don't overdo it with the quick time events. I, I kind of don't mind to an extent. So, um, yeah, I'm kind of like on the fence. Right, I think. I don't, wanna, I don't want the fish to go. If, if we have one more hit, then I'll take the first dead. I don't want to use the fish because it, it just looks nice in the inventory. <laughs> it looks nice, man. I want the fish to stay. Me too, Boulder Dash. Um... Yeah, he said, looking forward to uh, seeing the Ada missions in the new one. Hell yeah, I hope they do keep the separate, um, yeah, Ada's separate ways campaign and uh, her uh, Ada's assignment as well. That mode, that would be sick. It'd be so good. Um, right, if you guys can see, those blue flames are our second home. So we'll head over in uh, just a sec. I, th I think we'll probably go there first before we progress anywhere else. We came from here, right? We come from here. Yeah. Cool. Yep, we'll go see our, our bro first. Broski. Oh yeah. What's up, Nesta OG? And we got Peter as well. 
What's up, guys? Appreciate you. Uh, Danny said, what's your favourite dish to eat? So if you're on about Indian, right, there's, I discovered the other month, right, there's a real good Indian uh, ne nearish me, and um, they do a vanilla ice chicken korma. So it's, it's chicken cooked in uh, vanilla and coconut. Man, it is so nice. If if you want a sweet um a sweet Indian, yeah, that I usually get that. That is my go to now. It's so nice. So yeah, vanilla ice, uh, chicken korma, coconut rice, and a Peshwari naan. That is the ultimate, the absolute ultimate, uh, sweet Indian. So nice, man. Right, so we need to be heading. We'll go over to the merchant. And that is, is that our next area? Actually, it loops back on itself, that, doesn't it? Okay. Oh, man, I don't know if I, yeah, I don't know if I missed a little treasure there. So that's where we couldn't go. Yeah, we'll just head over to the merchant. Let's go to those blue flames. How have I just, oh, What's going on? Don't do this. That's it. <laughs> Tell me you got stuck then. I was like, what the hell? Stranger. He calls a stranger. We, we've, me, me, me and you guys, we go way back with this guy. Back to 2005. We go way back. You know what I love as well? Ashley doesn't seem anywhere near as annoying in the remake. I mean, she still obviously shouts for Leon and stuff, but she doesn't sound anywhere near as annoying. So again, I think they've listened to the fans. Because if you ask anyone, right, what is your worst part of this game? Like, what's your worst thing about this game? For me, it's Ashley. Ashley's screaming and wailing how helpless she is. I, I know she's a young girl and stuff, but... It seems like she can take care of herself a little more in this remake. Um, so yeah, I think they've done a decent job by the looks of it from what we've seen uh, on the gameplays. Nice green gem. Cool. So I'm really pleased about that. That's another thing I'm, I'm real happy about. I think they've, they've nailed, like, um, you know, getting the balance right with Ashley because she's still quite fearful. But um, she does actually kind of follow you around and make herself useful sort of thing. She does kind of explore things. things on sale, stranger. What are you selling? What are you selling? Is that all? <laughs> he must be like one of the most loved Ari characters, the merchant. Don't you think, guys? How can you not love this guy? Ah. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. I think that goes in like an elegant mask, I think. So we'll keep them, obviously. You need one more uh, gemstone for the base time. What are you buying? No more attaché cases of yet. No riot gun yet. That's fine. What are you buying? Nothing else we can do right now. Got almost 100k Pesidas as well, so we're in a decent position. Uh, James said, did you see the info about the final size of RE4 Remake being twice the size of Village? That sounds like lots of content. Yeah, definitely. Um, I think, I if we can get back there. Because that, that's that merchant's area into the save bit, yeah. We'll be round there anyway, I think, because we've got to go back for El Gigante, haven't we? Um, yeah, it's like, isn't it some like 63 gigabyte or something? That's crazy. Um, I know that Mercenaries, that's not actually there on day one. So I, I don't know when that's dropping. I've got to say that, that is really disappointing because uh, you want that available on day one, right? You know, for as soon as you complete the campaign, you want to go straight to the Mercenaries. I mean, come on. Unless they've still got work to do on it, maybe. You know, tweaking it, making sure the multiplayer is all good. I think there's going to be multiplayer in that, because the, um, the game has been rated for multiplayer as well. So, um, yeah. I think you'll at least be able to do uh, multiplayer mercenaries. Uh-oh. The mutations have begun, guys. Um, yeah, and I think another thing would be awesome... Um, if you could do a co-op in uh, with with the Leon and Lewis parts, that'd be awesome. But I think uh, I think most likely you'll be uh, able to uh, 
co-op on, on mercenaries for sure. Please don't mutate, bro. Don't do it to us. Don't do it. Nice. See, it took us quite a few shotgun hits. It's just because we haven't tuned anything up. Because uh, I'm just waiting it out at the minute. Oh, let's reload that up. It's just I'm waiting out until we get that riot gun. And then, uh, yeah, I'll crank that right up. so enjoyable to go back to this game it really is guys um thank you all for being here i appreciate it it's honestly the, the support tonight has been immense on this stream uh, if, if you're enjoying it, if you don't mind dropping us a cheeky like just keep the momentum going keep it going good in the youtube algorithm appreciate a like on the video thank you guys come on one like for the merchant <laughs> you're telling me this guy doesn't deserve a like <laughs> Let's go. No, it's, an, it's an honour you guys, uh, you know, you choose to spend your Saturday evening chilling on stream with me. Thank you. Oh, where did that come from? Holy shit. Bro, bro. He's up there, I think. Let's get him down. <laughs> oh, nice. Yeah, Tyrell Angel said there's a skin for Ashley's armor, so she's immune for damage. Um, yeah, I think that's on special costume number two because I I was contemplating whether to have a special costume on or not, but I still opted to have uh, the OGs. Because obviously I, I needed to be matching with Leon because I went all out with uh, with the jacket tonight. So we needed to be matching with him, you know. I'm glad you think so, Danny. You said it's a relaxing stream. I don't think it's that relaxing. <laughs> no, it kind of is, honestly. Um, I, I like uh, watching um, people play Resi streams. Like, it relaxes me, generally. Yeah. Right, so you need to stop that water. So go in, there, go in that cave. Take a look what's up here before we go across. So, Mega Pork Chop dropping the quote. I knew you'd be safe if you landed on your butt. I wonder if they'll keep that in the remake. Um, when was that said? I can't remember that, uh, Pork Chop. I totally can't remember that. Oh, I think, is there another, is there another crate up there? Oh, Spinal. Oh, it ain't. Hang on. Oh, an amber ring. Nice. We love Leon that much. We put a ring on him. Oh, no. They definitely got rid of the uh, Ashley, you pervert line. They definitely got rid of that. There's no way you'd be able to get away with that nowadays. I remember, genuinely, um, I didn't find out about that like through my own experience or anything. I actually found out via YouTube videos and I, honestly I thought it was a mod I thought someone had modded that I couldn't believe that that was actually in the game I thought wow that that's really controversial you know uh, I mean I know I know it's humor I, I get it I, I've laughed I've laughed at it before I get it um, but I couldn't believe they actually included that I, I totally thought it was a mod in all honesty I thought someone had, had, had modded that um, but no, that that's not in uh, the remake. And also the uh, Lewis, when he says, um, I see the president's equipped his daughter with some ballistics. Um, that's obviously a, a bit of a controversial comment. Um, that's removed as well. Yeah, they're about to tone things like that down. And it, it, understandably so. But you've still got it in the original, you know. <laughs> it is what it is. What's that? Where is that at? Oh, who subscribed? Who subscribed? I've just heard Bobby Kendo. Let me just get the stream up on my phone a sec. Just keeping an eye out a second. 
I just want to be able to thank you. I can't see this on my uh, on my own screen, you see. Uh, yeah, Tyrell Angel, thank you, bro, for subscribing. I appreciate you. Thank you. If I could, if I could do the merchant's voice, I would do the whole <laughs> thank you. I'd do, I'd do it if I could. He probably. Oh shit! Shit! Off me! Off me! Oh shit! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh! I was spamming. I was spamming. I couldn't do it. <laughs> there was too many of us, guys. Have you not ever watched Titanic? There was definitely not going to be enough space for all your asses. <laughs> you cheeky bastards! <laughs> all right, that's fine. It's fine. I should have moved my ass off that. I wanted to make my way over to get that, um, to get that, uh, treasure over there. It's fine. We'll get it. I'll just have to, like, proper dash across. Ooh. What's up there? It's really in the time. <laughs> it, to it totally in the time to be doing this, but you know me, guys. You know I like to push the limit. Push it to the limit. Limit! Man, I, I love Scarface. I think we need to stream... Who would be up for that if I stream Scarface on PS2? I really want to stream that. I don't know whether to... Um... Yeah, let's just go past him. Let's go. Because we've got enough Posadas, I don't think we need any more drama. I think we should just go. I ain't dealing with it. We're not gonna take it. No, we ain't gonna take it. Hell no. <laughs> I've been listening to a lot of uh, the GTA uh, soundtracks uh, nowadays. So obviously that's the insignia we can use on the church. Um, yeah, I played a little bit of Vice City the other night, actually. The remastered trilogy. Got it. Jeez, we've been streaming a few hours now. I'll definitely stay on stream for like another like hour or two, definitely. We'll get some more stream time in. I'm so grateful to be able to stream tonight because I'd really love to be able to stream on, like, say, Friday, Saturday, Sunday nights. It's kind of peak time for us all because it's when people, most people are free, you know. So it's really nice not to be at work this weekend and uh, be able to stream. It's fantastic, guys. It really is. What are you selling? What are you selling? Spinels, as always. <laughs> Thank you. An old ring. I can always feel the history behind this jewelry. I just hope that there's some value to it. I'll tell you what, I bet when it's a married couple, the missus dumped him because he's spending too much time and too much money on video games. That's what the historic story is. <laughs> Thank you. What are you buying? Nothing else new. Nothing new. I think we good. What are you buying? <laughs> Tyrell, when you change weapons, say hello to my little friend. <laughs> Yeah, I love that line from Scarface. I want to go back to it, and uh, I'd, I'd love to probably stream it if you guys are up for that. I think it'd be cool. It'd be cool to uh, replay it. Right, I think it is time. I don't know if it'll kind of make an automatic checkpoint here, but I'm just going to save it just to be sure, just so we've got a, a save point here. All right, so let's quickly... Um, it's our little tight rider. Absolute classic. Oh, nice. Nice, James. That, that is another classic. I, I haven't seen it in so long. It, it, it has been some years since I've seen that. Uh, James said, It's funny you mentioned Scarface. I've been watching Kali O's Way today. Awesome. Man, you, you make me want to watch it now. The um oh man the 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 soundtrack to Scarface is so good. I like Shake It Off. I like that um that song Shake It Off. Oh shake it off tonight. So good. 
I can't sing, but I'll still do it anyway. Um, tell you what movie I've, I haven't seen in years, which I love. Kevin Costner is in this. Uh, the Untouchables. Really good. Also, I like the movie Blow with Johnny Depp. Um, that you know, it's real like drug, drug related and stuff. Um, obviously, it becomes in, in the world of, of that. So good, such a good movie. Um, my favourite movie of all time is Goodfellas. Here he is, El Gigante. Let's go. I think we've got a couple of grenades. This is another boss fight, man. Um, it really is good. It's probably my second favourite, actually. I remember the, the sense of dread. Every time I, I get up to this part, you, you just know it's coming. I love being able to jump on his back and slice in the, you know, the mutated uh, plagas. It's, it's so good. It really is. Um, right, we'll kick it off with a flash grenade. We'll get some, get some shots on him. I say that, guys, it's not, it's not the absolute best, this, because um, we haven't got it upgraded. Shit. <laughs> oh. <laughs> right, hang on. If we go... Let's quickly pop in a cab in a sec. Oh shit, I meant to reload, sorry. Cool. Oh. Shit. Wow. Oh, how was he taking us out? I'll do that, then it'll increase our health permanently. Well, the amount of our health. There we go. We're doing okay. We've got a lot of green herbs. We'll get it. We'll get it. Use that air grenade. Oh, shit. Oh, nice. There we go. That's what you need, bro. That's what you need. Let's go. Let's go. Go on, Leon. I, I love this part of the boss. It's so good. It actually makes you feel kind of dominant over him. Do you know what I mean? Like, you're in control of the guy. So you're the one that's slashing it. Doggo! Doggo! Hey, dog? This is so cute. It's the cutest partnership. Hey, it's that dog. It's too good. Let's get some shots on his back. Try and get that uh, plague set, I suppose. Go, 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 go! Whoa! Shit, shit! Go on, doggo. Distract him. Go on, doggo. Nice. Right in the booty. Oh, shit! I, I always push it. I'm always really greedy with my shots. I'm so greedy. I need to reload, so if I just get a couple of quick shots on. Quickly reload this. Yeah, definitely not, um, James. That thing wouldn't be out of place in God of War. <laughs> I've actually not played those games, but I imagine anything goes in them. For sure. That's it. Go, 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 go. The doggo is a massive help. If you don't save the doggo at the beginning, like, I dread to think how you'd... I mean, the, the boss would be possible, but no way near as, as bearable. <laughs> the doggo really is Leon's best friend. The cutest partnership ever. Really enjoyable boss this. It is great. Please let me know who, who is your favourite boss in this game. Or favourite bosses. Let me know. When I say who's your favourite boss, don't say the missus. I'm on about Resident Evil 4. <laughs> Give us a sweet Pasidas. 15 grand for some El Gigante booty. Ain't even wearing his Calvin Classics for you guys on stream tonight. <laughs> He's wearing the dirtiest duds ever. He's not even dressed up for you guys tonight. <laughs> What's up, Stuart Burrell? Uh, said, this is my game in shame. Never managed to beat this originally. Not very good at games. That's alright, man. Even if you haven't got to the end of it, it's, it's still still fun to play. It's literally 
as long as you have fun playing the game, even if you don't complete it, as long as you have fun, that's literally all, um, literally all that matters, generally. Right, so we'll heal up. We'll just have a little, we'll have a little green hair, I think. That's it. We'll treat ourselves. We'll combine that up. Nice. Let's move that over. Nice. We look, we're looking alright. I think it's around the the castle part. That's when I usually get the rifle. You know when they've got the um, the cannons and stuff firing the uh, you, you know like the the fires and, and all that. Is, yeah, that that's when I usually get them to take them out. Take the the people manned manning the cannons. Usually buy it then. Oh, nice Tyrell. Yeah, the guy soldier boss, my favourite Krauser. That's not a bad boss fight. Is like. Once you click on that, um, I would like to just go this way just to get that treasure. Let's pop through here for a sec. Um, yeah, once you click on that, you can just you can defeat him just with the knife. I didn't realise I was struggling so bad. I was really struggling. Oh shit! Have I left a load of enemies here? What the fuck's going on? This is awful. <laughs> I didn't realize I was going back into this. The fuck? Yeah, you should play with fire, bro. <laughs> uh, Enes Erin says hello. What's up? Thank you for being here. And who else we got? Uh, we got Lobo Wolf as well. What's up? Thank you guys for stopping by the stream tonight. Um, yes, gamer. I think the doggo will be uh, in the remake. Um, I don't know if you noticed, but um, did you see the dead doggo in in the demo? Um, there's a dead doggo, but I don't believe that's the OG doggo. In all honesty, I, th I think there is actual uh, live live doggo. Do you guys remember? Um, speaking of that, James, he said inventory tech. Tetris. It, it really is awesome in it. The uh, the inventory system in this. I'm so glad they've kept it in the remake. I, th I think they knew they had to. Knew they had to do that. <laughs> um, do you guys remember when I played the save game? The what was it? Save. Come what? The inventory game. I can't, I can't remember what the title of my video is. Um, it's the inventory game or something hang on if i look re for inventory yeah that's what it's called it's called the save room inventory game i have done a stream of that it was like 10 months ago now but it is an actual game guys it is literally it was like a couple of quid off steam um it's not on consoles i'm afraid but it is on steam and obviously there's myself and other people who have uh, obviously played and streamed this resident evil save room inventory game and it, yeah it gives you a load of stuff and you have to pack it into um your attache case and you have to make everything fit you've got like limited number of space you've got to combine items and everything uh, i completed all the levels on it on stream it, that was really fun it was really fun yeah if i have time um like if if i can fit another stream in the schedule um I, I will stream it uh again for you guys so we can like relive it if you fancy that could definitely do that let's have a look at that map a second yeah it's only through here i just want to pick it up it's, oh man maybe i shouldn't have gone here hang on oh no oh fuck i forgot totally forgot i need to reload Bollocks. <laughs> I had it lined up perfect. We're not even getting anything for these kills either. Let's just find this treasure then we'll, we'll be gone. Um, right, so if we go this way, I'll try avoiding the best I can. Somewhere over there. I really don't want to come, come back here and start losing health. So it's just round here. It must be, I think it's like in a box or something. It must be. Oh, is it here? Got it. Can't miss it. We can't miss them, guys. Antique pipe. I literally thought I was going to have my pants down and say that I've come all this way for a spinal. It's fine. Got all of the uh, 
Spinels in it. I, I usually call them spinels, I think. Yeah, I know, Faisal. <laughs> totally forgot the reload there, man. Oh, it's my own fault for, uh, yeah. I'm just thinking too much. Oh, shit. Nice. Got it. Got a few new items as well. Did we get that? Where did the egg go? Bro. There was literally an egg there. I don't know where it went. Is there anything else? I, I think we're good. I'm, I'm not messing around. I literally just wanted to come back for that treasure. Um, yes, Tyrell. Yeah, I do play the Silent Hill games. Was that anything? Oh, it's just reading the sign, I think. Yeah. Yeah, I definitely want to stream all the Silent Hill games. Um, I just need to do another play for... I, I did one the other month. Uh, I need to do another play for of the original, like the absolute OG Silent Hill before I stream it. Because I need to make sure I can do a smooth stream. Otherwise you guys will see me backtracking everywhere and it, it won't be fun. <laughs> well, you might laugh, but it kind of won't be a fun stream. Um, right, so yeah, we're through here now. Right, so we've got everything, haven't we? Just double checking, we've got all the items and stuff. So Game said, have you ever thought about doing a Resi Evil gaming marathon for charity? Start at Resi One, see how far you can get. Um, so I'd, I'd love to do like the OG Resident Evil trilogy. That'd be cool. And like the remake trilogy as well. I'd like to do the, the first three of each. That'd be really cool, man. Um, and yeah, I... I I, w I do love giving to charity, but at the same time, I'm I'm not sure because at the same time, I kind of don't really like kind of... I know it's in a good way and it's for a good cause. I don't like pushing for money, if that makes sense. Um, maybe if, if my following like increases and stuff, but I just want to be careful. I really don't like pushing or pressuring anyone for money, if, if that makes sense. Oh, man, we could do some grenades for these doggos, but these are bad doggos. Freaking bad doggos. Look at him staring us out. Oh! Shit. Oh, fuck. Oh! Oh, guys, they're so scary. Fuck. They're so scary. Shit. Oh, man. Look at them fangs. Bro. Bro. Oh, my God. They're scary as hell. Fuck. I'm trying to wait it out before we use that. I, I might have to use it, I think, maybe. I hope we got a key for that, did we? Yeah, over oh, from the other side. It's fine. Um, but yeah, I'd probably do... Um, I'll, I'll probably schedule one, definitely at some point this year. I think we'll definitely... We'll do, like, a trilogy marathon. Um... But yeah, I'll, I'll probably do it just, just as a, a chill thing, I think. So we we can obviously make it in the church now because we've got the key. Hell yeah. Was that, a, was that a treasure nearby? Is it in the church? There is one in there, isn't there? In the, oh yeah, it's just there. That's fine. Cool. Right, I think we're good for the minute. <laughs> no more bad doggos. Like, I can't be dealing. Let's go get Ashley. Oh, guys, babysitting duty starts shortly. <laughs> uh, James says where does this take place is it like a remote part of Spain it's not a tourist hotspot yeah it, it must be some remote part of Spain um, I, I know it is in Spain um, I'm not sure exactly whereabouts is it down here yeah sort of bow up uh, Dano said uh, did you watch Book Pursuit complete Invisible enemies mode in Iron One Remake. He made it look so easy. Nice. I, I didn't see that stream of his. Um, honestly, I I think as far as Ari goes, Bork for Soup, he, he is the go. He, he really is. And it, he does make things look easy. Like I've watched him play like Resident Evil mods. Like, for example, there's one called Code Nightmare. And it's like in the Resi 2 kind of engine. I've streamed it. I've streamed it twice. I did a blind playthrough and then I had to quit when it... Um, kind of glitched out then i streamed it again and i like i completed it we went all the way through it but i needed to put it on unlimited ammo uh i watched it and i thought oh yeah i'll be able to do that bork made it look so easy and uh yeah <laughs> I, I had to get it on unlimited ammo it was difficult it really was man but yeah bork is it he's 
unbelievably talented at resi he really is like the modes he plays and his speed runs um i, I literally can't praise the guy enough he, he is real um real enjoyable to watch look at that uh the saddler being so vain i know you said james you'd like that on a t-shirt i think that'd be sick on a black t-shirt and even even just a portrait a high quality print of that or like one with like that grainy sort of effect that'd be sick it's so good it's a great picture that i like this puzzle as well this, this one's a good one no worries danny he said i'm off now host a bit of pleasure time to depart my viking ship <laughs> no worries man thank you for docking here for a while tonight appreciate you being here So move through it with the red. I think that looks about right. Take a look at green. That looks good. I think that's right. Great little puzzle. I like the colour purple Tyrell. My favourite colour is actually baby pink. I, I love baby pink, so I have lots of baby pink clothes. You wouldn't think so, because I'm, I'm absolutely not like proper girly or anything, but love baby pink. Ashley. Don't come. <laughs> hey, take it easy. Everything's going to be just fine. My name's Leon. I'm under the president's order to rescue you. What? My father? That's right. And I have to get you out of here. Now come with me. That's it, guys. Just signed ourselves up to uh, Leon's daddy, Dacre. It's Leon. I've succeeded in extricating my subject. Good work, Leon. I'll send a chopper over right away. Where's the extraction point? There's another trail that you can take to get out of the village. The chopper will pick you up beyond there. Got it. I'm on my way. Get to the chopper! Tyrell says hello to annoying girl. That's not a very nice way to talk about me. <laughs> I'm kidding. You talk about Ashley, right? I hope so. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding, man. We all know. We all feeling the same pain tonight. <laughs> Yeah, I agree. I agree, James. This game needs Barry Burt and he'd sort them all out. You you don't have any nonsense if Barry Burt was here. I have this. <laughs> ready is awesome. You guys ready for the line? I, I'm just doing it for you guys because we won't get this in the remake. Oh, you pervert. There you go. We didn't see the animation, though. Or do you need to be closer? It's so... Hey, what are you looking at? It's so big of what we're doing. <laughs> but yeah, that, that is what we won't be getting in the remake. I, I couldn't believe that's in the actual game. I'll take the girl. Unless you thought it was fans you? messing around. If you Lord know. Sadler! My name is Osman Sadler. The master of this fine... What do you want? To demonstrate to the whole world our astounding power, of course. No longer will the United States think they can police the world forever. So, we kidnapped the president's daughter in order to give her our power and then send her back. No. Leon, I think they shot something in my neck. What did you do to her? We just planted her a little gift. Oh, there's going to be one hell of a party when she returns home to her loving father. <laughs> but before that, I thought I might bargain with the president for some donations. 
believe it or not, it takes quite a lot of money to keep this church up and running. Faith in money will lead you nowhere, Sadler. Oh, I believe I forgot to tell you that we gave you the same gift when I was unconscious. Oh, I truly hope you like our small but special contributions. When the eggs hatch, you will become my puppets. Involuntarily, you'll do as I say. I'll have total control over your mind. Don't you think this is a revolutionary way to promulgate one's faith? Sounds more like an alien invasion if you ask me. Good choice. You okay? Uh, Leon, what's gonna happen to us? Don't worry. We got into this mess, we can get out of it. Uh. There we go. Nice little shot, Leon and Ashley there. But no, I think they've, um, they've done a decent job with Ashley. I think in the remake, as in her uh, outfit, I think she looks a bit less kind of immature and a bit more elegant, if that makes sense. Yeah, I agree with you, El Rambo. Leon's one-liners are great. They really are. Yeah, he's a uh, very stu 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 pretty. He's very classy, but still like cheesy in this. And I think they've kept a little cheese in the remake. I think. Um, yeah, that would be incredible, Dano. If only. Yeah, when you kill the chainsaw dude, why can't you take his chainsaw? It would be awesome mowing down. Uh, yeah, the um. The Ganados with a chainsaw. You never know. I wonder if it makes me think now you said that actually, Dano. Like, could you actually, could we actually do that in the remake? Oh shit, shoot him, yeah. <laughs> For some reason. Oh shit. Oh, shit. Blow fire at Ashley. Oh, he did as well. GG, good man, good man. <laughs> no. You're doing it, me. You do it, at Ashley, that's fine. She's already on caution. First fucking encounter. Bro, I need you to try and I need him to try and breathe fire, then we can shoot him. <laughs> um, but you notice in the demo, you can't actually kill the chainsaw guy. As far as I know, someone told me that when I was streaming it, and obviously, I never got to kill the chainsaw guy. So the, the bell always went off, the bingo bell. Um, so it makes me wonder. Do you think they might actually give us control of the chainsaw? Maybe not, but it's still thought. You never know. So we're still going into unknown territory in this remake. You don't know everything about it. I am treading lightly on social media, so I am also warning you guys as well. There has been leaks of the game. I know, obviously, we've seen gameplay and, you know, trailers and things like that. I know Capcom been very generous in what they've showcased so far. But there's been, apparently, a lot of spoilers and leaks going on. Just about checking this. I can't remember if there was pickups around here. It's around some of these back graves. I can't remember. I don't know where I've got this from, but I just had a feeling. I'm not sure. No, maybe not. Because, um, yeah, apparently... Um, I don't know what it was. It's like a French company or some kind of... Some company have, like, leaked them to a retailer or something. There's images going around online with people with the actual game in their hands. It's crazy. Um, but, yeah, I need to, tre need to tread carefully, man. Because we, we, know, we know so much about this game. We don't want any more spoil, you know. Right, so we've done all that area. So, yeah, I think we are we are tracking back, I think. I think so. Let's have another look. Yeah, I'll take we're going there, up there, and then into this whole area, I think. I love how Ari Falls a huge game. It's a real lengthy game. Uh, we've got Jack Dolan Jr. What's up, man? Uh, he said, hey, how's it going? It's going awesome, thank you, Jack. We've had an absolute... Um, Awesome stream tonight. Immense reception from everyone. So uh, thank you all for being here. Really appreciate you. Oh, bro. I'm happy to Welcome. see you. It's always a pleasure. Got some rare things on sale, stranger. What are you selling? See what we're selling. So we'll go with the TMP. Um, Is that all? Spinels, <laughs> antique pipe. Cool. Thank you. 
Um, what are you buying? There is the red nine there. I am good at the minute though. I'm gonna wait for that. Um, wait for that right gun to come up. What are you buying? Can't shoot at the Punisher is boss. We'll do that. <laughs> is that all? <laughs> Thank you. Nice. Come back any time. It really is gamer. Like I, I hate um how things get ruined for others. They really do. If you don't watch something or play something, you know, within a certain amount of time, like it just gets ruined for you. It, it's a shame, man. I know, Dano. I thought that for a while. He said I haven't seen Dave Hedgehog in a while. Yeah, we've got a uh, one. One of our my subscribers. Uh, he's one of the regulars. Oh, he was anyway. Mister Dave Hedgehog. Um, and he's got Dave Hedgehog from bottom as his profile picture. Uh, yeah, he's a real nice guy, and he pops in a bit. But um, we've not seen him online in months. So Dave Hedgehog, wherever you are, I hope you're well, man. I, I really do. Um, I, I do genuinely, I, I, I do care about, like, you guys. Like, I get quite concerned if I haven't heard from some people in a while. You, you just do, you know? You can get a little concerned. just want everyone to be all right. But, you know, I, I appreciate all you guys, even if you're coming in to chill or you, you literally... Some people just drop in to say, hey, you know, if they're busy. They'll just say, hey, not stopping, but what's up, you know? It's nice of people. It's nice. That's so I think we're heading. It's so eerie coming back to uh, come back to this area. I ain't messing around. Oh no! Oh, you're kidding. No, 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 no. Oh no! I'm gonna have to sacrifice some health for this bitch as well. Ashley is literally, she is living up to um. Oh bollocks! Oh, we ran the wrong way, bro. Oh, bro, it's all because of her. I was literally going the right way to that gate. Fuck. I might just let her die, just so, just so uh, it makes me happy. <laughs> right. Just give me a sec. She ain't having that fish. We're having it. It's our tea. No! Oh, it's my own fault. I, I just didn't want to mess around. I just wanted to take her out. It's fine. It's my own fault, that. Well, it's Ashley's fault. She got caught in the fucking bear trap. Right, let's let's sort out that bear trap a second. Very well placed, I've got to say. Very well placed. Blow it, Ashley, not me. Oh, shit. Oh, bollocks. If we just... That's it. If we just... Is there some pickups around here? Shit. Oh, Bollocks. Ashley, it's in the time. Oh, this girl's killing me. Right, I'm off. I'm going. <laughs> this is so bad. I, I can't deal. Look at her health. There's nothing. You're not having this fish. It's mine. You, The best you're having is a green herb. I ain't using anything else on you. <laughs> See how my mood has, has changed? I'm a nice person, but... It comes to Ashley. Asshole. Right. I don't want to leave a right back here because I, th I think uh, I think you're kind of asking for it. I don't know where we're going. Have we got any key items? I can't actually remember what we're doing. Um, we must be able to get in one of these, I think. So it must be that one on the left. Okay, so if we go... If we go up here. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Fuck. We're going to have to take them all out, I think. It's, it's traps galore, man. Let's shoot them down, so... Shit. Oh, I missed the thing. This, this ain't going well. I think we needed to leave her actually. Um, don't worry, let's, let's go back. Honestly, everything's fine up until we get her. <laughs> it really is. Get in here. Follow me. Hi. Trashly. In the trash where you belong. Right, let me take all these out, or else we can't do anything. There are actually new pickups to get, aren't there? So. 
We need to be, uh, we need to be on it. Shit. Go on, go to breathe the fire. Oh, nice. Damn the load. Nice. Scared of Oh no! No! Freaking rude. It's so rude. We'll soon play him, guys. Oh, you as well? You're freaking showing off. You're just showing off on stream tonight. Oh, nice. I thought he was actually going to be tight. Right, well, let's make sure we got everything. Because, yeah, obviously new things have uh, respawned. Because if they hadn't, I'd, obviously I'd just uh, I'd rush on. Oh, nice. Sarah and the third party. The whereabouts of Sarah are still unknown. So this is Lewis. Most likely he's using an old secret passage taught to him by his grandfather who used to hunt in this region long ago. I'm pretty certain that he's hiding our property somewhere in the forest. If his grandfather was still alive, I would have used him to find Sarah. But how did he find out about the egg injected into his body? And the fact that he was able to remove it before it hatched is concerning. Another factor that concerns me is that Sarah escaped with our property just before the American agent arrived. I don't believe that was just a coincidence. There has to be another player involved in this. In order to settle this whole situation, we have to capture Sarah and wait for the effects of the drug to wear off before we inject him with another egg. Once this is done, Whoever is behind all of this will surface. Nobody shall interfere with our plans. Those who do shall suffer severe consequences. Oh, bless you, Dano. Said, uh, I like to play my Switch with you your streams in the background, but it's charging. Oh, man. How, how much longer are you going to leave it? Do you think you'll be able to jump on it soon? I hope it'll be done soon for you, Dano. What was you going to play? Yeah, I think I mentioned this on a previous stream. I, I don't show my Switch anywhere near em em enough uh, love um, as, as I should do. It's, it's just because of the sheer lack of time. That's all it is. Because I'm, like, real busy streaming. Um, and also, I've just um, not really been travelling about uh, lately. I mean, the only time I'd use it travelling is if I was on a train or on a flight. And I never get trains anywhere. Because if, if I go anywhere in the UK, whether it's literally half an hour or five hours, I will drive. Because I, I hate using public transport. I love having um, just the luxury of going in my own car, you know. I like to uh, be able to drive myself, have the tunes on. I love my own space, you know. So, yeah, my time, you know, my opportunities to play is pretty limited, really. I don't get enough time on my breaks at work. So we get, like, 45 minutes. If we're on a 12-hour shift, then anything under a 12-hour, like, 8- or 10-hour shift, we get 30 minutes and... It's not much, like, I can only barely just eat my dinner in time. <laughs> so I can't really play at work um, on breaks or anything. Uh, what's up, Newham Duck? We've had loads of new names in tonight. Um, thank you to you guys. Uh, thanks for saying hello. And, you know, for anyone uh, just chilling incognito without commenting, shout out to you all. Thank you for being here. So I do have people who, who say, you know, I, I was in the stream, I just didn't feel like commenting. And that's absolutely fine. I get that. Sometimes um, sometimes I watch streams without commenting because I, I literally just like to sit and watch uh, sometimes. I might be a bit tired to keep track of a live chat and, you know, be commenting. Or sometimes I just say hey, but I'm there. We've had loads in tonight. Like, we've, we've had a sick stream. I really appreciate you all. I really do. To get those figures, really, after, like, only a year of, like, streaming myself, like, it, it's really good for my channel really good for us guys we've got loads of the regulars in the ogs we've had a lot of new people really appreciate you all uh, right stay there stay i just want to get a few headshots in Nice. I was just waiting for that noise to see if it'd mute it. I don't think so. I think we're good. I take it this is the way we're going because there's all the traps. Let's go, Trashley. Bro. You guys are insane. Newham Duck. 
all the way from East London. He said East London in the building. What's happening, Gavna? Hope you're all well, man. I love London. It's chaotic, man, travelling around, but um, I love visiting and going places. I really do. And you know, I think the last time I went to London, it was literally just before the um, release of RE2 Remake. I'm going this way. You, you can't operate a ladder. Why would we need to catch you? You just literally need to make way down a ladder. Um, yeah, so they, they did a pop-up event in London. And it's basically like kind of a, a zombie experience slash escape room. I actually made a video of this. I wasn't allowed to actually film within the event, but I filmed like the build-up of it. Me and Alex, my best mate, played the demo just before we went in. It was about 10 or 15 minutes, this kind of escape room. We was in with a few other people. Um, oh, yeah, we get to piggybacker over there. Um, and then, yeah, we got to chill in the Raccoon City bar at the end. And the Raccoon beer, right? I've still got the beer bottle. Guess what it was? It's a fucking pale ale. Bro, I don't know if any of you guys like pale ale, but I thought it was minging. Oh, it was so minging, man. I just had to down it and then just get another beer. But at least I had a Raccoon City beer, you know? I just needed to down that to uh, be able to keep the beer bottle for the collection, which I did. Um... So yeah, it was it was a good event, man. It was good. Um, but yeah, I think that was the last time I went to London. Thank you, Boulder Dash, for still being here, man. Um, he said, still here, going to make a coffee. Nice. Welcome. I'm a massive coffee lover, man. I love coffee. I've, I've got G Fuel tonight, though. Good things on sale, so I've got... I've actually used my Resident Evil Village Shaker. Because I thought it would be... Um, I thought it'd be quite fitting, really, obviously, because we fight our way through a village with the Ganado, so I thought, oh, the village shaker. I've actually got a Doom um, flavour tonight. I really love it. It's sour demonade, so it's like a sour lemonade. It's really nice. Oh, sounds good, Dan. I play playing uh, Breath of the Wild at the moment. Nice. What are you selling? I've been meaning to go back to that. I played the first few hours, but I just got distracted what are you uh, by other games. I don't think there's anything on offer for us. What are you buying? No, I think we're good for now. Come back anytime. Leon, I have some bad news. I'd rather not hear it. Get to the chopper! I have to tell you anyway. We've lost contact with the chopper. Someone must have shot it down. Bollocks! <laughs> Great. We're prepping another chopper for you. Meanwhile, I want you to head towards the extraction point. Got it. Man, we have some solid views in tonight. Thank you, guys. If, if you're enjoying the stream, if you don't mind just dropping it a cheeky like, it helps it do well in the YouTube algorithm uh, amongst the videos. Thank you. What are we going to do, Leon? I hate to say it, but we're sandwiched, all right. Quick, in that cabin. <laughs> Lewis, hell yeah. Leon. Small world, eh? Well, I see that the president's equipped his daughter with ballistics, too. How rude. And I don't believe there's any relevance with my figure and my standing. Who are you? Oh, oh excuse me, your highness. Perhaps the young lady might want to introduce herself first before asking someone his name. Her name's Ashley Graham, the president's daughter. Is she? Well, you know. Don't worry. She's cool. Eh, never mind. She ain't cool. It's supposed to be some kind of obvious symptom before you turn into one of them anyway. <gasps> Look! Ashley, upstairs! Okay. It's game time. It's game time. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Push it real good. Da, 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 da. Let's go, let's go. Let's get the pickups. Let's go upstairs. Hell yeah. Barricade these. Nice. It really is, James. It really is hard mode, man. Uh, I have no idea, um, I've no idea Tyrell, I, I don't know why uh, we drive on the left side in the UK. <laughs> don't know why, we just do. 
Right. Ash is hiding in here. Everyone, go in there. Go in there. Right. They're going to be coming in. I don't want to leave up here unguarded, really. Oh, they're here. Use this. Thanks, bro. Use this. use this. Use this. Thanks for taking care of us. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Right, so we need... I think, I think we'll have a little incendiary. Oh, shit. Nice. <laughs> so hectic. So hectic. Has Lewis got a red nine? He must have. Absolute pickup galore in here. It's great. So good. Oh, man, it's mutated. Shit. I think he's mutated this one just here. Is he? No. Yeah. No, I thought he had done. Okay. Oh, he's there. There. Shit. Right, what we got? We'll use this because obviously it'll uh, increase our max health there. Uh, yeah, I, I, I would like to new him, Duck. Um, I think it would be pretty cool. Uh, there is a, a site called Restream and you can hook up several socials on there. So it would be cool to stream on here and Facebook and Twitch at the same time. Um, I've, I've generally been considering that. Yeah, I think it'd be really cool to do that. I'd, it's just I'm friends with other YouTubers. I kind of don't want to tread on their toes, if you get me. I don't want to kind of get on their turf. But I'm not really much of a threat. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I am in a bit of a different league. I, like, I, I think I'd be fine. I think I'd, I'd be okay with it. I just don't want to tread on people's toes, if that makes sense. But I, I don't think they'd mind. I'm not trying to, like, compete or block anyone out. Like, you know what I mean? Yeah, it's just some of my friends stream on, like, Facebook and, and Twitch, but I think it'd be fine. Shit. Shit. Nice. Yep, come in, come in. Shit. It's fine. What we'll do, we'll use, use this. Nice. Oh. Christ, man. Right, got it, got it. Shit. Out of the way. Out of the way. Gonna lob a grenade down, I think. Actually, or should we... Just do a load of headshots? We can. Nice. Nice. Yeah, they're, they're probably breaking upstairs now. I think we need to... We'll keep an eye up here. We need to, uh, yeah, shove those those uh, ladders down as well. Right, I think I might. I'll take a green. Um, yeah, I think we'll... Yeah. It's justifiable. Nice. Shove the ladders down. Check those other ones. Hell yeah! <laughs> Joke's on you guys. Us guys and Lewis be slaying it. I think we've done really well at this part. Killing it. Absolutely killing it. We've got plenty of handgun ammo, so we need to spam them. Thank you, bro. Thank you, thank you. Nice. Shove that ladder down. Hell yeah. Ain't no one coming in here. No one! Do you hear me? No one! <laughs> I think we smashed this with Lewis. I really hope he lives longer in the remake. I really do. It upsets me so much, like, in this game, like, losing Lewis. It really does. Yeah, I hope so, James. It would be good if they give Ashley a handgun in the remake. Like... Even if she's like not that good, like just something, like uh, even just just so she can try <laughs> and do something, you know. Shit. Let's get this one. I'll throw that, I think. This? Thank you, bro. Thank you. These last plaggers going. Oh no! No, that was going so good. 
Bro, that was doing so good. Fuck. I didn't realize we was pretty low there. Fuck. Oh, bro. Right, there's nothing new in the match. Right, at least we get to relive that. It's fine. It's fine. It's one of those things. We good, guys. Oh, it's a shame, that. Yeah, I'm the same, Dano. If I think I'm going to get some opportunities gaming when I'm going somewhere, um, yeah, I, I will take, like, my Switch or uh, Game Boy something with me. Um, you know what, like, my favourite retro handheld is? I absolutely love the Game Boy Advance SP Tribal Edition. I got one boxed off eBay. It was about, like, 50 quid or something. And this was years ago. This was about um, 2016 when I started picking up my retro collection again. I absolutely loved it, man. It's so good. Right, I think we're good for the minute. We'll just take a... Uh... Oh, sorry about that, guys. That was a proper letdown, that. Do apologise. We'll get there, though. It's fine. But yeah, that how sick with the GBASP Tribal Editions. They were so good. That's amazing. Where's that El Rambo? He said, when I was in the brig. What's the brig? He said, they let us have Game Boys. They cost 100 US dollars, though. Nice. Use this. Thank you, bro. Thank you. I sound like um, Jay-Z at the beginning of uh, Jay-Z and Linkin Park, Numb Encore. Thank you, thank you. You're far too kind. Thank you, thank you. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Do 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 <laughs> Lewis, take this. Thank you, thank you. You're far too kind. Oh, the fucking deadly. Absolutely deadly. Them uh, plagas mutations. Fuck. Cray cray. You freaking cray cray, bro. Thank you, thank you. You're far too kind. Do, 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 do. <laughs> I know, Dan, it makes no sense, does it? Like, they all should be pulling up the ladders, not knocking them down. Too true. I mean, GG to Lewis. He, he is a useful AI. He is real good. I do love him to bits. Love you long time, Lewis. We love you. Spam the hell out of this. Let's go. Got loads of ammo. Let's go. Oh. Yeah, man. Oh, some areas of this game and that. It, it just. There's so much going on. There's so much going on. Let's check out this mutated one. Oh. Nice. Oh, shit. Right. Let's get upstairs. Whoa, 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 whoa. Nice. Everybody get up now. <laughs> right, we'll look, throw this in a sec. Give us a second. That's it. The, oh my god, the shitloads. We're all doing the fucking conga up the stairs. <laughs> Jeez. Everybody get up now. Right, we're going to smash it this time, guys. It's those mutated plaggers, man. They're awful. So bad. It's them that... Because <laughs> they can get you from a distance. That's the problem with them. Nice. No. No. Uh, Tyrell, you said, uh, do you know when the next stream is? Uh, I'm going to try and jump on tomorrow night, actually. Because um, I'm, I'm off tomorrow as well. Then I, I'm back at work on Monday evening. Um, well, Monday afternoon, sorry. Um, yeah, I'm on a load of late shifts, so I won't be able to stream until uh, Saturday, next Saturday. So I'm going to try and get on tomorrow. We'll continue this playthrough. Shit. I just totally want to make the most of, um, you know, these couple of nights that I have free to be able to stream. Shit. Lewis, you saved my ass. Thank you, man. Shit. 
just throw a let's get a flash grenade there we'll help him out oh shit oh my god nice fuck it's still crazy oh shit sorry i think i just shot in there <laughs> totally didn't mean to i think he just went shit leon too true james the owners of the house are going to be pissed I don't think you're going to be able to use this as an Airbnb anytime soon. Hell no. Nah. GG. GG, guys. Ooh. Looks like they're backing off. So, what do we do now? The bridge I crossed to get here is out. So I guess we have no choice but to keep moving. I forgot something. You guys go on ahead. Lewis. Oh, Lewis, don't ditch us. Bro, don't ditch us. <laughs> Bro. Let's go. Leave us with Ashley. Proper lifted my spirits being with Lewis for a bit. Real useful AI. He's brilliant, man. Um, right, so we, I think we've got everything we can from this house anyway. What haven't we looted in here? Um, yeah, that'll be awesome, Danny. We said, uh, I hope the remake has a Lewis uh, DLC... Um, yeah, in the style of, like, Ada's uh, Separate Ways DLC. Yeah, for sure, man. Um, I think that, and then also we mentioned earlier, like, a Merchant Backstory DLC. I mean, that is pushing it. I think that, like, that would be way more unlikely, but, like, that would be so welcomed by people. It'd be so good. I would love that. More on the Merchant. And, yeah, it would be good, Tyrell, yeah. Um, how, how he was uh, captured and stuff, yeah, as the prisoner in the village. That'd be awesome. Uh, no worries, Tyrell. He said, I'm going to go. Good night, everyone. Uh, yeah, thank you so much for being here, Tyrell. I appreciate your support. Uh, take care. And hopefully catch you very soon in another stream, man. Take care of yourself. Right, I'm just checking the oats. Make sure we've got everything. I don't think there's any more, like, pickups or anything. I think we're good. We'll go see our merchant guy. See if he's got anything new. I assume he probably must do if, if he's here. Because we've seen him not so long ago. There's something in here. What's this? Two rooms. Just a while ago, I was informed by Lord Sadler that our men had shot down a US military helicopter. There shouldn't be any more outside interference for a while now. Unless the United States government determines who the traitor is, they can only initiate very small covert operations. We must use this time to our advantage and recapture the girl. The two Americans can only get out of our territory by using one of two routes. This is where we will stop them. We shall make use of our forces to the greatest degree. We'll deploy a large number of Ganados in one of the routes to ensure that they do not slip by us. For the other route, we shall leave the task to El Gigante. Whichever route they take, the agent will never leave here alive. Not with the girl, at least. So, there's Ganados or El Gigante. I think we should go El Gigante. <laughs> what do you guys reckon? We'll have a Gigante problem on our hands. What up, bro? It's, it's always a pleasure. His eyes have turned red. Let's just stop. We're doing a sec. Look at his eyes. They were blue at first. They're freaking red now. He's possessed. I literally wonder if he's got infected at some point and he's hiding his wounds under his uh, under his uh, swag. Thank you. Right, we're, we're good with them. What are you buying? Nothing there. Nah, still ain't ready to buy the rifle yet. I'll buy that a bit later on. Usually get that um, around the castle area. Right, so is this? I think this is El Gigante, I think. Because the one on the left, it said Ganados. The one on the right, um, El Gigante. I mean, they're both locked, aren't they? They're both locked. What's through here? Let's have a look. Oh no! I was spamming it and I just meant to say, yeah. Oh, bollocks! I don't think I can, um... I don't think there was a checkpoint. Fuck. Oh, that's it. I'm so glad you can go back. I, honestly, I, I don't... I'm not in the mood for any more Ganadas. We've had so many. We'll have El Gigante again. Let's go. Let's freaking go, guys. We can do this. I'm so glad you can change your mind. I thought I'd ballsed it up then. Go El Gigante. 
Hell yeah. Ashley, you, you can limp all you want. I I ain't messing around. You ain't having any uh, ain't having any help, bro. Oh, nice. Hang on. Shit. Nice. Beautiful. Beautiful. I need the doggo. Shit. I need the doggo. Fuck! I just shot him in his booty. He didn't really do anything. Shit. Uh oh. <laughs> Bro, I. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh! He's gonna kill her! Ashley, you're a liability. I need to see if I can, like, leave her at the gate. Tell her to wait. <laughs> it's not me, guys. It's Ashley. Ashley, you're fucking up my stream. I'm gonna end up with like one subscriber after this stream. <laughs> Asshole. Oh. Yeah. Shit. Shit, hang on. Boom. Can I... I... I can't hide her anywhere, I don't think. I don't think I can. So you can just inflict a little bit of damage, then we'll do do a flash grenade after. Oh, I didn't do anything. Wow, that did something though. Okay, just get behind him, get behind him, get behind him. Come on. Do we actually have to defeat him or can we just run past? Do you guys know? Oh, I, I think she's gone. She's gone. Boom. I literally don't know, is it? Can you get past them? I'll drop that on him and see if we can run past. Oh, thank you, Dano. He, he said just run past him. I didn't actually know, you know. It's, it's been ages since I've, I've done this. Like, this, this like second El Gigante. Yeah. He's kicking our ass. Boom. Let's go. See you later, bro. Yeah, that's what I was hoping for, James, and it keeps ending the game. <laughs> I'd feed Ashley to him and make my escape. That would be the perfect scenario. Bro, she's the most annoying thing ever. <laughs> she really is. Right, is that it then? Oh no, don't tell me we've gone through the wrong fucking door. What? <laughs> we've just gone through the wrong door? How? I don't know how this has happened. Wow. <laughs> We'll just try and get past. I, I don't know how that's just happened. I thought, I thought we came in the other way. Fuck. Oh, I've got it. Got it. Got it. Okay. Oh, shit. Right. It's fine. It's fine. I might just let him get Ashley and then, then I'm not um, losing any health. Get Ashley. Get Ashley. Be more entertaining. Oh, you have to get us, don't you? No, I just want to retry it so then we won't lose health and stuff. We'll get a little Leon death. <laughs> it's fine. I don't know how we, we got through the wrong door. I think it's because I turned round, obviously. Right. No, thank you for your patience, LJ. Yeah, you said you're all good. Some missions just take a few retries. They, they do indeed. They freaking do, man. Right, I've already shot that down then, haven't we? Right, we just have to be really quick. <laughs> to be real quick. There we go. We got there. Oh, don't say he comes through. <laughs> Bro, I, I want to loot these. Bro. <gasps> oh, shit. I want to loot these. Oh, no. <laughs> Fuck. Oh. Oh man, I just want to loot. <laughs> right, I think I think we've literally got everything in this area. Actually, I think we did good there. Oh no, not again. Okay, I don't see any more rocks to, to shoot on him, so I'm just gonna. Oh shit! I see pickups over there. We don't have the time. Shit. 
Yeah, shame you couldn't have uh, Ashley for his tea. <laughs> right, let's reload up. That's that door we have to use uh, Mendez's eye on, right? I think. Is it that one? Maybe. Oh, shit. That's it. Welcome. Welcome. Bro, it's been a minute, literally. We're so nice to see you again. What are you selling? Is that all Sell that again. Thank you. Cheeky spin on Fia. There we go. Nothing else new, that's fine. It'll be worth it. We're accumulating loads. It's been so fun, guys. I've been so engrossed in this game. It's been real good. I mean, even the deaths have been pretty funny. <laughs> it happens. Honestly, the amount of times I've played this game, I'm sure it happens to you guys, like... Even when you played it uh, over the years, <laughs> it still catches you out. It's still a challenging game. So good. You know, the only thing, the only enemies we haven't seen um, in, in the um, gameplays and trailers of the remake, the only enemies, I think, are the regenerators at the end. Damn, they are scary. They are the scariest enemies. I really hope they, they leave that. They don't show us anymore until the final game, hopefully. Village's last defence. I clearly underestimated the American agent's capability. He's still alive. I thought that we could wait until the egg hatch, but at this rate, he could destroy the whole village before it does. We must take care of this nuisance. We shall change our priorities for the time being. We will seize our hunt for Lewis and ambush the two Americans. There's a building used to enlighten betrayers just beyond the point where you get off the lift. It's a perfect place for ambushing them. If all else fails, they still would need to face me in order to get past the last gate that leads out of the village. For only before my sight will the gate open. So yeah, we have to use his, uh, his redener. In the retina scanner, hell yeah. What up, Milky Way? I said, look at this jacket, oh my god. <laughs> you know, on, honestly, bro, it's, it's not actually as, as um, impressive as it looks on, on stream. The, um, I got it from a store on Amazon, it, it really ain't good. I'm not gonna actually return it after this stream. And um, yeah, I'm gonna, uh, what was I gonna say? I've ordered a, a more premium one, I've ordered a better one. Uh, yeah, from uh, a decent website called hookandbull.com. This is the only way out of this village. That This light looks like it's some sort of retinal scanner. So yeah, I've ordered a more premium one. Um, so that'll be better. Right, so we want to be. Um, that's a lot. I think we can go down here, I think. I don't think we'd do anything down there. Cheeky, uh, what is it, gondola? I like these. Yeah, honestly, the, the fur, it looks like, I always said it looks like it's literally been bathing in Sunny D, or Kel has drenched it in orange soda. <laughs> it's so damn orange. It, it's nothing like the listing. Absolutely had our pants down with this one. There's no way I can keep it. But it, it looks all right. It's not too bad to stream. I, I changed it in the thumbnail. I actually changed the, the lighting and stuff, the colour, uh, to make it look all right on the thumbnail. <laughs> I don't freaking think so. Look at look at Ashley. Look at a little celebration. That's so cool. That's another thing I never noticed until years on. It's so cool. Oh, I think that I found myself a cheerleader. Oh. What are you, what are you singing about Ashley for? I've just freaked myself out. <laughs> um... LJ said, if there's a Holy Grail, uh, Resident Evil prop or collectible you could own, what would it be? It would be the uh, Code Veronica Dreamcast. So it's a, a transparent red um, Dreamcast and it, it's worth like hundreds of pounds. I, I do, regrettably, I, I did pass up on one. Um, my mate uh, Jason, I think it was Jet. no, Jason Cybersnake was the guy who bought it. Uh, one, of, one of the guys from the retro game community, Craig's here again, he was selling one, I think it was about four or five hundred pound, and I think he had everything, but I don't know if it was missing one little bit of paperwork or registration card, and the OCD in me thought, like, oh, if I'm paying like hundreds of pounds, I really want everything to be there, you know? Um, so I passed up on that, but very regrettably so. Fuck, it's, 
the, the console's worth so much now. It's worth so much. But, yeah, if, if you search it up um, online, it would be, yeah, the um, RE Code Veronica Dreamcast console. Yeah, it'd be amazing to own. Yeah, I really should complete the look, uh, James. I, I will, probably will do. Probably do, like, a, a female Leon kind of cosplay. <laughs> I've never cosplayed anyone before. I really want to be able to cosplay Jill Valentine as well. That'd be so sick, getting, like, her Styles gear. I've already got, like, a, a cheeky beret. <laughs> so, yeah, it'd be cool, man. Um, let's just see where this leads. Hmm. What that other area was? Um, is that a dead end? All right, we'll go down here. Let's see what's in here? Yes, Dano. Um, the, the yeah, the bottom episode where they're stuck on the Ferris wheel, mate. You're making me want to watch it. I might have to watch some bottom after stream, you know. <laughs> it's so good. I can't remember what that one's called. It, it's great that. <laughs> What did he say? Um, didn't Eddie take a dig about uh, Rich's weight? And he said, don't you dare call me overweight, young man. And he goes and sits on it and the thing starts swinging, like hanging by a thread. I love that part on it. Fucking so good. <laughs> Reddy is funny. You better stay outside. Ashley, go hide. Yeah. What's up, Ads? Thanks for stopping in tonight, man. Big cheese. I ain't talking baby bell. We're talking cathedral extra mature cheddar. That is where it's at. The big cheese. He ain't, uh, what do you call them? Do you remember cheese strings? Man, they were so good. What's up, Klaus Mi Michelson? Said, I'm new and I subbed and liked. Thank you, man. Appreciate that. I actually managed to hit that QT while I was reading the comment. Quite impressed though. <laughs> You're just in time for the big cheese. Let's go. You're just in time for some cheese on toast. <laughs> Hell yeah. That's the La Vista. That's right, Faisal. Yeah, he does as well, James. Yeah, Eddie has a pint under his jacket. <laughs> Perfectly balanced, mate. So good. Right, we need grenades galore for this. Whoa. What's up, Low Fig says, um, or oh, Lo-Fi is it, apologies if I didn't get that right, it says, hello Holster, have a fantastic weekend, rock on, rock on to you man, hope you have an awesome weekend as well, it's so good to um, chat with loads of you guys tonight, we've got loads in, it's been absolute hype tonight, you guys are too kind, get him, get him, let's go, let's go, oh shit, just missed QTE, I kind of forgot QTEs were in this fight, you know, Oh shit! I mean, that's a pretty cool death though, right? Danny Jarman! What's up, Danny? I hope everything's all good with you, man. Yeah, doing awesome tonight, mate. Honestly, it's been an absolute wicked stream. It really has. Yeah, you remember cheese strings ads. So good. That's what I'm saying, the big cheese, you don't take him lightly, he ain't a baby bell or a cheese string. It's absolute mature cheddar. This guy. This guy. Yeah, Eddie's emergency pint. What's your favourite, anyone who watches the show Bottom in the UK, what's your favourite episode? I think my favourite, um, I really like the gas man one. I love the gas man. Um... Me and my, my best mate Jodie, I work with her uh, every shift. We're, we're permanent crewmates. Um, and yeah, we, we always say bottom quotes. And uh, you know when we don't need... He's at the door and he's screaming, Gas man! Gas man! Because he w needs Eddie to switch off the gas then. You know the gas man says to Do you have someone who looks after you? That's like literally the quote for me because Jodie looks after me. It's proper like, do you have someone who looks after you? And then I point to Jodie. I'm like, yeah, she does. <laughs> Nice. Nailed it. Nailed it that time. Right now he's got his second form. 
he chills up on there. Oh, give me that sweet eye, bro. Give me the sweet eye. See if we can stun him a little bit. Oh, I kind of forgot he moves around so much. He does, don't he? Shit. I think we need to shoot him down because this ain't this method ain't working. Where is he? Fuck. Right, let's quickly stun him so he stays down there. Proper make use of these grenades. Oh, bollocks. I thought he'd stay there a little longer, you know. Oh shit, I had to reload. <laughs> Merchant guy, where are the first aids? We haven't seen one in like five hours. <laughs> Glad you're all good, Danny. He said, uh, love this Resident Evil game, the best one out the lot. For a lot of people, RE4 Original is their favourite game. Yeah, yeah, I can definitely understand that. And for some people uh, who missed out on playing the OG trilogy, RE4 is the first Resi game they played. It became really popular. Really damn popular. Oh, I missed the QTE. This is real bad. This is so bad. I don't remember this fight being like this hard. We must be almost there. Must be. Oh, they are deadly. There must be some health items up there. I think. Let's head. Let's head up here. Yes, Klaus. Yeah, I, I did play the uh, chainsaw demo. I absolutely loved it, and I did stream it as well. So yeah, I've got a stream of that on. Fry with this one we can I think. I think it'd be a, a decent shout. Hang on, let's see if we can see if we can shoot him down, then we'll use that on him. That should finish him off, I think. Should do. Let me just pause it a sec. I think someone I think someone just subscribed. Appreciate it. Let me just check uh, on here. There we go. We've got that sweet eyeball for the retina scanner. It'll pop up in just a sec. You see the the game screen. It, it's in front of of uh, the actual screen. If that makes sense. Uh, yeah, Klaus. Klaus Michaelson subscribed. Thank you, Klaus. I appreciate that. Just wanted to shout out uh, people subscribing. Thank you. We've had lots of new subscribers this stream. This has been an absolute awesome stream. It really has. We got the false eye. We got his red possessed eye. I think he had one blue, one red. Or at least he did earlier when we came across him. Let's get all reloaded up. We'll check everything, get all the pickups. <laughs> you know what? That is literally my, um, what do you call it? My special ability. I only see things like that after I've kicked someone's ass. And I'm like, oh, it could have been way easier. That's <laughs> so what I do best. I make a meal of everything. 30 grand. Bro, we literally got 15 grand for killing El Gigante. 30 grand for the big cheese. That makes sense, to be honest. Cathedral cheese does cost about 30 grand, let's face it. <laughs> it has to be, um, bro, it has to be cathedral cheese. I remember when I was at my mum's, um, when I lived there before, before obviously get my own place. Um, my stepdad, in, he went shopping and he got the shittest cheese. So stringy, I nearly choked about 10 times when I had uh, cheese on me, uh, Jacket potato. <laughs> Take the piss, man. Right, we're all good in here. That's a, that's a cool little uh, it's a cool little scene right there. You chill there, Mendez. Hell yeah. Right, let's start the inventory. We can combine these up. Nice. Uh, move that out of the way so we'll end up selling that. The merchant guy, man, he, he needs to get some more first aid sprays and he, he never has enough. You got like two throughout the whole game. Won't open the door handles are twisted together. I can't undo them. I think you actually. This confused me last time I streamed this, and you guys had to tell me. I think you jump out of a window. It's like here. I thought it was blocked off because of all the fire, but I think you can. Yeah, you can get through. I totally didn't. Okay, didn't remember. Can I creep us up on us like that? <laughs> Must maybe jump there. Um. I like that. Yeah, I'm just catching up with you guys' comments. Your favourite bottom episode. Um, LJ says the chess game. I think that is that called contest. That one. Um, 
and then Dallas said the one where they go camping. Um, Great Uncle Bulgaria. Whoa, Bulls! So good. Yeah, I, I love that when um, Eddie eats all the uh, chocolate hobnobs. <laughs> and then uh, they, they get, like, the, the shittest fish. It's like me when I'm fishing on here. Look at that! And then... <laughs> Yeah, don't, don't Richie say, look at her, she must be that big, and it, it, it's like on a little stick, and it's like that, it's like, like a little sardine or something, so funny, oh man, when they go fishing, and then the, the fighting, aren't they, over the hobnobs, and the, it goes in the air, and the rest of them go in the, in the river, too funny, what up bro, Welcome. you got anything new for us after that? No, nothing else. Nothing new, bro. You need to step it up, merchant. I love you, but come on. <laughs> yeah, you know what, Ads? The, the Dairyly uh, Triangle Cheeses are decent. They are alright. I think I went through here. Oh, of course, of course. No, no. I ain't having, I ain't having throwing that. No, no, don't do it. Oh my God, I'm so glad that didn't go past those sandbags. Fuck. Oh my God. The luck I've had with them fucking party poppers. <laughs> Assholes. <laughs> yeah, was this your first Resident Evil game, uh, Klaus, that you played? It, it was uh, like a lot of people's first Resident Evil game, you know? Um, yes, I do love the bottom live shows. Do you remember the um, the movie Guest House Paradiso? That was ace. That was so good. I need to rewatch it. I've genuinely not seen that probably since I was like a teenager or something. Look at that, 200k Posadas. Um, and when I first watched Shaun of the Dead, I was like, where have I seen him before? You know Simon Pegg? Because I actually hadn't really seen him in movies. And then, then it clicked. I, I saw him in, in Guest House Paradiso. He's in there. I think him and his missus and kids, they're all sick, aren't they? Yeah, everyone's like projectile vomit in the hotel or something. The blood's still fresh. Was there some kind of ritual here? And the vomiting light, it's like yellow, isn't it? And it like custard or something. Do you guys remember the, um, I think that's the last cat side to our bear stand, you know. Look at this, guys. This is. It's a thing of beauty. Three gemstones have been set in the side. Hell yeah. Do you remember the bottom episode uh, where it's Halloween? Uh, it's called Terror. And, um, don't, uh, Eddie... No, is it... Eddie's a banana, isn't he? And Richie's like a devil. And, um, don't... Ri is it Richie who has all that custard in his pants? <laughs> he has, like, his massive pants, he has all custard in it. And then, um, don't he, um... Don't he have, like, a, a cattle prod, in it? And then he, he, um, fires it up and then he shits himself. <laughs> Absolutely ace. Man, that was great. Yeah, the, the Halloween episode's good. Honestly, I, I love Spud Gun and Dave Hedgehog. I really do. Fucking absolute treats they are. Uh, what's up, Tim Bellison? Thank you for stopping in. Jeez, I think I've had, like, every single one of my subscribers in this stream. I'm not even kidding. Literally, everyone has been in. What are you selling? You guys are the real MVPs for coming in tonight. 20 grand, guys. All that graph for 20 grand. Let's go. Thank you. We haven't even found an elegant headdress yet for the um, them gems. Cray cray. I know, James. I absolutely agree. Um, rest in peace to Rick Mail. It was only the other day. It was like a few a few days ago. It had been, you know, obviously quite a few years like, since he'd passed. I, I can't believe like that he's passed away. I, I literally can't. You only just can't believe it. Oh, my bad, guys. I think we need to go up the stairs, I think. But yeah, I'll tell you what, my top three TV shows um, is uh, The uh, the Royal Family, Faulty Towers and Bottom. They are my top three. They're, they absolutely, they make me piss myself laughing. Genuinely, I, I laugh the most at them. So damn funny. Yeah, we're up here, back on the gondola, I think. Then we can use that eye on the retina scanner. Let's go. Smashing it, guys, smashing it. Uh, Klaus said, um, my question for you, what's your favourite Resident Evil game of all time? My favourite Resident Evil game and game of all time is original Resident Evil 2. It really is just something else. It's incredible. 
I, I, honestly, words words can't describe like how much the game means to me. I, I absolutely adore the game. Never gets boring going back to it. And I've streamed it quite a lot of times. You know, I've streamed it like when I first started streaming. I streamed like the original. Then I've I've played it with like HD mods and stuff. I'm just checking this, but I think it's um yeah, it won't open. It must be bad from the side. I was just checking it because I knew it was locked. Yes, he did. Um, Rick Mail did do uh, adverts Nintendo as well. But yeah, I actually didn't know that until like up to like a few the last few years sort of thing when I saw the um, the video circulating you know like on Facebook gaming groups um, but yeah the live shows are good I, I want to go back and watch those um... <laughs> the addiction's real Klaus yeah yeah he did say uh, you know what since he's played Resident Evil I have an addiction to it I, I feel you man we're all the same that is a funny moment, Danny, yeah. Have you got any more exploding carrots? <laughs> oh, man, there's so many um, decent episodes. I, li I like the Christmas one as well. I actually watched that there, Christmas, to get me, like, you know, the whole Christmas mood. And he's like, um, I've got a baby. Why couldn't you be more careful? And then, uh, what is it? Um, and then the landlord comes in. He's like, oh, you bastards, where's my grandson? Um my daughter dropped him off this morning, cow, and there's Goldfinger on the telly. <laughs> Let's just all have Goldfinger and just pack it in, all right? <laughs> it's just too funny. Fuck. Oh, God, this is bad. That's it. Got it, got it. There's been many a times where I've, I've <laughs> missed a line my shots on this. If I just tried to go for the driver, I think you can either go for the driver or you go for the wheel. I just kind of spammed there. Can you imagine if we all played charades? Dano, what are you saying? Goldfinger. James, what are you saying? Goldfinger. Ads, what are you saying? Goldfinger. LJ, Goldfinger. Let's just all have Goldfinger, just pack it in. <laughs> Too funny. <laughs> Gold Frankenstein and girl. <laughs> Too funny. Uh, yeah, it's makes sense. I actually like the um, the one where they have to mine the shop and they watch the cricket up on the roof with pickled onion sandwiches. Question for you, bottom fans: Have you ever had a pickled onion sandwich? Because when I used to watch it, literally when I was like nine or ten years old, I, I actually started making pickled onion sandwiches while I was watching it, um, and I actually like them. They're all right. I don't mind pickled onion sandwiches. I actually loved them as a kid. Used to make them while I watched Bottom. They're actually really nice. We need to try use these up. We need to spam these. That's it. You better be giving us pickups for this. Oh no! No! I knew he was getting a little close. Nice. Nice. I mean, we could have ran past him, but I kind of stopped for those pickups, so now it's like we, we need all the Pasitas we can get. We need we need to get them. Nice. We're going to be absolutely balling, guys. Uh, Tim said, just stopping in to say what's up, spending time with my family. Well, you have a, an awesome day, uh, Tim, and thanks for stopping in to say hey. I do appreciate it. Yeah, the, the doodano, yeah. <laughs> the sprouts, the repeat on everyone. I like it when, uh... Oh, well, what was it? Did... <laughs> they had the Christmas pudding and didn't, um... Didn't Eddie soak it in vodka margarine? And then, uh... And then, uh, Richie lights in. He's just absolutely goes up in flames. Absolutely awesome. Oh, LJ, what a, what a combo, man. Used to have ham... Pickled onion crisps and cheese sandwiches. That's awesome. Bro, I don't know if you can... Can you still get pickled onion crisps? Because I know walkers used to do them, didn't they? I don't know if you still can, but... Mate, I would be absolutely okay. up for that sandwich combo. LJ with the elite sandwich combo there. You know what, LJ? I think that could actually rival a Jill sandwich. The LJ sandwich, it is up there with the Jill sandwich, I'm telling you. <laughs> I love that. Come on. Yeah. Time for the castle. 
It's where those enemies, the chanting moldy STDs, isn't it? <laughs> I love that. Moldy STD, moldy STD. It literally sounds like the same moldy STDs. Well, go get checked out then. See your own GP. You're going to have to wait till Monday and ring up at 8 in the morning like the rest of the UK. <laughs> Bro, you better be fucking sorting us out before we go in this castle. You better hook us up, I swear. Or we'll be falling out of the merchant. Oh, you know what I'm actually hyped for, guys? I'm actually really hyped for the shooting galleries as well. How fun are those? Hell yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, you bollocks. The snakes, man, they always catch you when you least expect it. All the time. How did it get over there already? Bro. Nice. You know, I'm not even... Oh, I should do, really. What kind of chicken egg is it? If it's a brown chicken egg, she ain't having it. Yeah, she's not having a brown one. Yeah, I'm not going to give her anything. Fuck her. <laughs> Fuck her. Ashley is a mouldy STD. <laughs> Freaking Trashley in the trash can. <laughs> Got some rare things on Thank you, Tim. Appreciate that. Encouraging people to hit the like. If you, yeah, if you guys are enjoying the stream, if if you don't mind, um, if you don't mind uh, hitting the like for the stream, that would be awesome. <laughs> Thank you. Come back anytime. What's that, James? You'll you'll stop what? Is that the bottom puns? What are you buying? <laughs> Bro, you can never have too many bottom quotes. It's fine. Thank you. Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. Right, I think... Mm, got the black tail broken butterfly. Uh, riot gone. Is that all? Ayo. Boom. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. We'll get the rifle as well. Oh, I still no first day. Why are the rear as rocking horse shit? Bro. Yeah, we'll get the semi-auto. Sick. Right, we'll just sell the... Selling? Oh, I've been so excited for this one. Right, we'll sell the shotgun. Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. What are you buying? Then we've got room for... We'll do the semi-auto. I think I've made that mistake before, buying the, the rifle and then the semi-auto comes up. And I'm like, oh, shit. Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad we wait that out. Thank you. And then we'll get the scope for the semi-auto. Thank you. you. I think that's everything. We'll tune up what we can as well while we're here. What are you buying? Is that all? <laughs> can only do Thank the power you. on that at the minute. We'll do the firepower as well. <laughs> Thank you. Um, I think capacity is okay. I think is reload would probably be useful. Actually, we'll save our sats. Perseus. Cool. Right. Um, we, right, we've literally just had chapter end, haven't we? Um, just because I've done all the inventory, I've done our wheeling and dealing, I will make a save here. Bro, what a stream this is, though. Like, everyone has been in. Literally everyone. It makes me really happy that I've, I've said hi to so many of you guys tonight. I sound like I'm off the goonies, don't I? Hey, you guys. <laughs> oh, Ashley's meat is really doing my head in. Let's just give her that. Piss off. It's doing my head in flashing in the background. Mouldy STD. <laughs> yeah, I reckon so, Dano. Imagine the whiff of Lynx Africa every time the merchant opens his coat. It's either that or... Um, What's, um, oh, what does, Eddie spends his money on it in, um, bottom. I'm not talking the pheromones, I mean the, um, fuck. Is it dupe or brute or something like that? What's the, is that guy's fucking, it's like a guy's aftershave or something. It's like a proper classic one. Oh, I can't remember. I think Eddie said he spent some on it. 
he got this particular aftershave. Yeah, he'll have some kind of classic, like, uh, I think it's called Brute or something. what it is i can what i'm thinking of but right we have stashed some uh, rifle ammo here yeah i'm glad you agree there klaus the og 2 is the best i like how dumb the ai was back then so obviously you can shoot that and this guy doesn't even bat an eyelid you can just literally chill and pop him off as well awesome The merchant, that was totally me. Um, that was totally me back in school. Cause I, I used to be, you know, the one who sold sweets. I was, I was that gal. There's a couple of lads who did it, but honestly, I fucking smashed it. I'm not even kidding. Like I would literally get about, probably get about 50 quid a week or something. No, not 50, about 30 a day, was it? 30 a day? Obviously, I'd have to, like, reinvest in the business and buy more sweets and stuff. Just trying to sneak out enough to get that guy. Let's have a look. That red one is wearing a mask, so we can't do a headshot. It's got to get him in the bollocks. <laughs> I don't know if... We might have took out that other guy. The cannon ain't on, on the go anymore. I'm sure I used to get about 30 a day. Oh yeah, now I see that. Um, and yeah, it, it was it was really nice to be able to actually. I eventually got caught, and it, it was literally like the scene on Goodfellas, you know, when they're selling the illegal cigarettes. I think it is, and then Tommy goes and runs to. Um, is it Robert De Niro? Is it is it uh, Jimmy? I think it is. He's like Henry got pinched. That's what it was like. I had to go back and tell what I got pinched, and she was like, "Oh, you're joking?" Because like, I was helping her out financially at the time. She was a single parent and everything, so. Um, it was literally hard times for us, genuinely. So it killed us, genuinely, when, like, I got caught. <laughs> it li literally was not for my own financial benefit. I, di I did that, like, for my mum as well. For our own, both of our income, you know. So, yeah, it was it was a gutting time, man, when I got uh, caught out there. Funny times. But no, we, we made some decent profit, though, for a while. We did good. Let's get that barrel. Boom. Seems like the same sort of concept as well on the remake. You get the cannons uh, manned by, obviously, the uh, the people. Um, and there are, like, barrels and stuff to shoot to help you out there. It seems like the same sort of concept and stuff. Not from the other side. It's going to take a lot of firepower to destroy this gate. Hang on a sec. Did we... We could, we could check that cannon, didn't we? I just need to check if we can actually um, move it. I don't know if we can yet or not. Shit, where was it? Oh, 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 oh no. Oh wow, okay, that's fine. We'll do that again. Fuck, wiped us out. I was just trying to backtrack. It's my fault, I should have checked the uh, thing. Take that, Ashley, and piss off. Right. Take these guys out again. You know what? Did we actually... Um... Yeah, thank you, OJ. We, we absolutely do. Do have anything for your family, for sure. Mold the STD. Hard times, man. We, we do go through hard times, like you said, but we, yeah, we definitely do anything for our families, for sure. Family is everything. Let's get our barrel. Is that still going? Is it coming from... Coming from over there. Right, we got way more distance on this. Uh, no worries, James. He said, I'm off. Great stream. Catch you in the next one. Thank you for being here, James. Appreciate you being here tonight, man. Take care and catch you uh, in the next stream. That's, we... that's it. Oh, there's got to be a mechanism somewhere to pull this thing up. That's fine. We'll find it.
Oh, t- right, it's this way, yeah. I always totally lose my bearings when we have to turn around places and that. It's all good. Oh, shit. Let's wipe this guy out. Nice. So one over here. Let's get this guy. Oh, gonna have to kind of go for a neck shot, I think. Matalo. Oh. That's it. Yeah, it's getting pretty late here in the UK. Oh, wow. It is actually. Yeah, it's like 1am. Wow. Okay. <laughs> That's cray cray. No worries, Tim. Thank you again for being here. Catch you later as well, man. And uh, have a good time with your family. Right, so that's locked from the other side. Let's make our way over. Man, I don't want to end the stream. I'll probably stay on for like another hour or something, guys. Nice. Now I'm going to probably have a pot noodle. Uh, king size pot noodle, by the way. You can't have standard ones. You get like two mouthfuls and that's it. you got to have the king size ones, man. Um. Yeah, I'll have one of them, and then I shall um, watch Bottom as well, because it's your guys' fault. <laughs> no, in a good way. I'm buzzing to watch some Bottom now. I think... Are they still all on Netflix? I'm sure they are. I've been meaning to get them on DVD, really. I, I should do, you know, just to... I like owning some things on DVD or Blu-ray, you know, just to, as a kind of backup, just in case they get removed from streaming services. That's why I like them. Um, Right, got to Oh shit! Hey, Fucking Ashley, I got knocked over by a cannonball, you prick! Right, wait, wait there. Don't do anything. <laughs> Literally got knocked to the ground. There's nothing, nothing in it, bro. Oh shit! That's it. <laughs> you got a little too close there. I just want to get them sweet headshots. I cannot get any angle from here. Um, so I think... Oh, get that guy. Nice. Yeah, we're just going to have to leg it across in a minute. Try to take out that. Oh, oh nice. Other cannon. going to have to take something as well. Um, try that. Nice. It'll be right for now. Right, I'm just a little hesitant. They're so deadly getting caught up in the yeah the crossfire of those. Boom. Nice. So satisfying them. Um, so satisfying these guys. Let's get our cannon up, blast that door, hell yeah. Yeah, that would be so good. That'd be so good, Dan. He said, why don't Leon and Ashley just nick their robes? They can just walk through the castle unnoticeable. Well she could. You just have to mutter, don't they? Moldy the STD, moldy the STD. Oh, Dano, have I bollocks? There's no way I'm having a Bombay bad boy pot noodle. They literally blow my head off. Like that. <laughs> no, I, I can't handle hot hot things, man. I can't handle spicy stuff. Uh, mine's a classic chicken and mushroom. It's got to be. The beef and tomato is okay, but apart from that, I, I just love the uh, chicken and mushroom ones. I always have them. Yeah, you've you got to have the, uh, the king size ones just to fucking have a taste of it. Because... <laughs> uh, you only get a couple of mouthfuls, that's the standard. Follow me. Always takes me back to uh, Oddworld. Gives me Abe vibes. Follow me. Mm, I don't know. Um... Right, so yeah, that leads where we were. That's fine. So we do want to stay up here. Definitely, LJ. You've definitely got a point, man. Um, you said, I'm a physical media collector. When the internet fails, discs prevail. Yes. Too right. Um... You know, it's like a while ago. I thought it was one of them then. I nearly let's just see how beautiful the guy is. His, his eyes are blue now. Uh, blue, da 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 da. It used to be red. Are you cured, bro? Are you got the vaccine? There's something you're hiding from us. Welcome. But yeah, it's like things like. Um, got some rare things on sale. I started my South Park DVD collection from the car boot. I literally got them for like a quid a season. I've literally got most of them. I've got about f at least 15 seasons or something. But I've got them stored away in a box in the garage. Um, and obviously, I think all of them, I think they're available on, I think it's Amazon Prime, I think. But 
what are you it's saying? just nice to have them there in case they're taken off the streaming services because if they are it's something you like you're screwed you know so yeah i don't like that uncertainty i do like having a physical collection is that all <laughs> thank you what are you thank buying? you Firepower, hell yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, see, that's why I was saving it, because it, they become pricey, these uh, Come these tune-ups. Come back any time. Come back any time. It is a classic tune, LJ. Hey man, where's your current location? We decided to lay low in a castle, but it looks like it was a bad move. Meaning? Well, it appears that this castle's also connected with the Los Illuminados. I must not get many visitors here, because they're giving me one hell of a welcome. Sounds bad. I have an idea, Leon. I need you to... Uh-oh. Repeat, Hunnigan. Great. Just my luck. We've had to take that yet. It's a platinum sword mounted on the gold plate. I don't know if anything happened if we took it. I think we're good for now. There's an old book here. It's so weathered, it's eligible. And I've never done that, Dano. He said, did you ever have your pot noodle in a bowl when you were little? No, I haven't actually. I've never, never thought of that. Yeah, did you use to? Did anyone else use to? Ma, Dano. They're all coming out now. All the chants are coming out. Moldy STD. Moldy STD. Oh man, I need to stash Ashley somewhere. Wait in that corner. Ashley's in the naughty corner. <laughs> Go here. Moldy STD. The German suplex. No. Oh no. Oh no. Fuck. This isn't even a difficult part, she just makes it difficult. It's re it's really a difficult part. Martalo. Shit! Put it down. Oh you're kidding! Oh man. And so it begins. Let's keep her at the start of the area. Fucking hell. You can't do anything, bro. Bro. <laughs> right. Yeah, I think Dano after um after stream, obviously I said I don't want to watch bottom. I think I I think I may have to watch um the Ferris wheel one first. I'll be able to get in a couple of episodes. I mean I'm gonna be up late anyway. Nice no, think we've got to um that's it. Let's swap those swords round. I can stay up late anyway because I'm I'm most likely gonna stream late tomorrow night and then I'm back up I'm back on um late shifts from Monday. So I, I, it's. You know, that part of the road where I've got to keep staying up late, so... Oh no! Even that ain't working. Shit. Leon with the gem suplexes. Where are these come from, bro? Oh shit. Right. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I've just fried Ashley. It was worth it, though. Right, let's just... Uh, th there's no easy way to do this. Oh, nice. Hell yeah, Danny. Danny is in with the game-changing comment. Pot noodle butties. Yes, Danny. You can't beat a noodle sandwich. They're great. They're so good, man. We do with the rifle but we haven't got the distance. Man. Oh, that looked great, that Plagas. Splatted everywhere. That looked awesome. Pop the gold one here. Nice. Right, we, we did good there, apart from I set Ashley on fire. <sighs> Let's give her a green hair about a pity. <laughs> what else can I do? Fuck, we, we ain't looking good at all right now. <laughs> uh, what's up, Mukin? Says hello. What's up, man? Yeah, it makes sense, Dano. You know our parents worry. Said, uh, my parents didn't trust me with the pot because it was too hot. <laughs> Yeah, I guess, I mean, it, it still is, even as, as an adult, if you feel that, it's, it's still pretty hot, isn't it, when you've just poured it. 
I usually leave it for like five or ten minutes before I even start eating it. It is really hot. Mate, gotta have pot noodle butty soon. Danny Jam with a game changing comment. <laughs> I love it. Follow me. Follow me. We we played a bit of um We played a bit of uh Oddworld um Is this the Oh it's like I I just don't know if we if I came the wrong way. Lewis. I've got something for you guys. Uh -oh. I must have dropped it when I was running away from them. Dropped what? A drug that'll stop your convulsions. Look, I know you're carriers. You've been coughing up blood, right? Yeah. And you? Yes. Damn it! The eggs have hatched. We don't have much time. What are you talking about? I have to go back and get it. Let me come with you. No. You stay here with Leon. He's better with the ladies. Sure. Why are you? It makes me feel better. Let's yeah, just leave better with the ladies. Hell yeah. Yeah, I was just saying. Um, we played. Um, last played some. Oddworld, on uh, when I did a PS One demo stream. Um, I'd love to do another one of those if you guys are up for that. We'll, we'll definitely do one sometime. I've actually got a demo here. Um, it's actually the best ever horror games. So it's obviously got it's got the OGRE one. It's got Silent Hill one, Quake two, Soul Reaver, Dino Crisis, Nightmare Creatures, Death Trap Dungeon, Exhumed, Carmageddon, and Doom. It's got an absolute list and a half. If you guys are up for that, I was definitely going to um. Do a stream of that sometime. I think that'd be pretty cool. Uh, if we fancied uh, like a horror night, right? We'll go through this area first. I'm gonna use this when we can because I just wanna. I wanna take some of these out as easy as possible. It's so annoying, man. Matalo. Oh, it's been a while since I had a baguette, you know. Baguette and butter, yes. And uh, yeah, Danny said, get the bread and butter ready. Hell yeah. It's definitely worth it. Getting some bread and butter on the go. Yeah. Is there something here? Oh, shit! I kind of went a bit too far there. If we just lure them out, obviously we can uh, get that barrel. Just lure them out a little bit. As long as they're not behind us, that's fine. Moldy STD. Let's go! Let's go then. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, I didn't mind if there was in there. Not when you're coming from different directions. Bro. Oh, absolutely grafting with that knife. What does it do to us? Mutates. Let's do that. Let's do that. I ain't having it. <laughs> I ain't putting up with your bullshit. Got loads of uh, handgun bullets. That's it. We need to try and make use of them. Yeah, it could be like Halloween stream, Dano, for sure. Um, I know you asked me, didn't you, um, if I could go back and stream the Mortuary Assistant? Because unfortunately, we had a real good stream of that, but it glitched on me at the end because I was like, we was trying to, we had to like burn a body that you believed what the devil was in. Um, and yeah, I think I was like in the wrong room when I selected it or something like that. And it glitched out, um, unfortunately. But it's since been patched and um, it had a Halloween update. So I think that would be a good Halloween stream also. Totally already rushing the year on for Halloween. <laughs> the best part of the year, bro. I love it. I absolutely love the um, Resident Evil 2 Christmas mod as well. I don't know if any of you guys caught that. Bollocks. <laughs> I love doing that. I love the Christmas mod. It was really fun. So damn fun. Lord Sadler. Yeah, we'll take that. We literally... We was bowling at the start, but we're literally clutching at health right now. <laughs> Ashley's full as well. Yeah, 
That is true, Danny. I think that's probably a good shot. Say if, like, you have... This is serious pot noodle talk, guys. I, I hear you laughing. This is serious. Serious life advice. This is why we do these streams, so we can learn this valuable life advice. You can't beat these late-night chats. I, I love it. Um, yeah, if, if you've, say, got... If you haven't got, like, a, a king-size pot noodle, you think you're not going to... It's not going to fill you up, obviously. And you've got a standard pot noodle. Butter, a couple of rounds of bread and make a pot noodle butty. That's what I'm going to do when I've got like a... Well, you know what? I think after stream, I'm still going to have a butty, you know. Thank you, guys. You know, I'll make a pot noodle butty. I'll post it on the socials. I'll give you guys credit. All you guys who've been chipping in with a pot noodle chat. Appreciate you. Bro, it's, it's such valuable life advice. Are you sure, Dano? You definitely don't eat pot noodle out of a bowl now, no? Are you sure? <laughs> Castle gate kick. Right. All you over here. <laughs> Didn't quite get all of them, but it's fine. Right. Let's leg it. It's not too much. It's just too much when you've got Ashley. There's literally only so much combat I can deal with. Before I have a stroke. <laughs> Bro. Is it this? Hell yeah. Oh, no way, Dano. I don't even think... Uh, having a Bombay bad boy pot noodle, having that in a butty, I still don't think it would uh, ease the, the spiciness of it. Not for me. Bro, it's got to be chicken and mushroom. It has to be. There he is, little Salazar. I was starting to wonder when you might notice us. Who are you? Me llamo Ramon Salazar, the eighth castellan of this magnificent architecture. I have been honored with a prodigious power from the great Lord Sadler. I've been expecting you, my brethren. No thanks, bro. My, my. We've got a feisty one. If you care for your own well-being, I suggest you surrender yourself and simply become our hostage. Or, Mr. Scott, you can give us the girl because you're not worth a penny, I'm afraid. You can die. I'm never turning into one of them. Never. Got that right. We'll find a cure. Love the optimism there. I mean, it, the whole game looks good with this HD project, but even more so, I think, with the um, the castle. It really does look impressive. Yeah, like the lighting and stuff, and that's without like any kind of ray tracing and stuff. I find that the smash of the the vases. I find it really satisfying. You know, because we've been we've been used to, um, you know, the, obviously the barrels, haven't we? The wooden barrels. It's just a nice little welcome change, don't you think? I think it's cool. So satisfying. I don't know which way we're meant to be heading yet. Let's pop in here. Is that right? There was another door. Okay, so that's like, oh, there's a treasure. What's up, Brandon? Brandon Youngblood said, uh, I love this game. Me too, man. It's generally, it is one of my favourite Resident Evil games for sure. It really is. There we go. It's always worth getting the treasure maps, guys. Because, like... Even if they're like a few grand, like, you know, the treasures that are pretty, um, pretty, like, hidden, like, and you find them, it, you, you make your money back anyway, you know, in finding them and selling them to our guy. Danny said, when I got my PS5, give my good friends who work my PS4 with, like, 30 games, start to think about it, had this game in with it, nice. Yeah, it's cool having the physical version of this game. I've only got the, the digital one um, on Xbox. Nice. I'll happily trade his face for five grand. Hell yeah. I know, Dano, it, it actually is a, a pretty British statement, that, isn't it? Bottom and a pot noodle. A pot noodle sarni. Pot noodle butty. Can we be more British? Hell yeah.
Oh, nice, Brandy. So I've already got Infinite Rocket Launcher and Chico Typewriter on OGRE4 on PS5. Nice. Um, do you have to beat the game in a certain amount of time for those? Because I've never unlocked the Chico Typewriter. And I, I can't remember how you unlock it. Could you let us know? I can't remember, man. Capture Lewis Sarah. I have confirmation that Sarah has entered the castle. Why would he return during his escape? Leaves me to question his motives. But we must seize this moment and capture him. We will get the other two Americans after we apprehend Sarah. It appears he took some vaccines when he stole our sample. The vaccines we can do without, but we must retrieve the sample for it is our lifeblood. I feel there is somebody else or some other group involved in this whole affair. If the sample were to get into the hands of that other entity, the world which we seek to create will not come. We must apprehend Sarah as quickly as possible. Bro, don't get Lewis. We love him too much. We love him too much. Nice. Can definitely make use of that. Come at us, bro. Is it the other way now, yeah? Is it back to the uh like the lobby bit I think? Yeah, have the key. Cool, cool. Oh, is it? It's a new game plus, yeah. Um, you buy the Chicago type right off the merch after completing new game plus. Nice. Yeah, I'll have to look into that. I've got the costumes. Um, obviously, we was offered, um, yeah, special costume one or two at the beginning, but I opted to do the, the obviously, the original ones. Uh-oh. Can we... Oh, fuck, where do I leave her? Should I just leave her, like, here? I don't want to... I don't want to leave her. Wait. <laughs> I just totally need her out of the way. Right, so we need to do the uh, the bells, don't we? Fuck. Just got her. Is that right? <laughs> oh, there we go. Oh, oh no. He's scary. Fuck. Bro, he's scary. I've got a couple of grenades, that's good. Um, let's combine that up. I've got this ready. Oh, shit. I was going to say, I've got this ready. I ain't fucking around. I ain't fucking around. Um, let's have a go this side. Oh. Oh, shit. I got a bit carried away. I really love the rifle. I got quite carried away with that. Oh, shit. Shit. Yeah, we need him to stick his hands in like the wall, don't we? His claws. Shit, Wolverine. You're just a shit, Wolverine. <laughs> Bollocks. Says we write that. <laughs> oh shit! Oh, I can never get this right. This one, it's it's a bit bit weird. There we go. Beautiful. Let's try the rifle because the rifle's usually like really good. Nice, beautiful. What's up, Dylan? It is so creepy. Yeah, definitely. Want once you get into the castle. Um, I always prefer outdoor areas because when we're like in the castle and stuff, it. It just, um, what was I going to say? Uh, I feel really, like, claustrophobic, <laughs> you know, like, being in, in a closed area and stuff. Oh, right, you actually, Bran said you get the Chicago typewriter from beating separate ways. I actually have done, because I streamed that. Damn it. I'll have to have a look um, and see how I can, um, yeah, I don't know what to do with that. Maybe it's because I, ne I never load that, loaded that save or something. Follow me. I'm so glad no one came for Ashley while we was doing that. It's the last thing we needed. Matalo! Moldy STD! Moldy STD! You got moldy STDs, bro. You need to be waiting till 8am and ringing your GP like the rest of the UK <laughs> to sort that moldy STD. 
Thank you, Jack. I appreciate that. He said, uh, just subscribed. Love this stream. Thank you. But without getting into it, what, what a system, though. <laughs> 8 a.m., the whole of the UK just goes cray-cray. He's -cray. bullshit. <laughs> it's cray-cray. It, that's why. That's why you can't get through. because all these, all these twats are trying to sort out the mouldy STDs. That's why. You ever wonder why you can't get in touch? He's all sleeping in till 8 a.m. Oh, shit! Oh, dear. <laughs> oh. oh, dear. I totally don't expect that. I thought we'd be all right. Oh, no. I've got to, oh, I've got to sort him out again. Bollocks. Wait. Leave her there. Shit. Does it actually? It costs like a million for the typewriter. Wow. <laughs> well, like, it's kind of beyond my means right now, then. <laughs> I'll have to get that someday. It will be mine. Oh, yes. It will be mine. I need to watch um, Wayne's World. Uh, well, obviously I've seen it. I've seen both of them. Uh, I just mean I'm well overdue watching it. Shit. <laughs> oh. Let's get the thing zoomed in. I tried to shoot him blind the first time through the flames. Shit. Oh! Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh! Guys, if you can, if you can get that rifle shot on it on his back. Sick. So good. It really is powerful. I think we've only upgraded like the once, have we? I think we've done the firepower like once. That was a lot smoother. Long may this continue. Let's go. You know what, guys? I love all my streams, but this has been one of the best streams I've ever done. Like, just in terms of, like, definitely the viewership. Like, we've had loads of people in. I feel like I've spoken to everyone, every one of my subscribers, all the regulars, all the OGs. We've had new people. And the last time we played this, I don't think it was around, around maybe... Uh, nine or ten months ago, I last streamed this game, so it just it still feels pretty fresh. It still feels pretty fresh to play. Uh, we've had proper British conversations, you know. It's been ace, man. Darth Maul dodged it. <laughs> it looks like a Darth Maul with a raspberry ripple head. <laughs> His head looks like a screwball. You know the little screwball things, like a raspberry ripple thing throughout the ice cream, then the, the, the gum at the end? <laughs> That's what the paint on his head looks like. Right, I'm ready for you now. I'm not, I'm not pissing about. Fuck. Oh, I didn't get us though, it's fine, didn't get us. Sometimes you just need another, um, just need another attempt at things. We got it. Got it that time. <laughs> Just because I wanted to. <laughs> right. Oh, man. We've we got to save the rifle for that annoying Ashley segment. You know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm on about. Yeah, def this, this part. Oh, this is horrible. This is so horrible. I hate this. I hate it. Hate it. I hate it, bro. Let's take these shields out first. Nice. Rifle, I'll sort that out. Um, I just said screwballs were the best back in the day. Yeah, you know what else I loved? I loved um, I love zaps. They're like the they're like a yellowy sort of uh, lolly, and they they've like got like green and like purple like swells for it. It's like a toffee one. Really nice them. I love them. I haven't had one in, in literally years. Um, I love the uh, bubblegum uh, lollies as well. Proper love like bubblegum ice cream. I haven't been to the ice cream man in ages. He does come down here um, in the new build estate I'm on. 
he just popped down. I just never, never run out. I'm, I'm always like streaming or playing a game or something. I literally never get a chance. This is awful when you have to activate the levers. That is horrible. Horrible fucking. The worst segment of the game for me. Worst part of the game. We're going to get through it tonight, guys. We're going to uh, get this over with. <laughs> I hate it. Horrible segment. Horrible, man. Oh, no more Granadas left. It's fine. Appreciate that, Dano. Thank you. I said, this has been a top stream, mate. Really enjoyed it. Um, and I haven't even moaned about the football. I know. It's, it's annoying, man. Me and Dano are both Liverpool fans, if any of you guys follow football. And, uh, yeah, we lost 1-0 against Bournemouth today. <laughs> So not needed, bro. No need for it, was there? I don't know how we're so inconsistent. I don't, I don't get it. I don't understand the... the inco oh, no. I think... It, oh, I think they've got her. They've got her, I think. Fuck. Shit. No! No! Ah! Oh, open the door. It's fine. Awful segment, this is. We'll get past it. But, um... I don't know how. How have the United fans been, been at us, Dano? I literally, I scrolled on Facebook for like two seconds earlier. And I was like, you guys have the audacity, right? No no, um, no offence to, to you guys, but the people on my face were like, come on. You have the audacity. Hang on. Wait. Can we do that? Brandon said just camp the back room. Go down the stairs. Yeah, she still comes with us. Right, two seconds then. What we'll do. Sort these out. Oh, is Alice a Liverpool fan as well, LJ? That's cool to hear. Yeah, me and Dano are proper all about Liverpool. And yeah, we, we, we always have a moan about the football whenever things don't go our way. That's football. That's football at the end of the day. What do you think about Match of the Day, Dano? No, one, no one's turned up on it, have they? Um... You know, Lineker and everyone stood in solidarity with him. It's a crazy situation. I've, I've not really, like, proper, you know, uh, been all up in reading every bit about it. But I know, obviously, Shearer, Ian Wright, uh, Alex Scott, they, they've all stood in solidarity with him, which is uh, brilliant. So, yeah, thank you for that, Brandon. He said just camp in the back room, go down the stairs. Thank you for that. I'll try this. <laughs> Bloody awful. Let's pop her on here. Wait. Nice. Thank you for that. I, I kind of forgot about that, that we had to activate this. Piss off. I am here, you know. <laughs> right, we'll take out as many as we can. I don't think there's, there's any real point in trying to take out all of them. More of them just respawn in, don't they? I'm sure more of them just respawn in. I'm trying my best. Let's have a look. This is a real, real annoying segment. Yeah, absolutely, Dano. Went from 7 up to Coke Zero. Honestly, my stepdad's a United fan, and um, the funny thing is, I can still wind it up uh, about. I wind him up about it like all the time now, still. Um, he loves KFC and. When I go around mum's like we sometimes have like KFC and stuff and um he, he actually his his go to drink is a seven up, he usually has one. <laughs> so uh yeah, that's that's pretty funny. I'll very much enjoy ordering him a seven up from now on. I'll never let him live it down. Never will. But yeah, it's one of them things, Dano, unfortunately. We're just very inconsistent, aren't we? But you've just got to trust the process, believe in the Reds. Uh, you know what? I, I love Darwin Nunes. I, I love Darwin. I think he's ace. There's all their memes, you know, saying he couldn't he couldn't get up the target, he couldn't get goals. He is good, and so is Cody Gakpo, man. They really shone in that game, and um, I just think today wasn't our day. Obviously, we had a penalty in Salah Skyder. Um, it just wasn't our day. It is what it is. I'm over it. It's fine. Just got to tr keep trying for top four. Just got to keep trying. <laughs> yeah, imagine Dano. Michael Owen presenting it. Honestly, he was my childhood hero until he left and then went to United. My childhood hero. Always aspired to be Owen. 
I had him on like my 10th birthday cake and all that. Absolutely, completely idolised him. I really did. It's all I wanted to be. Little female Michael Owen. It's all I wanted. Yeah. Oh, mate. Honestly, no matter what happens this season, like you just said, we'll always love the fact we beat United 7-0. Always, Dano. And we've got that for every conversation in the stream now. <laughs> Do you remember that day, Dano? <laughs> Do you remember that day in history? Hell yeah. Keep taking out that. There we go. Nice. Oh, of course he had to. I literally thought we was almost there with that. Let's just get rid of this one. Nice. Get rid of this and hopefully we can start that uh, that mechanism. Oh, man, this is a grind. See if I can start thingy. What the hell is this for? I guess the only way to find out who will operate. Oh, yeah, we can do Ashley, can't we? Kind of didn't realise that. That's fine. Right, please no reinforcements, please. <laughs> right, so we need to... Obviously, I'll, I'll get this area done. And then we'll... Um, and then we'll get all the... Any pickups that we've missed and stuff. Yeah, exactly the same, Dano. Um, yeah, he was my hero. And then, obviously, once he left and that, my, mine was Stevie G. I, I literally... Um, literally had that love for Stevie G. Love him to bits. Piss off. Oh, he's already on it. Piss off, bro. Bro. Uh, the, honestly, this part is the most annoying thing ever. It really is. <laughs> Hate it. It's so horrible. It, it better not be this annoying in the remake, I'm telling you. <laughs> I'll be raging. Right, that's fine. If we just get this guy up here. Oh! Right, that's one. And the thing is, I don't think you even get... Um, shit. Shit! I don't think you even... Uh, get like a checkpoint i don't think i think you just oh shit oh no 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 don't do it don't do it don't do it don't do it oh my god oh fuck man i'm totally neglecting my own health for this bitch right we're good we're good let's have that brown chicken egg yeah sorry guys this requires max concentration it really does Oh no. Oh no. Shit. No. Oh, don't do it. Don't. <laughs> I was really hoping to get him just before. Oh no. Oh, I should have just. Oh, I thought I had a headshot lined up. I should have just gone for his fucking legs. Oh, oh guys, the pain, please. I'm gonna have a heart attack. <laughs> the fucking pain. Oh, man, it, I mean, at least we got that first part done, but this is so bad. Let's just get some pickups first. Fucking hell. Oh, I hate her so much. <laughs> Impossible to hate one person so much. You're a prick. <laughs> oh, bro. Right, let's do this again. I've never played this game on professional mode, but this is literally the reason why. I wouldn't mind anything else but this. I think I'd lose my shit. I could probably do it. Watch out for me. We will do professional mode at some point. I would like to. And dare I say, I could attempt it on the, the remake as well. Once we've done like a normal playthrough. When the remake's out, we'll, we'll, we'll smash it. Honestly, we will absolutely um, smash it. Smash the game out. We'll do like a good few playthroughs and that. Do loads on it. We'll do mercenaries. Be so good. Be so good, guys. Re honestly, really exciting times. It really is. Right, that's good. We can try take these 
There we go. That's beautiful. We're, we're looking really good right now. If we can just take them out early, we haven't got them to worry about right now. Right, we've just got to be quick taking these out. That's it. German suplex. And Leon does do the German suplexes in the remake as well. I'm very happy to confirm. Nice. This is a lot smoother. Oh shit! I spoke too soon. Fuck, get him, get him, get him, get him! Ooh. Oh! Shit. Got him. Panicking a little there, because we're so close. She should be all good. Nice. Piss off. Nice. We got it. I'm so glad to get past that. It's my least favourite fucking part. It's so bad. Oh no! Oh, that's fine. It's <laughs> fine. I think. Hang on. Oh, it's alright. I was gonna throw a grenade, but it's fine. We'll just jump across. Mm, yeah. Oh shit. I mean, I think there was a couple of vases we didn't break back there, but it, it is what it is. I ain't messing around in this area. I hate it. <laughs> we'll just carry on. Oh, come on. Oh, Ashley, you're kidding. Why would you Why would you just crouch down on the platform? You literally could just jump across. Holy shit. Fuck. It's literally not that difficult, man. I mean, I would backtrack for the pickups, but it just looks like there's more. There's, yeah, there's more respawning. They ain't even giving us anything from these kills. What's well, up, got Sodium chloride in the chat. What's up, man? Perfect timing, seeing as I was getting rather salty. <laughs> I do, man. I do at this part. I hate it. No, I'm fine now. I'm fine. I think we're treated to the shooting gallery soon, aren't we? Let's get our breakables and stuff. Let's have a look around. Hell yeah. Oh, bless you, Dano. He said, not sure if I'll be watching the streams of the remix. I want to play it myself and I don't think I'm affording the game anytime soon. Well, um, I don't know if you was... I'm not sure if you was in the stream earlier. It was very early on. I mean, I know you was in the stream early on, but... Um, thanks to my mate Will over at Green Man Gaming. Um... He's going to pr be providing me with a few uh, codes of the game. Um, I think, at the minute, I don't think there's any PlayStation ones, but I think it's going to be Xbox and PC. So I'm going to be doing giveaways. So if you want to be entered in that, Dano, it's for the full game of RE4 Remake. And anyone else watching this as well, just keep an eye on my socials and, um, you know, just drop a comment. I'll, I'll do, like, a post, um, you know, obviously, of the giveaway on Facebook, Twitter, in the Discord... Um, I will actually do like a bit of a Discord exclusive um, one as well because I'd like to, um, I'd just like the, the OGs to have a good chance as well, if, if that makes sense, people in the Discord. Uh, and obviously, you're free to join the Discord. Um, I'm, I'm going to do a Discord only uh, giveaway and then the rest will obviously be open to all the other uh, social medias. So, yeah, we'll do that. I'm just going to see if there's anything up these stairs before we uh, consult our merchant. And then we'll, we'll go to the shooting gallery and uh, have some fun with that. Right, I think we've got it. Okay, it's from the other side. Welcome. So, yeah, please get in touch, Dan, if you want to be entered. I, I don't know what console you want in it for. What are you selling? Yeah, it'd be awesome to uh, hook you up with one, man. Is that okay? <laughs> Is that okay? <laughs> Thank you. Need uh, an elegant headdress, don't we, for these? What are you buying? Hell yeah. Is that all? <laughs> is that all? <laughs> is that? <laughs> is that? <laughs> Thank you. 
Is that all? <laughs> is that all? <laughs> what are you buying? We do the nice. We can that all? <laughs> just do the firepower for that. Thank you. Sick. What are you yeah. buying? Come back anytime. Right. See how good we can do. I mean, we're coming up to five and a half hours on stream. So let's see. Let's see, man. Hey, what's up, Leon Reaper? Thank you for being in tonight, man. Um, said uh, Holly is connected, getting deals everywhere. Yeah, luckily I'm I'm partnered up with Green Man Gaming. They they've got like an affiliate partner program. Um, and my mate Will, um, he works there as well. So I got in touch with him and asked how to kind of partner with them. And then obviously you just have to like apply online. I should talk to the guy over there. This is the merchant. Right, let's go for. I'm quite on the on the roll with the sniping right now, she says. So I'd like to have a go with it. We'll do the sniper. Sorry, guys, my hair's just it's just like going everywhere because it's just I'm I've been boiling in this. No, I've I've been really warm in it. It's been nice. I don't think this is the semi-auto. We'll see how we get on. Oh shit! Let's have a look. Oh no, this ain't good. We need to be that. <laughs> nice. Oh, I think we got literally max points except for that last one. We didn't get 100 for the headshot. I just got it a bit too low. This is going to be enough, but I will try. Shit. I'm trying, I'm trying. So much pressure. Nice. Two out of three um, Salazars. Oh, nice. Oh, it's a shame that I just missed the one. Number of prizes, four. So let's see what we got. I think it's the, uh, it's the models, isn't it? See what we've got. Four bottle caps. Let's do rapid fire as well. I can't remember what the maximum is. Let's try try that. What's up, Andy? Got Bow has declassified in the chat. How'd your stream go earlier, man? I did see Andy was streaming the um he did a comparison of the uh OG. Oh my god, it's going everywhere. Ari 4 demo in comparison to the remake. I thought that was really interesting, Andy. I don't even remember. I didn't even play the OG4, um, RE4 remake back in the day. Um, demo, sorry. Hope you're all good, man. We've been uh, doing good tonight. Had such a decent reception tonight. Been doing so well, like, considering it's, like, my channel sort of thing. Like, it's doing so well in viewership tonight. The support's been immense. But, yeah, we're balls deep in the stream, and I'm trying to, trying to concentrate on the... The shooting range. Fuck. That's it. Get him the little shit. Ooh. Not the best. Okay. A little unsteady with that TMP. Can we try again? Let's have another go. So damn good, man. I can't wait to experience the shooting gallery in the remake. I, I am pretty confident in saying I, I think it will be the remake. I don't think they will they would dare miss it. I would... So these bottle caps, Leon, it's for um, like figures, like models of the uh, characters and enemies. Nice. I'm, I'm just so relieved. Um, I just missed the one again. Number of prizes too. Let's have a look. See what we got. I, I don't know if we've uh, maxed out the... Unlocked the bottle cap. Let's have a look. First row. Oh, nice. Yes, I think we got them all, guys. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. So it is. Um, is it like in... Is it not in there? Can't worry, even, is it? <laughs> I think you have to go to the main menu to do it, actually. 
Man, it's been time. It's been time. Keys and treasures. Oh, there we go. Bottle caps. Examine. There we go. Awesome. So I, th I think, I believe we've unlocked all of them, I think, that we can. I think so. It Well, it does say first row collection. I can't remember. We've got Leon with the rocket launcher. Leon with a shotgun. We've got just normal, standard Leon there. <laughs> what a waste of a, a model. I'd rather have the, someone else. I'd rather have... Um, Del Lagos. <laughs> oh, shut the fuck up. I hate doing the sound on that. Love Lewis. Did you send out those invitations? I told you no more than 50 people. <laughs> That's sick. <laughs> thank oh, you. thank you so much. Sodium chloride with AED 100. Apologies, I'm not too sure. Um, is it something dollars? Uh, Apologies, I'm not familiar with that currency, but thank you very much for that super chat. It's really kind of you, man. Uh, he's, he's actually asked, uh, does YouTube take a percentage from this? So they do take a small percent, um, but most of it do, does, does go to, obviously, myself, which I reinvest back into the channel um, to upgrade, like, the setup um, and also to, obviously, invest in, like, new games for us to play. So, yeah, thank you very much um, for that, man. It's really kind of you. Thank you so much for the 100 AED. Thank you, man. I think we're um, maxed out what we can get, I believe. It, do, it does say, actually, is that actually? Yeah, it is. Oh, nice. That, that's nice. Andy said it, it um, is equivalent to about £23. That, that's really kind. Thank you. Uh, Bobby Kendo is out tonight. Let me just have a look. It, it's a bit trippy when I um, stream on PC because... Um, like I've mentioned earlier in the stream, um, the game, it kind of covers my OBS, so I can't see... I can see your guys' super chats in the live chat. I can't see this. So we've got First Strike 7 has subscribed. Thank you so much for subscribing, man. We've had loads of new subscribers um, tonight. I think we've had literally like 20 odd uh, new subscribers. Thank you for that, guys. I honestly appreciate it. It's been an absolute blast, this stream. It really has. Right. I'm I'm sure the chapter ends, so I think we'll we'll just keep going. I think we can get rid of her for a bit actually as well. So guys, we'll stay on for another like half an hour. So we've done a solid six hour stream. Hell yeah. See you later. I'll raise a G fuel to that. <laughs> Too good. Too good. <laughs> Don't worry, Ashley. I'm coming for you. There we go. End of chapter. Yeah, we'll do another half hour, guys, and see see whereabouts we can save. Um, like I said, I'm, I'm most likely going to be jumping on tomorrow night as well. I think we'll continue it. We've got to get a full playthrough in before the remake. Morgan, what happened? The transmission got cut off. <laughs> Salazar, how'd you? Jack be lying. We didn't want you telling everyone any unnecessary information. Where's Ashley? Ah, oh, so she fell into one of our wonderful traps. We'll make sure we find her. Don't you worry about her. Oh yes, I let our miserable insects out for some exercise down in the sewer. Oh man, they're, they're funky those. Keep me company, cause boredom kills me. I look forward to our next encounter in another life. They're funky. I'm missing Hunnigan, man, on, on the walkie-talkie. Missing our booty call. <laughs> that ugly bastard. <laughs> I think we through here next. Just want to make sure. Don't lead us into any other funky area. Is that... Is there a treasure there? Let's have a quick look at that, sir. Um, No, Andy, I'm not working this weekend. I've um, luckily got this weekend off, so... I think, uh, yeah, I'm just going to take advantage, um, yeah, this week and probably stream tomorrow evening as well. I'm back on Monday night on lates. Um, honestly, it, it makes me so gutted when, when I'm working on the weekends. It's, it's just been so nice to stream tonight. At, like, you know, pretty peak, peak night in it for people. Loads of people have been in. So good. 
Right, is it just over there? Let's have a look. See if we can... Oh, we can't get over there just yet, can we? Over from the other side. Yeah, that's fine. Let's continue down that corridor. Hell yeah. I, honestly, guys, I can't tell you how relieved I am to get past that real annoying section of the castle. I hate that when you when you're doing the little wind up thing is for the the little not really a bridge but the platforms to get across that water. Fuck. <laughs> I'm a little bit of rage, but not that much. It's it's been fine. It's been good. It's my least favorite part of the game. Like I said, guys, what? Oh shit. I heard them. They're kind of invisible, aren't they? Invisible and shit. Right. Yeah, what is your least favourite part of the game? Section or feature of the game? Like I said earlier, mine would be, um, obviously, the, the babysitting Ashley. Ashley screaming. I hate that. I just hate it. The worst thing about the game for me. And um, that's the worst section for me. Having to wind them for them freaking platforms, man. But yeah, I'm I'm gonna do it another half an hour and I'm I'm so ready to be real British like we've been saying guys and um watch an episode with bottom, the pot noodle sarni. I won't go to have a sarni, but you know what? It's Danny's fault. Oh shit! <laughs> These are ace as well because you get the little uh, treasures for them. You get the little eyes, don't you? Accumulate all those uh Cheeky eyes. It's ace. Don't mind these enemies. If I don't catch you out, like, you know, you're all good. Right, so we've been down there. Yeah, so sick. This music's sick as well, man. Shit, it's there. Oh, shit. I think we had another on to us. Oh! So glad to be free of Ashley. Oh! Oh, fuck. <laughs> Decapitation. Me? Oh, yeah, these aren't so bad. I don't mind them. Fuck. Oh, man. It's fine. Oh, yeah, I hope you managed to fix that, Andy. Um, like I say, I, I streamed this for the first time about, like, maybe nine or ten months ago. So it's been time. Um, so I, I don't really remember how I did it, but I, I didn't have any problems, luckily. Um, so, yeah, I, I, I don't know. I don't think I'd be able to advise, like, how I did it. But, um, you know, if you want me to, like, have a watch over it, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm sure you're, like, more than capable. But if, if you wanted... Um, if you want me to watch over what you're doing or anything, just just screen share with us sometimes, man. Um, I really hope you get it sorted though, because it, it is worth it. It is a decent uh, HD. And I definitely want you to, you know, be able to have this version of it. It'd be sick. Um, obviously, I know there's reshade and ray tracing available for this, but I just didn't get a chance to set it up. But I know on this video, this tutorial, I think the guy says like install reshade first before the hd and i'm kind of like well i've got the hd installed right now so I, I don't know what to do i can't really you know if, if i had reshade and then the ray tracing will it mess it up and i was i was a bit too scared to try it before this stream i was like i, I don't want to mess up my version of it on here oh shit i just jumped up i didn't think it'd do that oh shit i was able to try and get some shots from up here We'll get him, we'll get him. I mean, the blood spatters are good, but the, this, like, you know, the whole fucking infection splatter, the green shite, it's ace. So good. Yeah, me too, Dano. I've got to say, the island is far from my favourite part of this game. Nice.
Yeah, definitely. My, my favourite part of this game is definitely the village. And then I actually like all the outdoor water parts and stuff. Just ride around the boat, go into the merchant's little cave and everything. And then I actually really like the um, the Del Lagos bar. So I really love that one. Like I said, it's, it's probably actually like my favourite boss. And I really like uh, the little Salazar boss as well when he um, transforms. And then... You, you do the first part of the boss. I think you take out, like, the tentacles and, and stuff like that, and then, like, something that like, opens up in the centre of the boss and it exposes him. I just love getting a, a sick magnum shot or, like, a sniper shot on him. It's, it's so satisfying. Fuck. I totally underestimated these. I was like, yeah, yeah, these are all right. It ain't good when you miss these or they sneak up behind you. But when you when you get some decent shots on them, it's just really satisfying getting a good blast of the riot gun on them. It's really good. Nice. Have a nice collection of eyes as well. Collecting that bling. Oh. It's gonna pounce, it's gonna pounce. You gotta be sharp. Bro, you gotta be sharp. What? Oh, he's gone. Oh. He's there. He's there. I think we got. So good since Ashley getting trapped though. I, I felt like it probably would have been a good checkpoint to, to call the stream, but I felt like I'd, I needed like a. I wanted a little chill. It looks like he was alive till just recently. Judging by the wound, it was a quick death. It, this looks cool if, if you zoom in on it. It does look good, man. These upscaled textures. It is good. They, they've done a sick job on this HD project. They really have. It really does look impressive. It's like he's presenting the herb to us. It's like, <laughs> I'm dead, but there, there is a herb there for you. Thank you, bro. RIP. Let's have a look what we got. Might have a little cheeky green. Yeah, just to keep us going. I hate it when, you know, it's... Uh, the health bar is flashing in the corner. Leon's limping. I, it makes me feel all guilty. I don't like it. I don't like it, alright? Lewis's memo. There are some parasites that have the ability to control their host. It's basic knowledge among biologists, but not much is known as to how the parasites do it. Studying these parasites specifically might reveal some clues as to how the powers of the Last Plagas work and perhaps provide more insight on the victims of the Last Plagas, the Los Ganados. Here is a list of some parasites that have the ability to manipulate the behavioural patterns of their host. So, I can't remember which, one, which ones are which, to be honest. <laughs> Decrochelium. Once the larvae of this parasite migrates to the ant's esophagus, it alters the behaviour of the ant. When the temperature drops in the evening, the infected ant climbs to the top of a plant, climbs onto a leaf using its mandible, stays there immobile until the next morning, uh, placing the ant where it's most vulnerable to be eaten by a browsing herbivore such as sheep. One could conclude that the parasite is manipulating the host behaviour to make its way into the body of its definitive host, Galactosumum. The <laughs> I sound like a fucking possessed reading these out. I'm trying, guys, I'm trying. The larvae of this parasite makes its home inside the brain of a fish, such as the yellowtail and the parrot bass. Once infected, the fish make their way up the water surface where they'll swim until eaten by seabirds. Once again, this peculiar behaviour can only be explained by the parasite's desire to get into the bodies of the seabirds, Leucochloridium. These parasite sp sporocysts develop in the snail's tentacles. The sporocysts are vivid in colour and pulsate continually, somewhat like a worm. Surprisingly, the infected snail makes its way to the top of a plant where it's more visible to the eyes of birds, therefore more likely to be eaten. Once eaten by a bird, the parasite will complete its metamorphosis into an adult. It's interesting, man. I like reading these out because you get to kind of hear the backstory about how the you know some of these creatures are actually formed. You know. <laughs> Sorry, sodium chloride. Sorry, I'll sort the inventory in a second. It has been a while since I've um, sorted that out. Yeah, he said, ah, my OCD is kicking when you open the inventory. <laughs> I know, I know, man. 
I'm gonna sort it, alright? I'm gonna sort it. I'm gonna have to pop this. Um I would like to switch these around because I usually do. I'm gonna move actually, no, I'll leave them there because I'm gonna sell the, the TMP ammo when we can. I'm gonna I'll place that under there. We should be due at uh, the next uh, attache case next, I'm sure. How's that for your sodium chloride? Balling. No, I haven't, uh, Andy. Yeah, there is a mod for this. I never even knew about it until uh, Residents of Evil streamed this. I think it was uh, last night, I think it was. Um, yeah, it's called a World S mod. And um, right, it's got to be a way to drain the water. I'll have to look for that. Um, yeah, I've never even heard of that. So I think... It's like still like the full campaign in it, but things are changed up, is it, in like the story? That's so cool. Um, yeah, I never knew about that, so um, I'll have to have a look at installing that. Hopefully I can do it without balls in this sort of, like, I, I just don't want to balls up the actual, uh, you know, kind of this game, the, the main game. Did we, did we come from here? I think we have been down here. But yeah, I'll let you watch like the first... I managed like the first 15, 20 minutes of uh, JJ and Corey playing it on Residents of Evil. Um, and then I, I just didn't have time to like continue watching, but I'm, I'm going to have a bit of a chill tomorrow. So um, I'll catch up on that. Really intrigued by that. It looks good. Um, I love how he's, he's got like a red collar in that, hasn't he? On it. It's like a black coat and a red collar, I think. It looks sick. Yeah, have you played it, Andy? Yeah, I think... Um, I don't know if I'd get a chance to stream it before the remake's out. It might be maybe... I might have to do it after the remake. I'm not sure. I'm, I'm trying to calculate how many streams I've got left until the remake. That's why I've started this now, because it's going to take me a couple more streams. Last time I, I uh, played this, it, it took me like three streams to go all the way through it. So, Oh, shit. The back, the back. The riot gun, it, it's so... Oh, shit. <laughs> it's so satisfying, the blast from the riot gun. It makes an awesome sound. So. Nice. Beautiful. Oh, man. Yeah, the, if, if any of you guys played the... Uh, that, like... Is it... What is it? Mad Chainsaw or something? Yeah, I... Obviously, when I streamed the RE4 Remake demo, I, I streamed twice. I played it twice on the stream. I didn't get offered to play that that extra difficult mode. And someone asked earlier if I played it. I was like, you know, I, I don't even think I want to be offered it. I nearly was going to use a grenade, but it's right for the minute. Where is he? There was more than one I'd use a grenade, but we'll, we'll take this one out. Hopefully, it'll be the last one. Nice. Yeah, I kind of don't think I want to be offered it. <laughs> I'm too scared. I'm too scared to even attempt that. But, um, yeah, I, I want to watch some gameplay of it, though, for sure. Yeah, Andy or anyone else, have, have you tried that, that difficult mode of the chainsaw demo? The extreme difficulty mode or something. Oh shit. Don't. I hate when they jump up, get the height advantage. Let's get him, let's get him. Boom. And again. Right in the bollocks. <laughs> let's go. Right, we good. See, if that, if that was me in this game, I, I could fit in there. I'd just hide in there all game. Been a while, man. I can't watch coming up now. Oh, okay. Oh, did you actually, Andy? I got it on my first playthrough and died before the village. Man, it must be difficult. Fucking honestly. I don't even think I'd dare attempt it. I, I might do it at some point. Like, when I've, like, no life the main game, I, I might be a bit cocky and fancy uh, playing through it, but at the minute, not for me. <laughs> I 
feel like um, I've done my stream on the demo. I may go back to it maybe once more and get the TMP because obviously people have discovered that now. Uh, I never discovered that on my playthroughs. Um, but I feel like I want to stay clear of the demo now because I'm, I'm itching for the full game and the more I play the demo, the more, in a positive way, the more irritable I'm getting, like positively irritable, if that makes sense. I'm just itching for the main game and I, I can't contain my excitement. Like I need to distract myself with maybe the OG and other games and so I need to distract myself for the time being. Moldy STD! Moldy STD! Moldy STD! <laughs> you can take your moldy STD, shove of your ass! <laughs> Ooh, can we... It's gonna take him out with a rifle. Can we, can we throw a little cheeky grenade down there? Beautiful. Oh! <laughs> that is sick! Look at that for a ritual! <laughs> what up, Bandito? Oh, is that what it is? Moira SVV. Moira SVV. I sound like I'm, I'm possessed when I'm trying to read these out. I've been saying Moldy STD. <laughs> I got, that's what I said, that, that's why you can't get through to the GP at 8 in the morning in the UK because all, all these fuckers are on the line as well <laughs> trying to sort out the mouldy STD Bro You can leave our merch now. I'm, You know what, I'm so glad I didn't realise how risky that was, I'm so glad um, that actually hit him and it, he didn't dodge it and it hit our merchant guy. I'd actually cry if, if I decapitated him. Um, Sodium said, I just realised you're wearing the jacket for six hours. You know what? I actually plan to take the jacket off when Leon loses his jacket. But I feel like, even though I've been I've been really warm in it, but it's fine, it's fine. Like, But I feel like if, if I took it off, like I'd, I'd just feel too cold. I'd feel freezing. I've just got used to the layer. So, um, yeah. I'm gonna stick it. I'm gonna stick with it. <laughs> it's getting returned though after the stream because it's shite. Like I said, looks like um, it looks like Kel from Keenan and Kel's threw orange soda all over it. It's fucking orange as hell. <laughs> He's so orange in person. Loads of people have come on and said nice jacket, and I, I appreciate your comments. You're too kind to me, but I look shit. I look a twat. <laughs> I look awful. That's what I've been wanting. Elegant mask, hell yeah. LJ said, I'm off. Sorry I couldn't stay uh, for longer. Uh, have a fantastic rest of your weekend and peeps. Take care. Amazing stream. Thank you, LJ, for your continued support. Uh, both you and Alice, thank you for being here tonight. Uh, take care, man. Catch you very soon in another stream. Massively appreciate you guys turning up tonight. Can we... Right, we can put those in the... Uh... Put that in the butterfly lamp. Combine. Need another one, obviously. I, th I think. Is there another one? Yeah, we need one more eye for it. Um, and then these can go in the elegant headdress. I've been wanting one of these for ages. There we go. Beautiful. I know, Dano. Nice of the merchant to help you with that guy. Just, just stood there, just chill as ever. I'm, I'm so, mate. Honestly, I, I'd have started crying. I think I'd have started crying if, if I'd have. Uh, I, I didn't realize how risky that was. <laughs> with that shot. I'd have actually cried if I took his head off. Right, I think we've been through there, haven't we? Just check um, we've got everything. Yeah, I've been through there, been through there. That's fine. We'll go to our merchant guy now. Hopefully we'll be able to tune up some more things, uh, I reckon. Oh, no! <laughs> I thought we could jump across the chandelier. My bad. The doors, un the gate's unlocked anyway now. Oh, nice. Illuminados pendant. How's that for your merchant? You can have that, mate. Welcome. Welcome. His eyes are blue now. Got some rare things on set. What are you selling? I got really concerned. Wait, because at one point his eyes were glowing red. So I think he's infected, but I think he's, I think he's got a hidden cure. and He's cured himself. Last time we saw him, he was Eiffel 65 as well, wasn't he? Um, blue, da 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 da. He was. He pissed around. We'll keep one of each just in case. 
on the off chance we get another land. We'll, we'll leave that. Obviously, you need one more um, gem for the mass. need one more eye for the lamp. Illuminatus pendant, 12 grand. A pendant designed with a lost Illuminatus motive. Well, I'll give it to you, mate, because I don't think I'll get as much in cash converters. You can have it. You you rock that. What are you buying? Don't think there's anything else. I don't usually um don't usually get the bro Do I? What magnum do I get? I don't think I get the broken butterfly. Do I? Is there another magnum? I can't oh I can't even bloody remember. I can't remember what magnum I get, it's been that long. It does literally like two in the whole game. He never has them in stock. What are you Bro. buying? I'm not really fussed about doing the reload and the capacity. We'll, we'll keep that. It's fine. Come back Beautiful. Fucking smashed it tonight, guys. Um, I really don't want to end the stream, but I want to have to shortly. So, um, the next save point... I'm gonna have to end the stream, okay? We're, we're six hours. Um, really don't wanna have to, but we're past two a.m. I need to eat because Gal gets hungry, okay? Um, but no, I shit myself. Then I thought I was a tight rat. I was like, oh no, I can't do it just yet. The, guys, the stream has been too good. It's been too good tonight. At least you don't wanna end it. <laughs> Castellan memo. For many years, the Salazar family has served at the Castellans of this castle. However, not everything is bright, for my ancestry has a dark past. Long ago, there was a religious group that had deep roots in this region called the Los Illuminados. Unjustly, however, the first Castellan of the castle took away their rights and powers. As a follower of this re religion and the eighth Castellan, I felt that it was my duty as well as my responsibility to atone for that sin. I knew the best way to atone for the sin was to give power back to those who we once took it away from, the Los Illuminados. As I expected, it took a little time, but we were able to rejuvenate the once sealed Las Plagas. With this success, I was one step closer to the revival of the Los Illuminados. The reason why I released the Las Plagas from deep under this castle and gave them to Lord Sadler was only to repay for the sins of my ancestors, but I felt certain that the Lord would make better use of this power to help save the world, to save those that have sinned with the power of the Las, Las Plagas and to cleanse their souls, creating a world without sinners, the way it was meant to be. Once cleansed, they will become one of the many Granados where they will find their reason to live. And after the Lord has succeeded in creating the world in which he has envisioned, then the sins of my Salazar family will be atoned for. There's your bedtime story, guys, at past 2am here in the UK. Well, thank you to all you guys all over the world. We've had a lot of people in tonight uh, from everywhere, all the time. Appreciate you. Oh, do you actually, uh, Dano? You said you get the you can get the broken butterfly for free later in the castle, then the killer seven on the iron. Thank you for that. I'm a little rusty at remembering that. Oh yes, that. Oh shit! Oh bollocks! Hang on. Oh, hang on. Nice, it's gotta be quick. Oh shit! <laughs> Fuck. Bro, with them eye holes, if, if that cloak. I love trolling them, letting the door close. Um, with that cloak, if that was if that was white, it reminds me of that guy. Um, what's his bloody name? Him on Halloween, the. Um, Halloween 1978, the absolute OG. You know, when he comes back to see his missus. Because doesn't he go get a drink or a snack or something? She's in the bedroom. And then he comes back and he has that sheet on him. So. Why are you being so creepy? Why are you being so quiet and all that? That's what they remind me of with the, the eye holes in there. Boom. Oh, we need to get this, rid of this guy. Moldy ST freaking D. Let's go. <laughs> oh, they've all gone. They're pissed off. Get him, get him, get him. Right in the bollocks. Oh! Guys, you all possessed the sodium going Iniesta. And then we got Faisal going Madonna. I'm sorry, I think I possessed you guys. Sorry. <laughs> you guys are, are possessed by the stream. <laughs> right, let's uh, let's take take care of these. Let's go. I I get a little too carried away with with the sniper. I I love a cheeky snipe. I really do. Let's 
get him. But yeah, I think there'll probably be like a save point after this little area. So that that's cool. You know, we can do a little bit more. And then we shall make a save. We've, we've done awesome progress tonight, though. It's been real good. So good, man. It really is, Dano. Honestly, like, that is hands down uh, my favourite horror movie. Favourite scary Halloween horror movie. Halloween 1978. Absolutely. It, it just never gets old, and it? it's just so... I think the... You know, like, the, the score, the soundtrack, you know, like, when they're discussing Michael Myers, you know, like, say, the detective, um, Detective uh, Loomis, and it? Um, you know, when they're talking about him, and then you hear the piano, it goes, do, 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 like, that ain't a good impression, but that's, that's kind of how the, the keys of the piano go. It, it's so good. It's just, it's so simple, but so effective, and, like, like, the Halloween theme song, it's like a few second loop, but it, it, you never get sick of it, don't you? It's, oh, it's so good. It really is, man. I think it's a bit criminal what they did in uh, Halloween Ends. It, it really is like, if that would have been a, a Halloween spin-off movie, I could have accepted that, but not as Halloween Ends. I, I was really disappointed with that. I thought it was a good movie, but it suplex. But it should have been a spin-off. I think it should have been a spin-off, that. Fucking did a German suplex and you didn't even get a... a consumable for that. Cray-cray. Beautiful. The game knows. The game knows what I'm thinking. There we go. you got to go for the bollocks with these, because uh, they're wearing their masks. Boom. Oh, <laughs> triggered. I, try, I did try to get a booty shot, but no, I can't. Mm. Can't no, I can't quite get the angle. That's fine. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna definitely gonna watch some bottom, and I want to rewatch uh, Violent Night as well. If if you guys have seen that, it came out the cinema. Um, I think it was like just before Christmas, um, and yeah, I've waited all this time, man, for it to release. It's been so good. Um, I loved it at the cinema, and um, I ordered it on on the Sky Store um, to kind of have it digitally and uh, to have the Blu-ray upon release date. And the Blu-ray came today, so that was really good. Um, if I can lure him over here and then get that barrel, that's what I was gonna do. I need to get a guy over there. Oh, you! Kind of got damaged, but in the process, but that's fine. Right. Before we go in there, let's take out this guy. But yeah, it's really good. It's got David Harbour in. He, pl he plays the Santa. He's like a, a grumpy-ass Santa, drinking at the beginning and everything. But he's so good. So he goes out, obviously, like, delivering presents on the in the evening. And then he comes upon a house. And uh, there's a massive, like, robbery and heist there. And killings and everything. And then he has to kind of save the night, basically. It's, it's brilliant, it's so good. Yeah, I had to get that on DVD. And I, I, yeah, I was dying to watch it again. It's really good. It's just a real fun movie. Oh, sick, Dana. Where, where did you get that from? Where's that guy gone? Oh, he's there. Bollocks. <laughs> oh, dear. I, I actually, I really forgot about that. If I take one more hit, and then I'll use the brown chicken egg. Um, let's have a look. Um, oh shit. Where was he? Oh, shit. I don't know what the best angle is to get this guy. Um, yeah, Dana said, just bought a t-shirt with the pumpkin and knife poster on the other day. It's awesome. That's sick. Where, yeah, where did you get it from, man? No, oh, it's healed us a little. I'll have that in a green. There we go. Get the uh, get the turret guy. I can't believe it's nearly half two in the morning. Thank you guys. Uh, two are still here. I appreciate you. Beautiful, beautiful angle. Awesome. Go, go grab that key.
You know, I'm buzzing for a pot noodle sane and bottom. Really am. <laughs> Look at the, the mess you've made. Look at the mess. Look at all them bullet holes. Nice elegant castle. In the HD project as well. The freaking mess you made. Right, I think we have to go like the long way, don't we? Just to quit that. No, we have smashed it tonight. Made some decent progress. And, um, yeah, it's, it's, it's been so good. It really has. Like, I, honestly, I, I, I knew you guys would be up for it, though. Like, I knew loads of people would be up for it right now. You, you know, we obviously playing OGRE4 in anticipation of the remake. I, I knew you guys would be up for it. I thought, hell yeah. Oh, that's cool, Dan, though. An eBay store that sells official band and film TV merchandise. Sick. I'll probably have a bit more of an overhaul of my um, horror tea collection um, at some point. Yeah, I need some more horror teas, I think. Oh. I can't remember. Um, sacrifice of six lives. Oh, she'll make way the true path. So you need... Uh, Six people, in it, Yeah. I have no idea. Let's have a look. Seven. Let's try that. And that's seven. That's too many. Try that one. There may be... That's way too many. Hmm. Jeez. Seven. I think that's the closest we've got in it. Ooh. <laughs> we've got to be almost there. It's got to be maybe. Let's try that. No. Try that one. Definitely not that. It's just way too many. Almost there with it. Right. We need to... Let's have a look. It, it definitely is uh, sodium. It, it is the least annoying puzzle, for sure. That's it. It's almost there with it. Mm. It can't be that one. We'll do... Damn it. I know. Thank you, Dad. I appreciate it. You said it's the longest I've managed to stay in ages. Love this stream. So chill with some hilarious classic chat. Yeah, it has been pretty chill, hasn't it? I know, obviously, it's been pretty tense at times, the stream, but it's still been good. Nice, we got it. That's six. Yeah, as, ten as intense as these games can get, I'm still chilled when I play them. I'm still proper, like, the adrenaline's pumping, but I'm still kind of chill with you guys. It's such a I'm chill with my mates and play the game. But I'm afraid it's Ashley we need. Not you, Mr. Kennedy. Mr. Kennedy. Get off my back, old man. <gasps> Did you say old man, Mr. Kennedy? <laughs> Might come as a you're a little old dude but I'm only 20 years old <laughs> so you're just like all the others a puppet of the parasite surely you don't think I'm the same as those diminutive ganados the parasites las plagas are slaves to my will I have absolute control well I really don't give a damn rain or shine you're going down uh oh. <laughs> Get rid of our American Mr. Kennedy. Can you imagine it with me? Miss Holster TV. <laughs> You're going down. <gasps> what is yes, that? Mm. I'm feeling, uh, I'm feeling some incendiary, I think. Matalo. We've. Been all this time without contracting a mouldy STD in the castle. I'm so proud of us, man. GG, guys. Nice. Shitloads of Pasidas. Been doing awesome. Uh oh. Oh, is that guy? Bro. Oh, we, we could have done with. Oh! Fuck. I didn't like Uncle Festus then. Oh! Where, oh! Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. 
fuck. Where are they? Where are they? Shit, I don't know where they are. Fuck, I don't know where the, the guys are. Where's the... Fuck. I don't know where those, uh... Rocket... Rockets came from, I'm not sure. They got us over there. Can't see them around here. We'll get them. Oh, no, no, it's opening again. Right. Um, shit, where are they? Where are they? Where are they? Oh, fuck. <laughs> Made me jump. Shit. Oh, they're there again. You fuckers. Oh, I need him over here so I can... Right. Oh, I just missed him. No. Bro. Oh. Oh, shit. Shit. Oh, guys, this is a horrible part. What is going on? Yeah, I agree, El Rambo. Neon's come back to Epic can never get over the cheese. He is real good. Oh, man, this is bad. This is bad. Beat you. They're there. They're there. No, they're not. Oh, shit. Oh. Do you see his jaw? His jaw went like vertical because he was, uh. Because he, uh, transformed. He mutated. That's cray cray. Oh, fuck. Can we get the lamp? Get it, get it. Oh, they're in. I trust there not to be a lamp there. Take the piss. Have a suplex. You fucker. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, this is so bad. What has happened to our health? It's fine. We'll, we'll just have to sort it, like, you know, won't we? In next room, off to sort it. Where's them guys? Where them guys are? I'm not messing around. I told you I'm not messing around. Where's the guys? Oh, cause they, they kept appearing from there. I, was, I wanted to. Damn it! Thank you, Derek. I said nice shot, mate. Thank you. I try, man. I'm, I'm trying to be on it. <laughs> it's, it's not been that easy, actually. We need to get up there to get that, um, let's have a look. There's a treasure on there. Little room there, what's, what we got here? Nice. Let's make sure we've looted everything. How do you even... Oh, do you have to, like, jump across? Nice. Oh, no! I said jump down. Oh, is it this way? It's a little confusing. It's all the layout. I can't angle suplex. Oh, he's it's, it's not jumping across. There's got to be a way to, um... Can you press that again? Oh, I have deactivated it. Let's have a look about it. There must be... I think there's a room we haven't been in. Um, let's have a look. I thought that was something. Nice. <laughs> we all need a spinel, don't we? Never have too many spinels. Let's have a look. We've been in here. Oh, we'll get it in a second. Just trying to work it out. Just bear with me. <laughs> There's nothing there. Nothing in here. What am I missing? I don't know exactly what I'm missing. I don't know why we can't jump across. Can't operate then. Hmm. It's only saying jump down. Might not have been in there. That green hair being there. Uh, let's do a little cheeky combine. Make me feel a little bit better that we've got a, a combined herb. <laughs> Man, it's cray cray. Oh, there we go. Nice. 
head over. Oh no! No more! No! Fuck! Bro! Oh, this in the time! Bro! There we go. <laughs> Is that it? Easy as that. Easy as that, guys. Beautiful. I ain't messing around. <laughs> it's freaking half 2am. We ain't messing around. Oh, Sodium, don't remind me. <laughs> He's typing in the chat. Leon! Help! Bro, don't. Oh, it's an ornament of me. <laughs> Go ornament. Nah, I wish. <laughs> We've got an ornament of ourselves, guys. Hell yeah. There we go, guys. So here is... I was just checking there's no barrel ending. Here is our save point. So we will call the stream here tonight. It is half two a.m. We have been streaming for almost six and a half hours. It's absolutely flown by, though. I can't really... Honestly, what a stream. What a freaking stream, guys. Let me take us back to our chill and chat section. Let me just quit us out the game a second and we'll go to our chilling and chatting. Hell yeah, guys. This is the Merchant Serenity theme. But yeah, just wanna um, say thank you. Honestly, huge, huge, huge thank you, guys. This is probably one of my most successful streams, I think. Like, we, we've had so many, uh, like, concurrent, view concurrent viewers uh, throughout, like, Man, we, we have had, like, some numbers in tonight. Like, you know, to, to others it's not like that much, but to me, like, to our channel, it's we've had shitloads in tonight, basically. Like I said earlier, I, f I feel like I've literally been speaking to everyone who's subscribed to me. Like, literally nearly everyone has been in tonight. So just want to thank all you guys for showing up, showing the love and support. Thank you so much. Um, I appreciate you, Dano. He said, you're our goat holster. <laughs> Mate, thank you. I've got to be someone's goat. <laughs> I appreciate you guys for putting up with my bullshit. Um, Derek said, amazing stream, and thank you as well. Mate, not a problem. Mate, it's an absolute pleasure uh, to spend my Saturday evening with you guys. It really is. It's absolutely awesome. Uh, but yeah, I will most likely be able to jump on tomorrow for another stream. I will keep you guys posted on the socials. If not, it will be um, on Saturday. Um, it'll be literally, yeah, a week today. Um, I think it's, yeah, it will be Saturday. Um, but yeah, I'm going to try to jump on tomorrow because I want to really make the most of my time off work because I am back on late from Monday um, all week. So um, that takes poor my evening. So my evening's free. Like, I'd, I'd just love to be able to jump on stream with you guys. Uh, he said, excellent stream, mate. Top draw. Let's continue it tomorrow. You'll never walk alone. Good night. Hell yeah, man. You ensure sure I never walk alone on the tubes, man. Um, but yeah, thank you. Uh, really glad you've enjoyed it and uh, yeah like i say i will most likely be on tomorrow anyway uh we'll keep you updated on the socials it'll probably be around the same time it might even be anywhere 6 7 8 p.m um i will see how the day goes i basically gotta get all my, all my shit done and then i will be with you guys to chill in the evening and thank you sodium chloride for your uh, generous super chat as well uh, earlier on he said he was just passing through well it's been great to have you here man and uh thanks for kicking my ass about the um the OCD with the inventory because <laughs> sometimes it just goes on quite a bit and I forget to um, sort it out I usually have OCD with the inventory but um, yeah it was a little while and uh, thanks for prompting me to sort that out <laughs> you guys have got my back uh, Halfway Gamer Dude as well said thanks to Stream Holster honestly thank you guys for being here there's loads of you guys who've literally been here throughout the whole stream I absolutely appreciate it it's been over six hours with you guys six and a half hours thank you so much so yeah do you want to wrap this up guys um like, like I said, in the description, there's links to all my socials. Feel free to follow me on my socials um, and also our Discord server. Feel free to join that. It's a chill, safe space for everyone to just chat, game in life, anything. It's just a, a real chill uh, social thing we got. It's called Host TV's Mates because you guys are all my mates. Uh, if you've enjoyed the stream, if you don't mind dropping us a cheeky like, it helps it in the YouTube algorithm. Let's get the hype there for RE4 Remake. This has been a RE4 Remake hype stream. Uh, we will be doing a full playthrough of this, obviously. This has been part one. I'll be back tomorrow evening with part two. Take care, guys, all the way from the Merchant Save Room. <laughs> Take care, and thank you so much again uh, for your continued support. Take care, guys. See you tomorrow night in the next stream. Holster TV out. <laughs>